Franklin and Chop are the best characters in GTA 5, which is why I made a movie just about them. Except they didn't know it at the time, because when I begin, Chop literally goes homeless. He's cold, hungry, and needs somewhere to sleep. And soon enough, he's in trouble. That's when the real adventure kicks in, because he does whatever it takes to survive. Will Franklin take him back? Find out yourself, because this story has only just begun. There's sandstorms, zombies, and massive police chases. And at one point, we even blow up the entire dam. I won't spoil much else, but these two are full of surprises. So grab your popcorn and a soda and enjoy the movie. No, Franklin, don't do this to me. He's kicked me out of his house. I never thought this would happen to us, Chop. The day has finally come where Franklin doesn't want to hang with us anymore. It was an accident anyway. All I did was set his house on fire, but I'm not gonna listen to him. I'm still sneaking back inside. Franklin can't get rid of me that easily, and I still got a belly to fill. <laughs> what? I know you're kidding. You're the- Oh, my days. Hey, whoa. Franklin, you would shoot me? Your dog? No, I don't want to believe you. I'm going inside, and I'm getting my- <gasps> Oh my days, he actually will. He just fired a warning shot. The next one will be in my leg, are you serious? All right, I don't wanna risk it. I actually think Franklin would shoot me. All right, fine. I don't need food from you anymore, Franklin. I will be fine by myself. Ain't that right, boy? We know how to survive in this world and I can actually smell food already. Yeah, yeah, I don't need you, Franklin. Screw you. I'll be just fine by myself. <laughs> I found the scent of what smells like steak. It could be pork, but I think it's steak. And I think it's coming from in here. Let's take a look. <laughs> Yep, it's definitely in this house. <laughs> These guys are about to have all their food taken from them. You know what? This is probably going to be better than living with Franklin. Being homeless as a dog probably isn't even that bad. Especially when oh, I was right. We're able to pinch food from anyone who's got it around us. Now let's sneak up behind them. They still don't see me. And oh my days, look at all the food on the barbecue. There's so many steaks that and my tummy is grumbling. Ooh, exactly what I need. Thanks, buddy. This is delicious. Oh, boy. He's not happy with that. We better get out of here. See ya. <laughs> Thanks for the steak. You're the best. Uh-oh. This is a dead end. Um, can we jump over this? No, we can't. All right. We gotta go back around this way then. Oh, hey. Let's put that knife down, buddy. <laughs> we don't want to use that on anyone. Quick, get him, boy. Get him. <laughs> That's what you get for trying to take me out. I'll be taking the rest of your steaks. Oh, no, now this guy's coming after me. Leave me alone. I've had a really bad day. I'm homeless. Uh-oh. Wait, are those sirens? Oh, we better get out of here, boy. I think someone called the police. Oh, man, that was crazy. And I've just managed to make it out in time. <laughs> well, I got a little bit of food. I have done a little bit of damage. But what can I say? I mean, those guys had a knife. I wasn't going to let them use it. All I wanted was a little bit of food. Stop! Run down! Uh-oh. Have the police found me? Uh, yes. Oh, no. There's too many of them. What the steak? Down. What? Come on, this is my only piece of food. Oh, fine. I'll put the steak... Ah, oh, that was lovely. He swallowed it. Take him in. No, no, you'll never take me in. Run! Run, Chop! Get out of here! Hey, what's that? Did they just do what I think they did? They put a tranquilizer into my neck. Uh, 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 oh, everything's so dreamy. Uh, oh, no. What? Am I in a pet store? No, you've got to let me out of here. I don't belong in here. Oh, come on, come on, come on. I'm in a cage. What kind of person did this? Let me out of here, dude. This is not fair. Come on, Franklin. You kicked me out, and now this has happened. He's officially the worst owner ever. Guys, if you want to give Chop some support, smash like on the video, and you can do even better. You can get me out of this cage if you subscribe to my channel. Please do it. I gotta get out of here. Come on. I'm looking for a dog. Who's that guy? Did he just say he wants to find a dog? Please don't buy me, guys. Subscribe now, please. I gotta get out of here. That guy seems a little bit dangerous. I want an evil dog. 
Someone who's not scared. No, that's definitely not me. Please, you don't want Chop. He's the cutest dog in the world. Oh, oh, you're over here. I want you. No, you really, really don't. Please, please go for the golden retriever or the poodle. The poodle's pretty evil. How much? Uh, 50 bucks. I'm worth more than that. Deal. <laughs> oh, man, this is really bad. What is this place? Guard my park. Don't let people in. Okay, that isn't too bad. We're just a guard dog for this guy. And I gotta keep an eye out for anyone who comes close to the base. What if it's the postman, dude? Bite their leg off. Whoa, really? You want me to bite their leg off? Who is this guy? I'll see you later. Bye. Hey, wait, do I get some food? Huh? What? Hey, give me some food. I'm starving. I only had a steak today. Jeez, that guy is not really nice to me. I don't really know if he's gonna look after me or not. But what is this? Is that meant to be a generator or something? Oh, no, there's a gas tank. All right, don't do what we did with Franklin's and blow the house up. All right, I'm a guard dog. I'm a guard dog. I'm a guard dog. Is that a mountain lion I can see up there? Yeah, I'm pretty sure there's a mountain lion. Gotta make sure that thing doesn't pass through these gates. Give me your leg now. I'll get you over the wall. Hey, do you hear that? I think someone's trying to get over the wall. One minute. Is this going to be my first task as a guard dog? Oh, no. A dog's found us. Oh, he's super cute. No. <laughs> Hey, come on, help me! But he's cute! Yeah, that's right, I am cute, man. <laughs> Why didn't they try and get the dog? Jeez! Well, Chop, we're a pretty good guard dog. I don't even know what these guys were doing. Were they trying to get in or something? I'm pretty sure I heard them say, let's get over this wall or whatever. <laughs> man, yeah, they really struggle with that. Oh, hey, it's my owner. I made the right choice with you. Let me show you something. Ooh, what's this guy got to show me? All right, let's take a look. <laughs> Looks like he might actually be a nice Nice guy after all. Hey, they should have just gone through that wall. It's already been knocked down. <laughs> Those guys are such idiots. Welcome to your new home. Whoa, I got a kennel. Wow, this is great. Looks like we're no longer homeless. Hey, what does that name say? Shonky? My name isn't Shonky, it's Chop. That's right. You're called Shonky now. Uh, get some rest. We got a job tomorrow. Well, it looks like my name is Shonky after all, and he told me to get some rest, but... Oh, this food. Yes, we got food. <laughs> Amazing. Got to admit, it's a little bit smaller than my old kennel, but at least it still works. It's keeping me warm. I got food next to my nose and someone who actually cares about me. Chop, we've done pretty good. <laughs> but get some rest. I don't know what he wants me to do tomorrow. Shonky, wake up. Yes, sir, I'm awake. Let's go. Come here. I need you to smell this shoe. Okay, I'll smell the shoe. Wait, wait, what, what the... What's the deal here, guys? What's gonna happen if I smell this shoe? Just do it. Okay. Oh, man, that's gross. Someone's worn this for at least 10 years. Uh, new location on map. Hold up, did that work? Shop, can you actually find people based on their smell? Whoa, whoa, we can. That's where they are. Oh my days, that's amazing. Bite them. Take them down. Yeah, sure thing. I wonder what this person's done. <laughs> now I know where they are. This is gonna be super duper easy. I just gotta go upstairs, go into the room, and take them down. This is early in the morning, too, so they'll probably be slow. Oh my days. What? I just came across a rat and a boar. Oh, another rat as well. This place is not very clean. They gotta be sleeping right now anyway. So, no, Chop, get up the stairs. Up the stairs. <laughs> I think these rats are confusing him. We are not eating the rats, boy. We're going upstairs. Alright, we go. Up the staircase now. Yes. <laughs> so, I reckon they'll be sleeping, which means this is a perfect opportunity to go in and bite them. Even the yellow circle tells me to bite. <laughs> Alright, where are they? Hmm. Hello, is there anybody in? Careful now, boy. Last thing we want is to get hurt in all of this. I don't see anyone in that room. What about the other room? You've got to be in here. There's no way my nose lies to me. Not in this corner. What about over... Oh, my days. Hey, hey, let's put that down. No, don't, don't do it. Don't do it. Oh, my days. He's reloading. Okay, well, we're going to get him. We're going to get him. Ah! Ah! Oh, no. Chop. Please tell me you're okay. Please tell me you're okay. <laughs> Come on. Oh, I'm alive. Yes. No, stay with me. Stay with me, boy. Oh, no, no, no. This isn't good. He's only just alive. Hey, where's my owner? Where are you, man? Come on, save me. Wait, is that them? 
I can hear them. They're starting up their engine. No, don't leave. Don't leave. I don't like the dog anyway. See you later. We gotta go. No, they drove off without me. Oh, boy. Okay, we gotta get up, boy. I gotta get you help. Or else we are not gonna make it 10 more minutes. Yes, he's on his feet, but only just. He's walking. He's not quite talking yet. There's gotta be someone around here who can save me. There's gotta be. Oh, no. No, keep walking. Keep walking. This is so stressful. We're literally dying out right now. How do I get out of here? Yeah, there's some stairs. There's... All right, take the stairs down. Are those sirens? I'm pretty sure there's sirens. Whoever it is, please come over to me. We gotta get to the road. And that's the only thing we gotta do. Just get to the road. Come on. Someone's gotta save me. No, shop, don't stop walking. Come on, keep walking. Ugh. Oh, yes, an ambulance, please. Save me. Save me, dude. Oh, yes, for a second. Oh, jeez, he crashed into a tree. Okay, I think we're gonna be fine. Oh, I can't do this anymore. Where did you come from? I'm gonna get you patched up. <sighs> hey, I'm, I'm still... What? All I can see is a wall. All right, uh, you're back with your own. No, please, not that guy. No! You can't send me back there again. Oh, it's it's Franklin. Oh, look at who it is. He doesn't even seem happy to see me. Oh, jeez. Okay, he really doesn't want me to come back. Hey, man, this is a bad idea. Hey, Franklin. A long time no see. It's been crazy out there. Your dog almost died. Are you not at least... Concerned? Yeah, why aren't you concerned, Franklin? Come on, you're meant to be my owner. He's just being so mean about all of this. I'm not getting involved anymore. My job's done. So does that mean I can go back home, Franklin? Back to my kennel? Be fed again? Be friends again? <sighs> no. Great. All right, well, you know what, buddy? I don't need you anyway. I know what to do. I survive once, I will survive again. And this time, I got a much better plan. Because I'm going to the park. We're finding some friends. And what do you know? I've already found a friend. Let's go say hello. Ah, oh, man, this dog's so awesome. So that's his owner. Hey, go on, throw the ball. Throw Get off the phone. What? You're meant to be out with your dog. I feel so sorry for you. Hey, let's go and hang out. Yeah, we'll run over to the park or something. Woo! <laughs> this is fun! Check it out, we got a friend! Oh, you wanna get over the fence? You're just gonna bark at the fence. Hey, let me- I'll show you how to get over the fence. We just go around. And- no, okay, it's so much harder than it looks. <laughs> let me tell you, alright, we're in. See, check it out. Do you wanna come in? No, you're bored? Alright, okay. You're just gonna sit- okay, right. He's just gonna sit over there. That's fine. I'm gonna use the slide anyway, because I think they're fun. <laughs> Oh, man, they made him dog-proof. We really want to sit down. Okay, that's cool. We can sit down together. Let's go and catch some rays. <laughs> so, what's your name? My name's Chop. No, nothing. Nothing, okay. All right, well, we'll just look over here together. Oh, he's looking at me. Check it out. We got a friend. <laughs> Agatha, let's go home. Agatha, that's a very sophisticated name for a dog. Hey, we're playing. Get away from that stinky dog. Whoa. Oh. Don't make me bite your leg off, because I will. Whatever, let's go. No, I was making a friend. Oh, what am I supposed to do now? Ooh, that's a really nice car. Hey, I reckon that dog comes from a pretty rich family. <laughs> Don't lose that car, Chop. Are you kidding me? You just ran me over. That lady sucks at driving. Hey, 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 all right. Don't you dare reverse again. Where are you going? Okay, taking a left. Taking a left. All right, we're going this way then. Don't lose the car. Don't lose the car. Yes. She's not even driving that fast. All right, we'll follow where this goes to. I think I got a little bit of stamina. I hope it's not too far from here. <gasps> Whoa, this is a really nice house. Whoa, check it out. I can't believe it. This is where they live? And that's their garage. Well, I think I'll sneak in myself. I don't need Franklin's house. I got this place. But let's sneak into this bush. Last thing I want to do is scare them. I want to find a way to join them instead. Imagine if we could live a life of luxury. Unlimited steak. Nice food. People who actually care about me. Yuck, you need a bath. Come on, let's go! Uh-oh, looks like it's bath time. But wait, they're not moving. Do you reckon she can see me? I'm pretty sure she can. <laughs> Come on! I'm not waiting all day! Get off fine! Out of your way! 
And that's my cue! Let's go and say hello. Maybe she'll let me inside. Who knows? Seems friendly enough. Okay, do you want to be my friend? Yes! Th that's a yes! Awesome! Right, let's go inside. I want to check out your house. This place looks great. <laughs> yeah! So, I got a friend. We have a mansion we can use. Uh, let's see what it's like inside. I mean, do you reckon they got, like, huge TVs and massive fridges? They've got to have a couple of those things, right? <laughs> yeah! How do I even get in? This is strange. Is this? Oh my days, she's right there. You're from the park! Get out! Oh, she's not happy with me! No, no, I'd rather not. I'd really rather not. Whoa, you got a bar! <laughs> oh, look at this lounge! Come here, now! Oh, she's really chasing me! She's chasing me, dude! <laughs> Please, let me stay! There's gotta be something I can do! Is that your bath? No way! That's crazy! Hey, I'll take baths. I know your dog doesn't like them, but that looks luxury! <laughs> can I get a massage as well or something? Shoo! Get out! Uh oh, <laughs> she really hates me now. No thanks, I'd rather stay. Oh my days, you have a swimming pool. This house is perfect. Hey, mind if I use those towels? He's over there, please do something. Hey, wh what's she talking about? Who's she talking to? I am the dog catcher. The dog catcher? Hey, I don't like the sound of that. All right, well, you know what? I was actually just leaving, thanks. So <laughs> if you don't mind me, I'll just be getting out. Oh no, you didn't just, you did. Oh no, you just tranquilized me again. Oh, great. He's already on the floor sleeping. Well, this was a bad idea, I guess. Maybe we shouldn't have broken inside. I got way too ahead of myself. And now I'm surrounded by dogs. Whoa, this is weird. Why are there so many huskies and retrievers and lookalikes? Hey, there's only one chop in this town. It's me. Listen up. Oh, here we go. Someone's talking. That guy. All of you are unwanted. That's not true. Someone in this world wants me. I think. So, you work for me. I feed you. You do jobs, okay? I am the dog catcher. I'll be back. Bye. Hey, man, what kind of speech is that? All right, whatever. You know what? I don't care if no one wants me. I'm not working for that guy, so I'm leaving. I'm getting out of here. What is this, a slide open gate or something? They can't hold me against my will. I got rights to. Uh, oh. Oh, no. No, 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 no. That's not opening. Why isn't it opening? Hey, why is everyone looking at me? They come on, open. Are you kidding me? This can't be it. What about through? Come on. Come on. Oh, oh. Ah, no, not the husky. Oh, sorry. I'm so sorry. Are you okay? They're, they're sleeping. Okay, what if I try and get through this door? No, I can't even get through that door. Seriously? Come on, let me in. Are you out of your mind, guys? I'm trapped in this person's garden. Why are they letting them do this? This is not cool. And there's so many of us, too. Guys, we've got to find a way out of here. This gotta be something we can do. What about through this vent? Hey, do you reckon this will work? I guess it's worth a try. Get it off. <gasps> Guys, it works. I'm in his garage. And that must be dog food. <laughs> yep, definitely smells like it. <laughs> well, I'll be leaving. Thank you very much. And just like that, I'm out of there. But I want to sneak away because I don't want them to see me. I'm pretty sure he's still on that roof. Do -do 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 -do. Wait, I'm in Grove Street. Hold on, I know someone who lives here. It's not Franklin, but it's Denise and Lamar. If I can find them, then maybe they'll take me in. Quick, get out of here. Go, go, go. Before he even spots me. Whew. That was close. I can't believe I managed to escape from there. Right, we're going to Denise's. And she is going to look after me now. Please, Denise, please take me in. You're the only person I have left. If she doesn't take me in, then Chop's got nobody. Is it open? Oh, yes, it's open. Hey, Denise. Franklin left me. He disowned me. Can you please let me live here? Well, she's not kicking me out. That's great. Where does she go? Denise? Oh, wait, that's food. She's giving me food. That means she wants me here. Thanks for the hot dog, Denise. I'm so hungry. So Denise has given me Franklin's room because my kennel isn't there anymore. <laughs> I'm not complaining. I don't mind Franklin's room. I, I got a mirror. I'm indoors. It's warm. There's even a record player in case I want to play some records, listen to music. And I got his comfortable bed. Check it out. <laughs> oh, this is the life. We made a chop. Everything's gonna be just fine. Fine. Who's at the door? No, don't get it, Denise. Please don't. Oh, jeez. Who's at the door? Oh, it's Lamar. Hey, do you want to be my new owner? 
and Franklin kind of left me for no reason. All I did was burn his house down, but it wasn't that bad. Come on, Chop. Oh, yep. Yeah. Okay, I'm coming. I'm coming. I just fell off the bed. <laughs> I'm taking you home. Yes. Wait, Lamar's actually adopting me. No way. I don't even know where he lives. Uh, let's go. Franklin disowning you was the worst thing he ever did. You're a boss. Hey, ain't that right, Lamar? I know I'm a boss. Jeez, you don't need to tell me. Now take me home, Lamar. I want somewhere cozy, comfortable, and warm. And no, definitely not down this street. Please don't go down here. Oh my days, the dog catcher's down here. I'm pretty sure this is the same street. I am the dog catcher. Hey, I recognize you. Oh boy. Hey, can we can we just keep driving, Lamar? Where are we going? Where are we going, dude? I don't like this one bit. Do you live? On the same street as the dog catcher? Hey, this is a little bit sketchy. Okay, Chop. I need you to do something important. All right, what are we about to do? I want you to go into that house and bite his leg. Oh, whoa, really? You do this, and I'll look after you forever. I promise. I don't think this is very fair, and that guy's taking photos of us now. Are you sure this is a good idea? Just go. We ain't got long. I don't like this one bit. I'm getting flashbacks from the last time I had to do something like this, but they're letting me past. Oh, wow. <laughs> Looks like they don't even mind me going into their house. I think the door's locked. All right, let me find the, the back door. There's got to be another door to this place or a window. I'll find a window, even though they're barred up. What about a back door? There's got to be another door. Or could they be in the garage? This place is pretty big. Oh, that's got to be them. All right, take him down. Take him down. There's a lot of cash. No way, dude. They let me straight through. They underestimate me. Jump. <laughs> Good job, bro. All right, let's get the cash and go. Yeah, I agree. We should take all of this with us and probably leave over this fence instead. <laughs> Don't think we'll be able to sneak that out the round of the front. And because Lamar's a good guy, he's decided to adopt me and buy the biggest house in GTA 5. Even got some supercars. <laughs> well, you know what, guys? This has been a pretty eventful day. We're no longer homeless and we are finally living the life. Nothing's better than the sun beaming on your face and a good old jacuzzi on a spring day. That's right. I got my t-shirt on. It's warm outside. Chop is having the time of his life. And do you hear that? Yeah, I'm pretty sure you do. And that's Lamar, by the way. He's playing the bongos and he's doing a great job. I'm living the life. It doesn't get better than this. Actually, it does. Carabunga! <laughs> swimming around in the swimming pool. Oh, uh, Chop, can we not swim? Is that enough? Okay, Chop can't swim. <laughs> okay. Right, Lamar, I'm ready to go to the beach now. Can we go? For those of you wondering why I'm living with Lamar, I recommend you watch the last video we did, where Chop went homeless and got kicked out by Franklin. Lamar took me in, we did a few jobs together, and look who's got the supercars now. And guess who's picking? That's right, me. <laughs> Yo, Lamar, I think we gotta go for the red car. The red car is beautiful. Oh, the front of this gets me every time. This is my favorite car. Oh, Chop, you're not driving. I don't think you can drive. <laughs> <laughs> Let's take the passenger seat. And when we get to the beach, Lamar, I want to get the biggest hot dog ever. Make sure it's got onions on too. Hey, turn up the volume, Lamar. These are my favorite tunes. <laughs> da, 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 da. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, my name is Ben, hey, reporting to for song. Radio News. Suspicious mm. activity has been spotted near the science lab. We advise all civilians, TikTokers, and YouTubers to stay far back. I repeat, stay far back. Well, it's a good job we're not going there. <laughs> I mean, I don't fancy going to the science labs, do you, Lamar? We're going to the beach. And next time, I'll interrupt my favorite song for that. I was enjoying the groove. Now I've got to get the boogie back on again. It's not that easy. Yes, he's still there. And there's two hot dogs waiting to be served. Thanks, Lamar. You're the best owner ever. Way better than Franklin. Now, come on, Sharpie. You've been waiting for this all day. Mmm, delicious! <laughs> Next time, I want onions on them, too. Now, I'm going for a swim. You're joining me? Nothing beats a day out at the beach. Oh, we're just plowing through the sand. Yo, don't go too deep, Chop. Okay, maybe we should uh, go back to shore, Chop. This doesn't look safe. Uh-oh. Oh, no. I think he's in a little bit of trouble, guys. He, <laughs> he doesn't know how to swim. All right, we gotta get back to shore. Quickly, run! Is it this way? I think it's this way. Hey, Lamar, I made it! Lamar? Oh, you're over there. Wow, we really did go quite far. <laughs> Always went to the rocks. Uh, I think I'm ready to go home now. This is the best morning ever. And yesterday, I heard a rumor that if you press subscribe, then a strange noise will happen. Let me know if it actually does. I really want to know. Yeah, I'm naked. Oh, the 
That has been crazy. I went to the beach. I ate loads of food. We went for a drive. Man, I'm so looking forward to a little bit of sleep. And tomorrow, I get to do it all. Again. <laughs> oh man, hanging out with Lamar is the best thing that ever happened to us. <sighs> but it's exhausting, I can tell you that. Oh, there's even three steaks we left from this morning. I'll save them for breakfast. Now, <sighs> where do we even sleep? I don't even know where Chop made his bed. Okay, you know what? I think we're just gonna sleep right over here in this corner. This looks pretty cozy. What do you think, boy? Are you happy with this? Yeah, he seems pretty happy with this. All right, we'll use this little corner then. Whenever you're ready, boy. Whenever you're ready. I take your time. That's fine. Yeah. See you guys tomorrow. I got some good resting to do. Oh, oh, what was... Uh, 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 huh? Hey, wait a minute. What happened to the garden? What time is it? The sun isn't even up yet. Ma. Hey, this isn't funny, dude. What are you doing? What happened? Is everything okay? Anyone? Oh, oh my God. Days. There's a helicopter in the garden. How did that happen? That must be what woke me up. Okay, now I'm getting really scared. Where is everyone? Guys, anyone around? Oh. Guys, Chop's beginning to whimper. I'm gonna need you to like this video right now if you want to give Chop a little bit of love. He's literally terrified. Can you hear him? He doesn't sound very good. Are you around, buddy? Oh, are the cars still there? Oh, there's a really bright sunrise. Hey, Lamar, did he catch the sunrise, bro? Wait, what? Ah, smoke. Do you see that? I'm pretty sure I saw smoke. Yeah, there's smoke coming from the cars. What? Oh, my days, Lamar! <laughs> what, what happened to you, buddy? What's that on you? Are you okay? Come on, talk to me. He's not even talking. Oh, get away from me. Get away from me, dude. Get away from me. Something's happened to Lamar. Okay, one minute. Well, I need to go and investigate. Lamar doesn't seem like himself. He's not even talking to me. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Please tell me this isn't what I think it is. Man, all of these cars are smoking too. What? Wait, I think I saw someone drive. Someone was driving on the road. Maybe they can tell me what happened. And why a helicopter crashed into my house. Uh, oh, hey, guys. Can you tell me what the... No, they're doing the same thing as Lamar. There's another guy driving. I can see someone else driving. They're down this road. Hey, stop the car. Stop. Yes, they're getting out. They're getting out. Amazing. Hey, guys. You won't believe this. My owner, he needs some help right now. He... he what? They're doing the same thing. Wait a minute. Is this? Oh my days. I think this might be a zombie apocalypse. Are you kidding me? Again? Another zombie apocalypse? Come on. My life was going so well. That's it. Right. I'm going back to my house and I'm finding Lamar and I'm gonna make sure he's okay. No way he's a zombie. It wouldn't happen. No way. We'll just clean him up. I'll nudge him into the swimming pool or something. We'll figure it out. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. We're not going in the house. No, no, no. We're not going there. We're not going there. They must have been in my garden. Okay, right. We can't go back home. And there's zombies on the streets. Lamar seems like he might actually be a zombie. Which means I don't know what to do. Doesn't Michael live nearby? Yeah, I'm pretty sure Michael does. Okay, we're going to Michael's. And maybe he's alive. I mean, out of everyone who's going to be alive in a zombie apocalypse, Michael is going to be one of them. He knows what to do. He's been through so many of them. And if we can find him, maybe we'll be okay. Jeez, this is crazy. Like, everyone I'm encountering is a zombie. I haven't seen a single survivor. Come on! How did this even happen? So I've made it to Michael's and his gate is locked. I gotta find another way in. That's a good sign. Michael must have locked the gates when the zombie apocalypse happened. That's a great sign, of course. All right, how do we get in? If he locked the front gate, did he lock this one too? Please be open. Oh no, he locked this one as well. All right, guys, I'm pretty sure Michael's alive. So what I gotta do is find a way in. And I don't know how I'm gonna do that because I don't think there is a way in. Not when I'm playing as chop what if i try and jump on this wall yes brilliant brilliant and i think i can see a spot which we can sneak in through we'll just go across this wall get to that fence and sneak straight on in <laughs> this is crazy oh my days i'm breaking into michael's house as chop okay careful go down and we're in amazing all right his tennis court looks pretty clean check it out there's no one here this is really good compared to the house i was in i mean you can barely tell there's an apocalypse going on right here's the deal. We're gonna go inside. I'll scratch at the doors. I will literally do whatever I have to if it means I get his attention. Hey, Michael, are you in? Well, please tell me you're in. Please, please, please. Yes, it's open. Am Amanda, Jimmy, hey, have any of you guys seen Michael? No, no, okay, right, that that's fine. I'm pretty sure. Oh, run, Chop, run. They're gonna bite you, bro. I haven't found Michael yet, but I don't like the sound of this. If both of them are zombies, then 
what's gonna happen to Michael? Do you reckon he's one too? I mean, he wouldn't let anything happen to his family. Tracy, Michael. Oh, no. Tracy's also a zombie. Oh, oh my days. There's no one in Jimmy's room. Oh, quick, go around, Tracy. Go around her. Michael, are you in? Are you hiding in this room? Michael? Oh, no. Michael's not in, but his family are zombies. Great. Oh, what do we do now? Okay, let me take a look. Oh, oh I want to out of this house, of course, and into safety. Uh, Tracy, get away from me. Get away. This is crazy. Oh, my days. Everyone's a zombie. I haven't really got a choice, but I gotta go back to Franklin and hope he takes me back. We're not gonna survive an apocalypse otherwise. Where is he? Oh, wait, he's at Denise's. He's right over there. Okay, we'll go down there and yeah, we'll figure out a plan, but he's taking me back. All of this is taking me back to the radio we heard yesterday. Remember that guy who said suspicious things were happening at the science labs? You reckon that's what was going on? He told us not to investigate. Maybe it was. He, we should have listened. Yeah, it's too late for that now. Just keep moving boy. We know where Franklin is. Is that Denise's house? What did they do to this place? That's a pretty big fortress. Alright, we gotta find a way inside. Okay, we're not going down that way. Is that a fence? Yep, they fenced it off. Someone's been here. They know what they're doing. This is only the work of Franklin. He's the only guy who survived enough apocalypses to understand what to do. Maybe figure out how to climb over the door. Oh, jeez. Okay, there's more of them. There's more of them. There's more of them. They didn't barricade these off. Alright, so we can't really take that alleyway. I gotta find another way around to the street. Come on, look around, boy. Look around, look around. There's gotta be an easy way around. What's this? Fire station or something? No, no, no. What about over here? Yes! <laughs> I found a way. Perfect. And that is Denise's house. Oh, yeah, they did a really good job of this place. Check it out. Are those barrels and a working gate? This place is a mess. Look at this. It's overgrown and everything. Franklin, it's... Oh, oh my days. Oh, no. Get away, get away, get away. Get away, get away. Are you kidding me? There's another zombie? Wait a second. Franklin's in this house. He's in this house. Does that mean Franklin's a zombie as well? No, that can't be. That can't be. Franklin is not as... Get away from me. Get away from me. Get away from me, guys. Come on. Wait, Franklin's not here. Huh? That's really weird. He was here a second ago. Oh, no. No, he's back at his house. Did I see that correctly? He was definitely here. Maybe he left when he found out that everyone was zombies. That sucks. I was so close to his house as well. Do I even bother going inside? Oh, no. There are even zombies on the roof. For real? I don't know if Denise is alive. She could be a zombie. But at least we know Franklin's definitely alive. He was here like five minutes ago. <sighs> Man, that sucks. Okay, we gotta go back across Los Santos. At least we can see more now, though. But this time, Chop, be extra careful. We know these alleyways are full of zombies. The last thing I want to do is encounter a bunch of them. Was it down this alley? Yeah, it was down this one. And they can see me already. They must have a really good nose. <laughs> oh, no. Here we are. Franklin's house. Oh, no, are you kidding me? There's more. All right, we're going inside. There's a plant pot in the door. This is crazy. Franklin, I made it. I came all the way through Los Santos. Please take me back. I'm really sorry, bro. I'm really sorry for everything. He's not in the kitchen. What about on the balcony? Are you on the balcony, buddy? No, he's not here either. Oh, no, the zombies made it inside. How do they do that? Hey, do you smell that? It smells like steak. Wait a minute. I think Franklin was cooking steak here, like, today. Why would he be doing that? It's coming from inside. Oh, no way. He left me a pile of steak, a pork chop, a bowl full of food. He must have known I was coming back. I gotta shake off these zombies, though. They are in his house. Hey, what if I try and bite them? Do you reckon we can do that? Is that even gonna work? Like, what? What if we become a zombie? Three, two, one. Oh, get him, Chop. Get him. <laughs> and the other guy. Uh, let go. Let go. Let go. Get the other one. Get the other one. Chop. Let go. Uh, run. 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 I think we got him. Oh, yes, we did. And we're not a zombie. Perfect. <laughs> get out of Franklin's house. Suddenly, I feel like I'm home again. Now, let's look at this. He left me loads of steak and a note, which says evacuation flights at Fort Sancudo. I don't know where he's going. He's not at his house. He's in Fort Sancudo, waiting to go into the base. All right, well, it looks like he beat me to the chase. He's evacuating. All right, I got a mission. We're gonna do it. We're getting to Fort Sancudo. I don't know how hard it's gonna be, but I'm gonna try my best. Yo, great. Even more zombies to go through. Where did you guys suddenly come from? Are you hear that? Is that barking? I think I might have found another survivor. The first one. It's coming from behind this house. I'll go around the zombies. Let's take a look down here quickly. Is there another dog? Hello? Are you okay? Oh, there is! There is! <laughs> 
We found a friend. Hey, what's your name? Actually, doesn't matter. You a zombie? I don't think you are. Come on, let's go. Let's get out of here together. You're coming with me. Let me just check the coast. Uh, okay, that's not clear. You know what? I think we, uh, let's, let's go this way, buddy. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. We don't really have a choice here, but there's got to be another way out of this house, right? Uh, Come on, there's got to be something else we can do. We can't go the way we came. There's so many zombies coming around that corner. Uh, yes, there's another gate. Perfect. We'll go through here. Come on, jump up the stairs. Oh, my days. Is it really that hard to get up the stairs? Hey, come on, bro. We're in a zombie apocalypse. We can't be walking around forever. And voila, we're out of here like nothing. Okay, we better get moving. They know we did this. They can smell us a mile away. <laughs> this is crazy. This is so exciting. I found a friend in a zombie apocalypse. What name do we call it? Let me know some fun names names in the comments. Right, let's get moving before those zombies catch up. You see this guy over here? He's dangerous. We don't want to touch that guy, so we go around him, all right? <laughs> yeah. But if you have to, you can bite them. <laughs> all right, you get the other guy now. Get the get the other one before he bites me. All right, that's fine. That's fine, actually. You know what? I'll just I'll take him out myself. <laughs> you don't want to do this in case they bite you and you become a zombie. You hear me? Wait, guys, I think I found somebody. All right, go around the zombies. Hey, stop shooting. I'm not a zombie. I'm not a zombie. Michael. No way. It's Michael. And it is Trevor. Guys, I am so glad to have found you. What happened to the engine? Did it break or something? Right. Michael's just dealing with the zombies. I'll let him do it. You know, just uh, whatever whatever you got to do to take out the zombies. Come on, Trevor. Fix the engine. I reckon you can take us with you, by the way. Like, it's a pretty long journey to the Fort Sancudo base. Yes, we can get in. <laughs> All right, wait, maybe I should help out Michael, though. I mean, these zombies are getting awfully close. All right, now's your chance to take out some zombies, buddy. You just gotta bite them in the leg. Like this. Seriously, come on. I don't think it's gonna happen. My friend is a little bit too uh, nice for a zombie apocalypse. We'll just get in the car and let Michael do the rest. Good luck catching us now. <laughs> Yo, careful, Mike. I mean, that, that's awfully close to me and my mate. Boy, are we lucky to find these guys. We got a lift all the way to the military base. Uh-oh. Hey, watch out, guys. There's some Zombies ahead. Oh, yeah, just go go through them. Go <laughs> straight through. Oh, man, the perks of having a car. Oh, looks like we weren't the only ones who tried to get the military base. I don't know if we can get the car through this. Hey, Mike, do you mind if we walk? My friend doesn't really like cars either. He's been crying the entire journey. There's people here, and they're not zombies. I don't think we'll be needing those, Mike. Trevor, you can put that away, because these people, they actually seem like they're alive. This is great. Hey, come on, please let me in. I love how I'm trying to talk. All they can probably hear is just woof, woof, grrr. Come on, let me in, bro. Please, we come across the entire of Los Santos, and I'm pretty sure my owner, Franklin's in here, too. Yes, he let us in. Amazing. <laughs> All right, let's go to the base and find Franklin. Whoa. Look at this. <laughs> yeah. So this is the evacuation point. And it's nice to finally be around somewhere where zombies aren't trying to eat you left, right, and center. The question is, is Franklin... I think he is. I think I can see him. That's him. Come on, open. Yes, Franklin, it's me. Woof, woof. Come on, just turn around, buddy. This is awesome. Wait, how do I get through? Oh, come on, don't block me now. Come on, there's gotta be a way through. Franklin, you gotta open this gate. Franklin, look, it's us. Wait, he's seen us. Oh, man, I'm so glad to finally see you again. He's sorry for kicking me out of the house. Well, you know what? It's all right, Franklin. Water under the bridge. I'm just glad we're a okay. Now, which tent do I want? I think I'll go for the uh, yellow one. This ain't yours. Is it Franklin? Because it's mine. Actually, no, I want to go for the blue one. It looks bigger. No, I want this one. It's got a duvet on top. I'll take this. Oh, man, I'm so glad to be safe and reunited again. Attention! <laughs> I have officially joined the army, and it's not just me who joined. I'm with my best friend Franklin as well. We evacuated here in a zombie apocalypse the other day and decided to finally join. <laughs> and I think I'm doing pretty good because they gave me a brand new collar. This one has spots all over it. It's awesome. Cool, is this my first mission? <laughs> yeah. All right, this one seems pretty simple. I just gotta run over the tires and get to the other side without breaking my leg. That might be kind of tricky. Why is Franklin meditating? This isn't even gonna be that hard. Oh, wait, I get to play as Franklin. Okay. <laughs> Come on, Franklin, don't screw this up. We need both of you to join the army, not just one of you. Did I pass? Did I? Yes! <laughs> yeah. Franklin passed. All right, Chop, now it's you. All right. Like I said, this is gonna be easy. 
It's not gonna be tricky at all. Just run, and then these two. Oh, oh, oh these are really. Oh no! I missed one. Don't miss it. Don't miss it, Chopper. Man, I gotta start again. Seriously, ah, this is so tricky. Honestly, I thought this was gonna be kind of simple, but it's actually really hard when you have four legs. What does this have anything to do with the army anyway? Can you just give me some weights? I can lift those. All right, we'll just run over these two. Slow down. Run over these two. Slow down. And these two. And then these four. Yes. And then these three. Yes. And the last two. Ah, we pass. Yeah, take that, buddy. Hey, check this out. I'm one of them. This is actually awesome. They've just let me join the army, even though I'm a dog. Your first mission awaits. Don't let me down. Ooh, our first mission. How exciting. I hope it's action-packed and full of action. Did I say action? Uh I think I did. <laughs> Here we go, Chop. Me and you on our first mission together. And two other guys in the back. Yo, what's up? <laughs> All right, I wonder what we're gonna do today. Oh, and by the way, I totally forgot. But if you press the subscribe button, something crazy happens. Like, really? Oh, really? I'm upside down? What? No, this isn't meant to be the... No, stop spinning me around on oh, my days. I'm going dizzy. Really? This is the crazy thing? Oh, you've got to like the video to stop the craziness happening. Well, if you want to watch the video like this, you can. But I really recommend liking the video now. <sighs> oh, wow. Okay, that was wild. <laughs> Hopefully that doesn't happen again. Anyway, can you please let me out of the base so we can do our first mission? Excuse me, open the gate, please. What's this guy doing? Can you let me out, please? Who is this guy? He's just walking around. You are the most useless person on our team. Right, fine. I'll open the gate myself. See, that wasn't... No, no, no. What the... What is going on with this? We're gonna very, very slowly go underneath. Hey, guys, I think the gate's broken, so uh, you're gonna wanna fix that one. you can. <laughs> That's the weirdest thing ever. Oh, jeez. Well, we're finally out of the base. And we're preparing for our very first mission in the military. I know, Chop. I know. I'm excited, too. You don't need to woof in the car. Wait, why is he? Oh, you're woofing at this. The SWAT team are out here. No way. This is awesome. They barricaded the bridge to the military base. Hold on. There's a dog. That's why Chop's woofing. No, you can't say hello. Oh, my days. Wait, something's going on. Wait, wait who are you guys shooting at? What? What's happening right now, guys? Something crazy is happening. I, I think the military have found someone bad. This isn't our first mission, is it? Oh, my days. I don't think it is, but <laughs> I'm glad we got security here. Clearly, we need it outside the military base. But check it out. People are driving around, doing their thing. There's no zombies by the looks of it. Looks like the apocalypse is long gone. Did you see what happened? Hey, wait, Chop, where'd you go? Hang on a second. Oh, man, he is talking to the other dog. Okay, Chop, what have I got to do to get you back into the car? Look, they're not interested, okay? It's not time to make friends. You gotta do work in the army. We need serious work being done. Now get back in the car. I'm gonna have to make him get back in the car and I'm locking the doors as well. Screw child lock. We need to activate dog lock so Chop can't get out. Anyway, pleasure working with you guys. Let's get on to our first mission. <laughs> yeah, whatever it is. We need access to the satellites. Regain control and get them online. The satellites? Exciting! So these must have dropped offline or something. Okay, that shouldn't be too tricky. Why have we stopped here, though, guys? Is everything okay? Oh, my days. I don't think everything is okay. <gasps> There's people there. No way. I think they took control over them. What are you doing? No, come back here. Oh, my days. He's literally... Chop, no, you're gonna get caught. Right, that's it. I'm playing as Chop. You want to get yourself caught? Fine. Suit yourself. Wait a second. I think this was a genius idea, actually. Since I'm a dog, they won't suspect that I'm in the military at all. <laughs> so they got some engineers here. Interesting. Nice. I don't think those guys are gonna try and stop us. These people, on the other hand, they took control of the satellites and they still haven't seen me. <laughs> this is gonna be the easiest job ever. All right, guys. Stand back. They, how, how do they not see them? We're literally there. Okay, everybody, hold fire for now. I'm gonna make a start on these three, and then you can jump in. Oh, hello there. Don't mind me, guys. I don't like dogs. And you know what? Dogs don't like you either. Get him, Chop. Everyone, fire. No, not the engineers. We need them. Right, that's it. We're going for the ball. <laughs> Take him out, Franklin. Durr. You guys took the wrong satellites. Oh, that's my boy. Go get him, Chop. Yeah, this is awesome. Who would have thought both Chop and Franklin working in the army together. Hey, buddy, you're doing a terrible job on lookout. Hey, get away from my dog. Job is awesome. Atta boy, well done. You got them all. Well done, boy. You're amazing. <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> well, let's get these satellites back online. I don't exactly know why the army want them, but for some reason they do. Now, how exactly do we do that? Maybe if we just take a look, there'll be a clue. Hmm. I don't think we can get up this way. Let's try the other way instead. Like up this ladder and straight up to the top. This is awesome. I'm climbing up an actual satellite. All right, how do we switch this thing on? He didn't make it easy for us, did he? Yes, we got him on. Well done. The satellites are online. Uh, excuse me. Can I ask a question? Yep. Why did we need the satellites online? So we can see everything. You know, with the army. We need eyes in the sky. Oh, I understand. Hey, uh, boss, we got a problem. Uh, one minute. Oh, my. That is a problem. Uh, guys, round up everyone you can. Oh, jeez. Okay, I think they've already found something. All right, well, let's go. Oh, my gosh, he was right. Something is going on. All of you, listen to me. Back down. Now. You and what army, huh? I thought you'd ask that. This army. <laughs> All right, you heard the man. Let's take him down. <laughs> hey, guys, you should have listened. Honestly, you really should have. We got tanks pointing at all of them. Hey, actually, you know what I'm thinking? I might just take a tank. Come on, Franklin, we got this. Hey, Chop, do you want to come in? Oh, go on. I know you want to. Get in. This might just be the only time we get to use a tank. Boom. Uh, he doesn't want to get in. That's fine. We don't... Oh, my days. Yo, watch out. They got a couple of uh, gas canisters, and that made a big explosion. Hey, what's that guy doing diving all over the place? Hey, I see even more of them. Boss Franklin uses the tank. I'm gonna sneak in with Chop and see if there's any survivors or anyone who needs rescuing. Come on, boy. Run, run. <laughs> Thanks for clearing the area a little bit. Hey, I'm pretty sure some of them are running around the back. I'll tell Franklin about that when I get back. But first, I need to check these rooms. Bam! Chop's here and he's not holding back. Is anyone here? Hey, this room seems clear to me. All right, let's keep moving. Next room we go. You never know what these guys are hiding. For all we know, they could have loads of money. Or maybe some supplies or something extremely dangerous. Like somebody who hasn't subscribed to this channel. I mentioned it before, but those of you who don't miss out on videos like this every day. That, to me, sounds pretty dangerous. Is there anyone here? Oh, my days. The sheriffs. They've taken them. Well, then, not anymore. Take them down, chop. <laughs> Ah, no one suspects the dog. Hey, sheriffs, I'm pretty sure it's safe to get out of here. Let me just check around the other side of the room. Oh, yeah. Okay, this is good. It looks like all of these guys called the sheriffs and took over the land. Well, not anymore. Well done, Chop. You really saved the day. Hey, what's that in your hand, boy? Huh? Hey, where'd you get one of those? You're not meant to have one of those. You're meant to use your teeth. <laughs> hey, come on. Give it back, boy. Give it back. That is not yours. Come on. Hand it off. Ha no, hand it over, Chop. <laughs> All right, guys, I don't think... Oh, my days, he's literally fired it by accident. Yo, don't shoot anyone in the foot. Ah, oh, jeez. Oh, Can someone please take that from him? Well, I'm done, everybody. Hey, let's keep moving. We found something else. You know what? I'm getting in this tank. Well, okay, I'm not taking the journey with Chop. Not if he's gonna be holding one of those. <laughs> you can take the journey yourself, boy. I wonder what this is. The police station. Why are we here? Hmm, I can't use this tank anymore. Maybe we should send Chop in to take a look. After all, <laughs> no one seems to find a dog scary. Okay, Chop, it's your time to shine. I say head in that station and bark three times if you need us to uh, come in. They better have my back. All right, let's do this. Police line, do not cross. So, I don't know what the situation is down here, but we were told to get moving and take a look. Whatever's happening. I mean, it just looks like a normal police station. There's not really... Oh, my days. Oh, my goodness. What? Whoa. Prisoners have taken over the station. All right, let me use my cute I'm a dog tactic. Let me just... <laughs> they don't even care. Oh, my days. Police officers are in the cell. Whoa, this is crazy. So, during the apocalypse, it looks like these guys took over the police station. Okay, time to woof three times. Woof, woof, woof. No, oh, you're so cute. Yes, I am, aren't I? Burr. <laughs> take him down, Chop. Take him down. Hey, now be a great time for backup. Where are you guys? Come on. They almost took me out. That's right. <laughs> you thought you could take me? Screw you guys. Think again. The army have got my back. This is awesome. I love being in the army. Did Franklin survive? Oh, yeah. Franklin's literally leading them. He's in the middle. That's awesome. Well done, everybody. I am so glad everyone survived that. Check it out. <laughs> Even Chop did. Now, let's get those officers out. Everyone, it's safe to come out now. Let's get you back on your feet and running low Santos again. It's no use. What do you mean it's no use? Come on, talk to me. Tell me what's up. The Mafia are in town. And unless you stop them, 
We ain't got no power. We'll get you back in power, I promise. Let's go dig him down. We're gonna need every one of us we can get. So this is their base. Look at all those nice cars. And are those what I think they are? Let me zoom in. Yes, I knew it. Police officers. And they've been taken too. I think it's about time they learn who the boss is around here. Hey, guys, you picked on the wrong person. <laughs> yeah. Come on, everybody, let's get them. I'll send Chop out when it's safe to send him out. Right now, I'm just using my tank. Hey, they're trying to take these out, but guys, you should have got a tank. I mean, come on, what are you doing? You're trying to take over Los Santos and you don't even have a tank? Now, I don't care who you are. I don't care what you've done. I just want to make sure we gain control over Los Santos again and everybody feels safe. There's so many people. Boom. <laughs> oh, we better get promoted for this. And that's just about all of them. Hey, watch out for those cars, Frank. The last thing I want to do is... Oh, no. I think I blew some of them up. Come on. They look so nice. Boom. Oh, man. There's even more of them. Well, we better leave this tank alone. Which car do I want? I gotta take your award. Wait a second. Did I not get them all? There's even more of them. They're still alive. Watch out, Franklin. They could be anywhere. Where are they? They're shooting me from, like, all over the place. Guys, get out of here. It's not safe. Leave. All right. Where are they? Hello? Is there anyone? Oh, my days. They're on the balcony. Of course they are. All right. What have I got? Yes. I got a rocket launcher. Boom. <laughs> yeah. Hey, you guys are totally screwed. Let me see if I can throw one of these up as well. <laughs> yeah, enjoy. Uh -oh. oh my days, that almost landed on me. Did they survive? Yes, I'm pretty sure they survived. Officers, it's safe now. You can turn around. Did you find the cash? Cash? What cash? These guys have cash? Let's go and take a look. I found the cars, all right, but if you're saying there's cash around here, we'll find it. I got just the person for it too. Where are you? Oh my days, someone's alive. They're still up there. <laughs> you guys are quiet. So, I want you to use your sniffer of yours, boy, to smell out all of the cash, wherever it is. I guess there's a lot of it if the police were talking about it. Let's see. Oh, yes. Chops definitely picked something up. I think it's this way. How much cash are we talking about? Like, is it millions or billions or, dare I say, trillions of dollars? I mean, for all we know, it could be quintillions of dollars. Oh, in this world, I think Chops got something. He's going straight for these gates. Guys, we might just find the biggest pile of cash ever. They're locked. All right, one second. We're gonna pounce. Three, two, one. Bah! Stop right there. Get him, boy. <laughs> 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 and that is a lot of money. Oh, my days. Okay, well, I think we're talking somewhere in the trillions now, guys. We found the cash. Check it out. We've taken over Los Santos, and this place is safe once again. <laughs> we even got our own celebration parade. Except uh, I'm pretty sure we're the only ones not actually following instructions. <laughs> Look at this. This is awesome. They're taking photos. I'm pretty sure the president's out as well. And we've got helicopters and cars and even planes in the sky. Well, Franklin, we've done a really good job in the army. Let's get back in line and continue with this adventure. We've got a problem. There was a zombie apocalypse the other day. We evacuated and now I've just come back to my house. And as you can tell, things don't look too good. This place is a mess. There's grass on the roof. There's weeds coming out the walls. I don't even know what it looks like inside. Do I dare take a look? I mean, do I want to? What do you think, shop? Do we? Okay, let's may as well take a look anyway. I mean, it could be spotless in there. Or we could encounter a lost zombie. <sighs> okay. All right, shop, get my back. Oh, All right, oh, it's barking. Good. Oh. <laughs> All right, three, two, one. Anyone? Oh, my days. What? This place is crazy. There's a mess everywhere. Okay, there could still be a zombie. I don't doubt it, though. I mean, there's a fire going on. <laughs> Yo, a part of me is thinking we just knock this place down. How did we even live here? Hey, your bed's still there, though. That's good news. And it looks like Chop ate all of the steaks and he left the food. Oh, what was wrong with the food? Come on, it was chicken dinner, your favorite. I left it down just for you and your pork chop as well. Hey, don't leave the ball down. Come on, may as well take that thing. Even though my house is a little bit of a mess, I reckon we can clean this up. Just gotta get the fire extinguisher on this. I can't be dealing with a fire in my house. Good job we arrived when we did. It would have burned down to the ground. Yeah, I got it. Perfect. Okay, let's take a look in the garden. I mean, if this is what it's like inside, maybe the garden's gonna be all right. Let's see. Oh, jeez. We got a lot of cleaning up to do, that's for sure. All right, Chop, you get the broomstick. I'm gonna start tidying this place. Good 
as new. Not a single bit of dust in sight. I think we did a pretty good job. Oh, come on, shop. Let's get some food now. And I'll make sure it's not chicken dinner this time. Clearly, he doesn't like chicken dinner. <laughs> oh, wait. Someone just rang my doorbell. I wonder who that could be. Did we order some surprise pizza? Maybe Franklin did it when I wasn't looking. That would actually be amazing. Uh, hello. My name is... Whoa, wait a second. What do you guys want? I worked for the army before. I, I think we did a good job. We're not joining again. Franklin Clinton. Yes, that is my name. Take this reward. It's the least we can do for everything you've done for us. What? You just gave me money. One hundred billion dollars. Okay, well, thank you very much. I'm so glad we're not joining again. No problem. Have a good day. Uh, you too. Man, how generous of them. They just gave me a bunch of money for working in the army. Whoa, hey, how did the fire get on my ceiling? Okay, time to put this out as well. I thought I solved everything. How did this happen? For some reason, it won't even go out either. Chop, watch out. There's... Chop? Is that barking? Hey, what's up with Chop? Hey, chill out, boy. What's up? Whoa, how did the kennel set on fire? I didn't see that before. <laughs> okay, stay back, boy. You're a little bit too close to this. Man, this place is a mess. It's like the entire house wants to burn itself down. Hmm... Hey, that's not a bad idea. How about this, Chop? We use our money to upgrade our houses. I think that's the best idea we've come up with all week. <laughs> and we have a ton of money to use. Come on, let's get moving. I want to get the best house upgrade ever. And Chop needs a new kettle. Even I couldn't put the fire out. And whilst we head there, I want to let you guys know about a secret. Because did you know if you press the subscribe button, the next video in the series will actually reveal itself on the screen. But you need to press subscribe now so you can see what's coming next. Next. Did it work? Did it? Hey, let me know in the comments if it did. Even I don't know what the next video is. <laughs> now, let's talk about our dream houses. I know what I want in my house. I want to get loads of supercars. And since I'm the one with the money, I, I gotta have my needs prioritized over yours, Chop. I'm just saying. Besides, how much do bones actually cost? Eh? We can dig them up somewhere else. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You want lots of Wagyu beef? Hey, you got expensive taste, Chop. L listen, you don't need that stuff. Just have a steak. Oh, man. Okay, Chop's getting really annoyed at me now. He wants some real luxury things. No, I'm not getting you a Rolex. Are you out of your mind? I gotta be careful. Chop's gonna go crazy with money at this point. It has been a while since we've been here. I mean, these guys are the people who've done all the upgrades on my houses before. We've had some pretty amazing upgrades done, but this request is the first of its kind. Hey, Chop, go and get out. I want you to explain to him all of your expensive tastes, and I want him to tell you why it's simply not possible. <laughs> He's gonna be so angry at me. Hey, man, long time no see. Yeah, you too. How are you holding up? I'm doing pretty good, you know, same old, same old, just filming videos, making people laugh, you know how it is. Wish I could say the same. Hey, what do you mean? Look at this. You got work going, you're doing things, you're digging up some ground. I mean, I bet you got some exciting projects going. Nope, it's been pretty boring. Oh, well, in that case, I got an exciting job for you. How about you fancy upgrading my house and Chop's house as well? <laughs> I got a lot of money and I'm willing to spend it. You've made my day. How much you got? Uh, let me see. I'll give you everything I got. How about uh, 90 million dollars? Does that sound fair? Yeah, we'll take it. I'll uh, we'll give you the best job ever. Come on, boys. Let's go. This is so cool. <laughs> yeah. I couldn't give them all of my money. I got plans for the rest of it. We're going to do some other things. Things which I know you guys are going to love. Come on, shop. Get in. <laughs> yeah. I can't ruin the surprise, can I? We're upgrading a house. We're upgrading a house. Let's go. Let's go. They're really happy about that. <laughs> yeah, have a good time, guys. I'll be back later on. You better build me the best thing I've ever seen. They're even dancing on there. That's awesome. <laughs> right, let's get to work. I still have $10 million, and I intend to spend every penny of it. Benny is just the person we need. Yo, what's up, Benny? Again, long time no see. I used to come to this guy all the time, and now we've barely seen each other for weeks. Benny, it's only me and Chop. Oh, he must be working on something. Benny, are you in there? Buddy, are you upstairs? Sleeping? I mean, it's a pretty cool workshop. This guy can do some amazing upgrades. You should have seen what he's done to my cars in the past. Yo, Benny! Are you in? Come on, open the door, buddy. This ain't funny! This is kind of strange. He's usually always in. Benny? Hello? Ah! Oh, what? Who did that? Benny? He knows me. He wouldn't do that. Oh, he really knocked me out. Oh... Oh, hey, where are we, Frank? Was I just thrown near the bins? Huh? 
Is Chop? Oh, Chop's okay. That's good. Man, that really hurts. What happened? Did you see anything, Chop? Uh, like, you seem okay. I'm glad whoever did that did not go near Chop. Could you imagine? I would have taken them down. Follow Chop to find the enemy. Wait, do you know where he is? <gasps> That'd be amazing! I think Chop saw him and he can sniff him out! Oh, wait, I don't have any money. Did they just take my money? No way. They took all of my money. That was my fun money! I was gonna do cool things with that! Now I really want to get my revenge. Come on! Take me to them! I wonder if we know the person who did this. Maybe Benny went rogue and turned into a double agent. <laughs> I mean, that would be pretty crazy, right? Uh, this way? You think they went this way? Dogs have an amazing sense of smell, and Chop has never let me down. So I'm pretty confident he's gonna find them. And when we catch them, oh, they're gonna regret the day they laid hands on us. Oh, here we go. Now he's picking up speed. We must be getting closer. Hey, catch up, Franklin! <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, Chop, calm down. We need to let Franklin catch up with us. After all, he is a little bit dizzy still. Do you guys have any idea on who did this? Like, there's a lot of evil people in this world. Lester is one of them, Michael's another, and Trevor is a little bit crazy. But I don't think he would do that to me. Even Simeon might have done this to us. We've done some bad things to him. Hey, do you reckon they're around here? I mean, this is a pretty hidden away area. I don't see many people around. It's a perfect place to hide out if you don't want to get caught. Come on, don't let me down. I've been following you around for almost an hour now. Unless... Would they be in here? Oh, wait, Chop's walking over. <gasps> There's a secret base. No way! This must be where they are. Where are they, Chop? Find them for me! So it looks like we found a scrapyard. I'm... Ooh, oh, guys, there's some cars! And they're really, really nice cars. Not the kind of vehicles you would expect to find in a place like this. This has Benny's name all over it. I mean, I want an upgrade like this gold one. Oh, wait, there's even more of them. There's even more of them. Let's take a look around and... <gasps> Oh my days. You guys see that? Hey, Franklin, I need your phone. There's loads of them. And I can see Benny. But he's not the only one there. They've got Simeon and the Los Santos mechanic. I don't believe this. I want to know where every car is located. Tell me. These guys are doing a heist against cars. And it looks like they're doing pretty good. And with those three captured, they'll be able to find all the other ones around Los Santos. But wait, is that my money? I think it is. I can't tell exactly how much, but it looks like like it's at least 10 million dollars. I need to get that back. So this is the plan. I'm gonna storm them with... Oh, great. They took everything I have. All right, I'm not gonna last three seconds in there. I can't just use my fist. There's like seven of them. They'll take me down. What do we do? I need that cash. I've got an idea. What if we sneak in with Chop and, oh, and grab some of the money. Yep, giving me a lot of hope here, boy. Come on, stand up. <laughs> Everyone loves dogs, right? At least most people do. So I'm just gonna sneak in and grab a mouthful of cash. Oh, he hasn't seen me. There's another guy right there. All right, three, two, one. Oh, gross. Oh, money doesn't taste that nice. All right, come on, bring it back. Bring it back. Hey, Franklin, I got some money. <laughs> Well, that should be enough to buy something so we can take him down. How much did he get? Ooh, uh, nice. He got like five different stacks of cash. Well done, boy. That ought to be enough. Come on, let's get moving. I'll take one of their cars afterwards. Last thing I want to do is let them know we were even here. Best behavior now, boy. There's a lot of dangerous things in this warehouse, all right? This is not the place to play. Hello? I would like to buy something powerful and not so expensive. Uh, we got a bit of a job to do. Let's see. $58,000. How much is that? That's Ooh, <laughs> just 11,000. Ah, oh, you know I'm getting the minigun. I'll get a couple of rounds, not too many. That leaves me $46,000. I don't want to go for anything too powerful. I don't want to destroy those cars. So let's go for something simple like this. Get a little bit of ammo. That'll do the trick. Now what else have you got? Oh yeah, perfect. Grab one of these. And then something we can use in a car. I'm thinking maybe this. Affordable. Yeah, that's quite nice. And just in case we do need to do something in an emergency, I'm gonna go for... 
a couple of these. Just a couple, not too many, and that ought to do the trick. Now, let me see. Have you got any armor we can borrow as well? Anything which might protect us? Oh, here we go. Super heavy armor. Perfect. We're gonna be just fine, boy. <laughs> yeah. Now, let's go and take him down and get my money back and rescue Benny. I need to keep Benny alive so I can finally get the car upgrade of my dreams. I was gonna spend $10 million on it. Here we go. I need you guys to be quiet because the last thing I want to do is a lot them. We're doing the element of surprise here. <laughs> yeah. All right, hide behind this dumpster. Oh, I'll be oh, hide behind this car. That works as well. And then let's see. Who do I want to pick off first? I'll go for the guy next to Benny. All right, three, two, one. <gasps> Bop, got him. And th th that guy as well. And this one. And this guy. Oh, my days. No, we're losing. We're losing. Come on, Frank. I'm taking him down. <laughs> okay, one second. Let me just catch my breath for a second. And this guy. And three, two, one. That guy. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no. They left me. Guys. Guys, come back here! Where'd you go? Oh, come on. I think we scared them away. I wanted an upgrade. And now the police are after me. I can't hang around. If they catch us, we're going to jail. Grab all the cash. Come on, every dollar. And let's get out of here. Where are they? Have they made it in? No, we're good. We're good. All right, which car do we pick? It's got to go for something fast. I'm going to go for the golden one. We'll take this. Or the red one, actually. Let's go for the red one. It's easier to get out of here with. Which way do we go? Uh, I don't want to go through the entrance, but let's go uh, down this alleyway. Of course. Yeah, this will be an easy way out. Sneaky as well. We'll crash through the gate and get out of here. Duh! Oh, wait. The gate opens. Whoops. <laughs> Sorry, boy. You did have your seatbelt on, right? Yeah, of course you did. All right, straight down here into this alleyway. Whew. Good luck catching us now. So I lost the police, and everything's okay again. Except those guys ran away. I don't know where Simi on Benny or the mechanic is, but I guess there's a chance they may have gone back to their store. Let's find out, because I still want to get my car upgraded. And now I've got my money back, there's nothing stopping me. <laughs> Benny, please tell me you're in. Come on, I literally saved your life. Is he? Oh, no, but my car's still here. Where's Benny? Benny! If my car's here, then clearly he's not going to be here. He would have moved it by now. Workshop, what about upstairs? Oh, wait, those are the builders. Wait, have they done the house already? You have to see this. You have to. Uh, okay. Is it done? Yeah, come on. I think my house is done. Let's go check it out. Benny can wait another time. We'll get the car upgraded. <laughs> I mean, there's lots of potential. And after all, I still got a supercar. It's not all bad. Besides, these guys managed to give me a bunch of supercars. I am paying them a lot of money for that upgrade. And I can't wait to see what they've done. Are you guys ready? <laughs> um, this doesn't look very upgraded. Guys? Hello? Oh, my goodness. What the? Are those? No. What are they doing? Hey! Where's that coming from? Uh, wait, up there? <laughs> what are you doing up there? Come and find out. Come on. Yeah, I'm coming. Uh, I think, yeah, we can drive up there. It's a fast car. It's, it's a little bit steep, but I reckon we'll be fine. I'm coming. Hey, what are you doing? I'd be crazy. Oh, my days. <laughs> Watch out. Don't put this in the water. Oh, oh, that was so close. This car is so expensive. Come here. Yeah, I'm coming. So, what's so interesting about this box? You're not doing what I think you're about to do. Oh, yes. It's gonna be awesome. You're blowing my house up? Really? Why can't you just demolish the place? My neighbors are gonna be so annoyed about this. You did tell them, right? No, but that doesn't matter. Uh, do you wanna press the button? Oh, uh, what do you think? Do you reckon we should? <laughs> like the video if you want me to press the button. Let me just double check. If I press that, my house will explode. Yes. Okay, that does sound pretty awesome. <laughs> Guys, you're gonna need to like the video. I mean, I kinda want this guy to do it because he's the professional. What if I get it wrong? But then again, I'm seeing a lot of likes come in. <laughs> I mean, a lot of likes. Okay, buddy. I'll press the button. I'll get it done. I'm not chickening out of this. <laughs> I've done this before. I blew my house up like several months ago. Whew, here we go. Three, two. I just press this button, right? Hey, why are you on the floor? You're making me really nervous. Should I be getting down? Nah, you'll be fine. <laughs> what? Are you sure? I don't think I'll be fine. Right, let's just... Uh, don't chicken out here. We're blowing the house up. Ooh. There we go. <laughs> so, how long does... Does it take to explode? Uh, any second. Are you sure? Uh, I pressed the button. Surely it would be like straight away, right? Give it a minute. Okay, we can do that. Y you did press the green one, right? Yeah, the, the big green one in the middle. I, I pressed that one. You know what? I'm just going to hide behind something because I really don't trust that guy. <laughs> any second now. Any second. Ah, this is strange. I don't hear any explosion. Maybe you pressed it wrong. Yeah, maybe I did. I'll, I'll try it one more time, okay? I'm gonna press it three times this time. One, 
two, three. There we go. Now hide behind this box very quickly. <laughs> Oh, come on, now this is rigged. Are you sure this even- Whoa! Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> yep, that works all right. That was huge. Okay, we better get back. Guys, that's literally gone into my neighbor's house. If anyone asks, I did not do that, okay? <laughs> Jeez, I can't believe you wanted me to destroy my house. Uh, yes? That was awesome! Well, thanks. I mean, it was basically you, right? I don't know what you're talking about technically. I'll give you a call when it's done. And that's the last I heard from him. All right, I'm getting away. I am leaving this place for good. <laughs> Next time I'm back, my house and shop's house better be upgraded. I gotta admit, that's really giving me a lot of energy for the day. Hey, shop, how about we go to the park? Shop? Hey, boy. Shop? Did I leave him in the house? No, no, I didn't I didn't step foot in that house. It, he wouldn't have gone there. No, he wouldn't have done that. Where is he? Oh, phew. He's not at the house. In fact, he's over at someone else's house. Just around the corner. Interesting. What is he doing there? Maybe I'll be able to spot him from up here. I think the house is just at the bottom of this hill. Yeah, it's that one. And are people screaming? Hey, what's going on? What have you done, Chop? Oh no, guys. I have a feeling Chop's in some sort of trouble. I let him out of my sight for one minute. And this is what he does. I guess this is better than, you know, being stuck inside that house. <laughs> for a second, I genuinely thought we lost him. Ooh, check it out. Looks like there's quite a few people here as well. Some sort of party, maybe? <laughs> Oh, wait. I know exactly why Chop's here. I can smell a barbecue. The best smell in the entire world. Okay, everyone, I'm really sorry for my dog. I know he's... Oh, man, what have you done? You've ruined the party, Chop. Look at this. Guys, I'm really sorry. No, 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 no. You, you don't. Don't do anything. Come on, Chop. We're leaving. And we are never coming back to this house again. I'm really sorry. Here, take $100 for the barbecue or something. Come on, Chop. I'm really disappointed in you, boy. The next time we go to the park, you can forget it. All right, you're grounded for two weeks. I hope you like the burger. Yeah, unbelievable. Hey, look who it is. Benny's calling me. Finally, it's about time. You wanted an upgrade? Yeah, Benny, I do. I got the money, I got the car. Can I please get an upgrade now? Yeah, sure thing. Swing by anytime. Sweet. I finally get the car upgrade I want. <laughs> yeah. Come on, shop, we're going. I got my eyes on you, boy. No more messing around, all right? Benny's a serious guy. He's cool. Hey, what's up, Benny? So, uh, what do you think of my car? Oh, he wants me to come over there. Okay. So, <laughs> I was thinking a really cool upgrade. Oh, that's just my dog. Come on in, Chop. Come on. It's cool. Hey, listen. I want to thank you for earlier, so uh, I'll do this upgrade for free. Yes, please. I'd love that. <laughs> do whatever you want. I mean, just go crazy. As long as this car looks better than, you know, it is now, then I'm happy. Hey, you got it, bro. Whoa. This is awesome. <laughs> Thank you so much, man. This is free. He made it gold. He added all the modifications on. Oh, he's getting in as well. All right, so are we hanging out now, Benny? Yeah, sure thing. Why not? Yeah, sure. <laughs> Why not? Hey, that's them. That's the builders. Is the house done? Yeah, it's done. Hey, come on. Take a look. Okay, I'm on my way. They've done the house. That was super quick. Are you going to keep that in your mouth the entire time? I mean, it looks pristine. You haven't even eaten the burger yet. Anyway, it's not my problem. My problem right now is getting home. Because my house has been upgraded, Chop's house has been upgraded, and my car has finally been upgraded. Hey, careful with the driving. I put a lot of effort into this. Oh, yeah. Sorry, Benny. <laughs> I'll try my best. Welcome to Franklin and Chop's house upgrades. <laughs> they gave me a tank. Oh! Awesome. Okay, I want to check out the garden. So this looks like Franklin's part of the house. Hey, bro, this is crazy. Is this where you live? Yeah, th well, th this, is, this is now where I live. It, <laughs> it didn't look like this this morning. Feel free to move in, Benny. If you upgrade my cars, then you can stay here as long as you want. But let's take a look in the garden. I'll go upstairs afterwards, but I want to see what they've done to Chop's kennel. What have they done to his kennel? <laughs> uh, wait, it looks the same. Hmm, are you sure they upgraded it? Oh, wait a minute, guys. I think they did. No way. Have they given Chop an actual house? Are you crazy? I gotta look inside. So there's a boulder in the path. They really ought to move that. But apart from that, welcome to Chop's house. 
Wow, it's got a Christmas tree. There's pizza, there's burgers, there's fries. Have you guys seen this? There's so many more burgers on the floor. <laughs> Shop, you are literally living in the house of your dreams now. There's a hot tub, jacuzzi. I know Chop loves hot tubs. And is this what I think it is? Yep, we got a balcony. Check it out. Chop has his very own balcony. I am so jealous. And his own barbecue. Yeah, he's gonna be happy about this. So, Chop's got a good deal out of this. And it looks like we have too, because I haven't actually seen much in my house. So, let's go inside and check it out. From the sky, it looks massive. And they gave me a helicopter. So, believe it or not, I am on my roof. Right there is above my garage. I got a hot tub, sofa, outdoor TV, because why not, you know? <laughs> I hope it's waterproof. But down here, is my very own office and my lounge. How awesome is that? I still can't get over the fact they've given Chop an actual house. <laughs> like, that's crazy. But you know what else is crazy? Like a hundred different supercars. This is amazing. And there's another layer above me and below me as well. But this is my garage upstairs. I am now at the tippity top of my uh, house upgrade. I'm pretty sure there's a helipad up there as well. How do I get up there? Is there like a staircase or a ladder or something? I kind of want to get to the helicopter. Maybe we'll get better luck downstairs. Let's take a look. After all, I haven't even seen the garage down here. And, ooh, they gave me loads of bikes. <laughs> I haven't ridden a bike in ages. All right, let's see. Which one do I want to go for? Let's go for the yellow one. And we'll go searching for a lift so I can finally get to my helicopter. For $90 million, these guys have done well. <laughs> I mean, my house has totally been transformed. If I had to guess, the lift's got to be in my actual house, right? I mean, this still looks pretty much the same. What about down? Down here. Oh, no way. <laughs> They've changed one of my rooms into an actual elevator. All right, get in. And finally, I've made it to the roof. <laughs> well, this is the best house upgrade ever. Not only did we upgrade Franklin's house, but we did a pretty awesome upgrade to Chop's house as well. It doesn't really get any better than that. He's even got a swimming pool next to it. I mean, we basically share the same pool now. Both Franklin and Chop are missing. I've looked for them everywhere. I've been to Denise's, Simeon's, even the radio station and still nothing and to make matters worse i can't even play as them either look at this he's blacked out i'm getting really concerned because he literally got his house upgraded the other day and all of his cars have disappeared he spent so much money on that house you don't even want to know how much it costs but i need your help i've tried everything i can to find them but i still haven't found anything so i'm gonna go around his house one more time and hopefully find something literally anything we can use which might help us find him check this out guys he literally vanished off the face of the earth. Nothing has been touched. All of the chairs are still normal. There's bottles on the table. Even the laptop's still there. I mean, this is crazy. It's like no one has even been inside the house. Even all of Chop's food is still there. Part of me thinks that they just up and left. But then again, why would they do that when they spend so much money on their house? It was millions of dollars. Wait a second. I've got an idea. What if I use the phone? Maybe there's some voice messages on there. Hey, this is your neighbor here. I can can you tell your dog to be quiet? It's two in the morning and my wife is trying to sleep. Uh, okay, maybe his neighbor did it. I mean, he's annoyed at Chop for barking at two in the morning. That is pretty annoying, to be honest. Any other messages? Hey, it's your neighbor. Your dog's been barking for an hour now. Do I have to call the police? Man, his neighbor's really annoyed. Chop's been barking for an hour. You know what I'm thinking? I think it's the neighbor. Let's go and pay them a little visit. I mean, think about it. You've just had your house upgraded. You're throwing a party. Your dog's barking all night. That makes a lot of sense. All right, we're going to try the doorbell first. And if they open up, then we'll find out ourselves. If they don't, I'll find a way to break in. What a nice house, too. I mean, you sure you can hear Chop barking? I mean, those walls are pretty thick. You have stone walls. All right, polite. Ding dong. Open up. Ah, they're not opening the door. Okay, one second. Let me try the other side. I'm going to break in through the back. This feels really sus. You know what I'm thinking? I think the neighbor actually did it. Ooh, wait a second. Can I look through there? Uh, no, nah, barely. It's pretty dark in that room. But at least there's plenty of windows I can break in through. All right, here we go. I'm going to use... Let's see. What have I got? Oh, a hammer. This will do the trick. Uh, bam! Ooh, what a nice place you got. Wow. That's a massive bed. I'm just saying, that is huge. Okay, let's take a look. Hello, Franklin, jump. It's only me. Better crouch. Last thing I want to do is load anybody. It's empty. Okay, maybe they're upstairs. <sighs> this is so confusing. Guys, are you in here or what? Come on. Okay, maybe his neighbor didn't have anything to do with this. But if his neighbor didn't do this, then who did? Come on, let's go back to his house. Maybe we missed some clues. And whilst I walk back to 
the house. Did you know that something strange happens if you press the subscribe button below? Give it a go and let me know what it is. Is it strange? Hmm. Did we miss anything? Uh, were there any more voicemails? I didn't actually check if that was the last one. Hey, this is Lily. I'm looking forward to our date tonight at the Bahama Mama's Club. See you there. Wait, he had a date? When was that sent? Message received 18 hours ago. 18 hours ago? Th that means it was sent last night at 6 p.m. That must have been just before the date. Okay, well, Franklin was meeting up with someone who was called Lily. It appears to be the last person he may have ever seen. And they were meeting at the Bahama Mama's Club. We got the place, we got the person. Now all we need is the proof. Let's go. I really hope they're okay. If I find out something bad's happened to them, we may just have to move into their house. I know, it's horrible. <laughs> Oh, but seriously, though, that house is huge! So, welcome to the Bahama Mama's Club. 240 people can go inside, and it's empty. Alright, looks like this place isn't so lively in the day. Maybe we can find some answers through him. Hey, man! Sorry, we're closed! Uh-oh, don't worry, I'm not here to buy anything. I just want to ask a few questions. I'm looking for a friend. He was here last night with a dog. I think he was meeting up with a lady or something. Yeah, I remember that guy. He didn't pay for his drink. Yep, that sounds about right. Franklin and Chuck get up to quite a bit of trouble when they're together. Yeah, he left through the back. Snuck out with a lady or whatever. So, apparently Franklin left through the back of this club. That's strange. Why would he do that? Hold on. Is that his car? I gotta check this out. There's someone's car in the back parking lot. And it looks like Franklin's. His name's on the number plates. No way. Franklin's car is still here. This is really strange. It's not like him at all. Is there anyone inside? Maybe he's in the car. He could have slept in here. Franklin! What about the trunk? It is locked, but maybe we can try and pick this open. Got it. Now, oh man, there's no one in there. Come on. So we have Franklin's car in the parking lot of the club. Oh, Franklin's not home. He didn't get a taxi. Why would he leave his car here? Hey, wait a minute, guys. I think I found something else. That looks like Franklin's phone. Oh my days. Look at this. Help. I don't feel so good. Huh? Guys, he tried to send that to Lamar last night. It's unsent. Right, that's it. We're calling the police. I'm really nervous. These guys are taking it really seriously. They're taking photos of everything. From the bins to the door to even the car. And they got three people taking photos of the car. Wait, what's this guy looking at? Is he just taking photos of a garage door? No, it's the wall. What's on the wall? This is crazy. I actually think something really bad might have happened to them. And if that's the case, I need to find them. Or else we may never play as them again. I may never see Chop again. I don't know who I'm missing more right now, Franklin or Chop, to be honest. But they're both gone. Hey, are you Michael? Uh, yep, that's me. Have you guys found something? Please tell me you have. Yeah, we grabbed these photos from the cameras. Oh my days. That's Franklin. And that's Chop. That's not his car. Did someone take him? We believe so. But we don't know who. What do you mean you don't know who? There's cameras everywhere. Look, there's one there. There's, there's another one there. Are you sure you didn't get a photo? I mean, they, they would be walking across the car park. They were in the club. We Checked every tape. Can't see a thing. Wow. Whoever took them must be really good. We don't know who did this, but I'm pretty sure it was Lily, the person on the voicemail. I mean, who else would it be? That's who he was meeting. It's not over yet. We did do something. Oh, yeah. Tell me the good news, please. I need to find my friend and shop again. Do you have any idea how boring this game will be if I don't get to play as Franklin anytime soon? He's the coolest guy ever. We tracked their registration and got an address. We found them. Let's go. So you thought to tell me that last and not at the start. Well, it looks like whoever this is clearly isn't pro enough because they... <laughs> they left their registration right in the line of sight of cameras. Wow, they're so stupid. Come on, let's get them. But on the bright side, at least we know they're both okay, I guess. I mean, they were alive in those photos, so if they were going to take him out, they would have done it straight away in the car park. I don't believe this. Lester Crest is the one who took Franklin and Chuck. Are you kidding me? Why would he do that? Okay, I'm going in. You guys can stay outside. Be my backup, all right? I'll shout if I need you. I know who Lester is, and he's not that dangerous. And if he's got Franklin and Chop, I'm getting them back now. Nah, oh, wait, are you sleeping? He's snoring, and he's snoring really loud. Seriously, Lester? Man, he's the worst person for this job. All right, come on, guys. It's safe. You can come out now. Where are they? This is so weird. Hey, Lester, come on. Get up. I won't ask again, Lester. I said get up now. Ah, ah, yeah, I'm, I'm awake. Wow, Michael. Uh, what, a, what a lovely surprise. Eh? Yeah, what a lovely surprise. A surprise I didn't want to have to do today. Where are they, Lester? Where are they? Uh, where are who? Uh, 
Uh, you gotta be specific. Franklin and Chop, where are they, Lester? We tracked a car down to your house. We know you're the one who took him last night. Uh, what? Hey, what are you talking about? No, this is a big mistake. I'll show you a big mistake, Lester. It's taking you out before the police come in, who are right outside. Uh, let me explain. <laughs> Come on, come outside! Come on, Lester, come outside. I want you to explain to me where they are. S somebody took my license plate last night. I, I promise, it wasn't me! Oh, what? Really? Someone took his license plate? Of course they did. Well, that would explain why... We've gone to Lester's house. The registration does belong to him. Someone took the plate from him. Who would want to set you up? That's a very vague question. Everybody would want to set me up, Michael. Everyone! Well... Took his license plates. This doesn't exactly get us anywhere. Have you got any cameras like that one? It's literally pointing at the car. No, it doesn't work. It's just to scare people off. <sighs> okay, I'm taking a look around. If someone took the license plate, maybe there's a few clues which might lead us to the person who did it. What's that? Another license plate. That's the same name from the voicemail on Franklin's phone. I think whoever took the license plate ditched theirs at Lester's bin. Are you serious? You seem so clever that you've done this. Hey, officers, I found something. You're gonna wanna bag this. Oh, wow, good find. Hey, Lester's innocent, boys. Oh, we almost had him, boss. Yeah, back off. I'm innocent. Back off. This number plate, it doesn't have a number. What do we do? Not to worry. I've got an idea. This plate's custom, which means it's not even registered to anyone, so we can't find out who this Lily is. But I know how we can find them. There's only one place in this world that does custom number plates. Let's go and ask them a few questions to Los Santos Customs, the only place in GTA 5 that does custom plates when you want them. Hey man, I heard you do custom plates. Yeah, it's 500 bucks. What do you want? See what I say. Anyway, I'm not here for custom plates. I'm here to find some answers. You see this registration plate? It says Lily with a one. Yeah, I recognize that. I did it the other day. Great. Well, you know exactly who owns this car then. I do, but it's gonna cost you. All right, I'm really losing my patience. 100 bucks. All right, fine. Here's 100 bucks. Now give me everything you know about this person. Now. I got her address. I got her name. I got her date of birth. Even got a phone number. What do you want? I want all of it. Give me all of it now. And just like that, I have all the details I need. Lily, you're going down because this, <laughs> this is over. This isn't a house. It's an auto parts store. What's going on? We better investigate. You never know. There could still be something, a clue. We can't leave here until we find one. Hold up. There are cars from Franklin's house. There's even more. Of them. There's even more of them. They're everywhere. Th these are the cars. These are the exact ones. Okay, we we've definitely found her. This is where she is. It might be an auto parts store, but maybe she lives here. Who knows? You wouldn't just leave loads of cars here if you weren't close by. And that's the exact same one. That's the one from the cameras. Right, that's it. I'm going inside and no one's stopping me. Okay, Michael, get ready. We found her. Three, two, one. Open up. I think it might be empty. Let's take a look around just in case. Last thing I want to do is get taken out from behind. Behind. Yeah, you never know what could happen. Okay, we're checking up the stairs. What's through here? Oh my days, there's a bed. She must have been sleeping here all this time. She doesn't have a house. That makes sense. This is where she lives and she's not here. Wait a minute. That's Chop. I didn't even notice you, boy. Chop, I am so glad you're okay. I gotta get you out of this cage. All right, stand back. Three, two, one. I am so glad to see you. Come on, get out. It's safe. You're okay. Who's a good boy? I, I would give you a snack or a treat, but I ain't got nothing on me, Chop. I'm really sorry, but at least you're okay. Hey, what have you found there, officer? Is there anything? Oh, my days. Do you guys see that? That's on the floor. Literally right next to the cage. I am so glad I found you right now. I found fingerprints on it. And you'll never guess who I found. I think I'll guess pretty easily. <laughs> Let me guess. It's the person we've been chasing all this time. No. Come on, let's go. Okay, right. I'm moving with you guys. Show me who it is. Shop. I, I, I haven't got any treats. Okay, don't. Oh, man, he keeps barking at me. I'll find some treats on the way. I feel so bad. It must have been ages since the last date. Trevor Phillips? Are you serious? We've been chasing the wrong person all this time? Why would Trevor do this? We're all friends. Can we talk this out for a minute? No, Trevor. You're going to jail. But I haven't done anything. I just, uh... uh don't look behind me. Don't look behind you? What, what, what's behind you? What's all this stuff you got here, Trevor? Why wouldn't you want us to look behind you, huh? Oh, wait. 
Oh, you're not allowed to do this. Says who? Uh, says a lot of people, Trevor. Are you selling these things to other people? Yes, I mean, no. Tell me the truth, Trevor. Are you selling these things to other people? Come on, you can trust me. I'm a friend. I won't tell the other officers, all right? I'm <laughs> I just want to find Franklin. What happened to Franklin? Someone took him, Trevor. And your prints are all over something they used. Now, do you recognize the name Lily? Yeah, uh, she, she was here yesterday. She, she bought a few things. Why? Well, that explains why your prints are all over. <sighs> Guys, he sold it to her. We're still going after the same person. I don't know where she is. No job. I'm... He really, he's really hungry. Chop, it's okay. I'll get you some treats. What's he doing over there? Guys, he's walking away. Oh, man, maybe Chop's been trying to tell us all this time, and he's finally decided to walk away and find him himself. Okay, Chop, you've got my attention. Where did they go? This is gonna take a while, but if it takes us straight to Franklin, then <laughs> it's gonna be worth it. I just hope he knows what he's doing. No way. Chop took me to the scrapyard. Franklin and him were here the other day when they were rescuing some people. Did they take Franklin? Oh, this is making so much sense. I think Lily, this person who took him, might be working for the same people who took all of the mechanics, Simeon, Benny, literally everyone the other day, and Franklin and Chop sabotaged their plan. I don't believe this. This is their way of getting revenge. They were literally right here. I remember this. But there's no one here now, boy. Unless Franklin is hide up somewhere. Franklin, not under the stairs. Hmm, is he in the bins? I mean, that would be a weird place to put him. Nope, the bins are empty. Well, that's a good sign. He's not in the bins. What about in this container? Ooh, ah, man, he's not in here either. I thought we would find him in here. But there are some bags of money. This might belong to Franklin himself. He had a little bit on him before. I just got a couple of million dollars. They had it inside the container. That's gotta be from Franklin. All right, well, Chop, they're not here. I've searched everywhere and Franklin's not here and no one's here. It's totally empty. No, wait, come back. Come back, boy. Where are you going now? Okay, I think Charles picked up something else. Maybe they were there. Franklin's money was there, so that would make sense. Where are you going now? I don't want anything happening to you, Chop, all right? Chop, are you okay? Please tell me you're okay. Oh, Oh, you had me so scared. I thought something happened to you. The moment I said, don't let anything... Oh, my goodness. Ow. 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 That hurts way more. Ah, come on. Surely we would have learned from that by now, Michael, not to jump down there. Where are we going to, boy? Why are we in the sewers? We've completely left the police at this point, by the way. I am following Chop. The police don't seem to believe this. They're, they're following their clues. In fact, I don't know what they're doing. Hey, come on. I got a close today. Hey, come on. Don't rush me. I want to pick something good. They're all good. Just take something. Wait, here we go. He's going. Amazing. He picked up something. I just hope it wasn't a hot dog or a hamburger. Come on. Are you serious? Franklin's in the sewers? Hey, hey wait up, Chop. It, it, it's not exactly nice down here. Watch out for the moss. Don't want to slip on that. Are you kidding me? Franklin's in the sewers? What is it? What is it? Come on. You really mess with the wrong people if they put him in the sewers. Out of all the places. Oh my days. That's not usually there. Someone has fenced up this pipe and Chop is standing right next to it. Oh, crack. Perfect. Wait a minute. Let me get a closer look at this. Franklin? That's Franklin. Hold on. Someone else is in there with him. I think that's the person who took him. How do I get in there? They blocked it off. All right, you know what I'm doing? I'm taking this down myself. Chop, stand back. <laughs> this is gonna be big. Boom. Hey, what do you know? It works. I'm Franklin. You're okay, buddy. Let me get it. <laughs> oh, my days. Are you... I think she might have... Are you okay, Franklin? Oh, man, that was close. I think she accidentally shot him, but he's okay. <laughs> I'm so glad to have found you. Thanks, man. I thought I was a goner. Well, you're not today, Franklin. You got an amazing house to go back to, and I found all of your cars. Oh, by the way, I also got Chop as well. You can thank him later. He's the only reason why I even found you. Come on, let's go. Man, it's good to be back. I'm never gonna forget this, Michael. You are the best. This is the biggest dam in GTA 5. It holds thousands of tons of water and today we're going to blow it up and when i press this button the entire thing will go boom what do you think chop it's gonna be a pretty big explosion right <laughs> yeah. now i'm not doing this for fun well actually maybe a little bit of fun i have a plan and i've been working on this for a while now because when we blow the dam up and flood the entire city the water's gonna go into the sewers underground and we're gonna pump it back out of the sewers at franklin's house and make a lakeside villa of the place we're gonna have our own private beach in our back garden all right 
Ooh, I am so nervous right now. I'm just like full of excitement. <laughs> okay. All right. We press this button. The whole thing will explode. Is it connected? Oh, phew. All right. It's actually connected this time. The amount of times we've done this and it hasn't done anything is actually crazy. Okay. Here we go. Bring the hands up. Anybody around us? No, we're good. All right. Let's do this. Three, two, one. Hey, why didn't it explode? That's really strange. Did the Y get wet or something? I mean, we are trying to blow this up. There's lots of water around. What do you think, boy? Do you smell anything suspicious? Maybe the button's stuck. That's always possible, right? Let's try this again. Nothing happened. It, it didn't explode. Oh, that's really weird. Hey, Chop, do you want to give it a go? All you got to do is press that button. Why isn't it exploding? Oh, 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 there we go. <laughs> we got it good. Must have been delayed or something. Go get up, frankly. Get up. I can hear the police. They're already coming. That has to be one of the craziest things I've done. We literally just caused a tsunami. <laughs> well, speaking of which, there is that tsunami. It's still really shallow, huh? No, it, it, it should be like flooded over there. Well, why is it not flooded? That's literally the exact same. Nothing has changed. They still got a beach in the middle of that thing. How is that possible? Oh no. Are you kidding me? It didn't break. And uh, what's going on here? How did they get here so quickly? They're already doing repairs. There's cranes. There's a helicopter. And I'm pretty sure that belongs to the FIB. Are you for real? How no, it's only been like 10 seconds. Did we even scratch the dam? Okay, a few bricks fell down from it. That's literally all we've done. That, oh, wait, we got a few leaks as well. Are you kidding me? I thought we did this. Bad news, Chop. The party's gonna have to wait. We need to get more explosives. Any minute now, this truck is gonna be driving along this road. And in the back is gonna be all the explosives we need. Do -do 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 Hey, I don't see the truck. Hey, Chop, get down there on the road. I, I just want to make sure our plan works. We chop in the road. When the truck arrives, it'll have no choice but to stop. And that's where we come in. Take the truck, get the explosives, blow the dam up. And whilst we wait for this truck, did you know that really weird things have been happening to my videos lately if you press the subscribe button? So can you give it a go and let me know if something strange happened? Did anything strange happen? Oh, no, it did, didn't it? Let me know what it is in the comments. You good down there, boy? Oh, he's good. Uh, he's the best dog in the world. All right, where's this? Oh, my days. There's the truck. That's literally the right truck. Franklin, get ready for this. Get ready for this, Chop. Hold on, buddy. You're gonna be... Chop? Oh, my days. You ran into my dog. Oh, my days. This was not supposed to happen. Franklin, get up, buddy. Chop, please tell me you're okay, boy. Oh, no, I don't think he is. Chop, wake up, boy. This is so bad. Why did he go into him? Guys, we've lost Chop all of this because I wanted to blow the dam up. This is the stupidest idea we've ever had. Oh, yes, he's okay. I thought I lost you, boy. Oh, that was a close one. Right, let's get that truck. That guy's so paying. And it looks like he stopped at a red light. New position. There's the truck. We're gonna take out the driver. After all, he went in to chop out day. Three, two, one. Boom! No, I think he's got bulletproof glass. Come on, again. Are you serious? Oh, no, I keep missing. Come on. I literally got one perfect shot and it did nothing. They must have bulletproof glass on that truck. Right, that's it. Time for plan C. We use our own vehicle to knock him off the road. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. This has to work. And if it doesn't, then we're out of luck. This is the last plan. All right, which way are you going? Is he going to follow the road? I think he's going to follow the road. Okay, that's it. Oh, no. He's, I think he's seen me. Okay, he's trying to throw me off. Yeah, nice try, buddy. Nice try. I think we're going to have to get some speed for this. You see that gap there? We're going straight into the side of this truck when he reaches the gap. Hey, come on. Go. Okay. <laughs> Almost! Oh, so close! No, 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 don't drive away! No, okay, guys, we haven't got many chances left. Our military base is literally right there. What do we do? Do I go for the side again? Do I try and go for the front? All I know is I need to get some speed. Here goes nothing. Straight into the side of the truck. Get him! Ah, <laughs> uh, no, 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 no. You ain't moving anywhere. All right, you reckon now's the chance? I think now's the chance. We're gonna try and get him. All right, get out of the truck. Get out of the truck now. The truck is mine. Get out of the truck, you ran over, chop. How dare you? Nice. <laughs> Stay down there and stay out. Actually, I come on up this. We're taking you down. He tried to take me out. How dare he? Well, it looks like we finally got the truck. This dam is going to be broken after all. <laughs> all right, let's open up the doors and see what we got inside. This is military grade, remember, guys. This ain't no play in the park. It's a serious stuff. <sighs> Okay, the doors are locked. They're really tightly locked as well. 
Man, we'd get the keys. Unless I can open it from the front. Maybe this guy had the keys on him, actually. Let's take a look. Hey, buddy, did you get the keys? Ah, he did. <laughs> okay, perfect. Ah, where was I? Oh, yeah, opening the door. All right, use the keys. There we go. And let's take a look inside. Huh? Huh? It's got to be some sort of mistake. Wait a minute. That, that doesn't make sense. I... I... Uh, this was the same truck I took yesterday. I got some highly flammable things to deliver. You know what I mean? Yeah, come on in. You're right on time. Oh, no. You've got to be kidding me. That was the truck we were after. This one was empty. I didn't know they have empty trucks. <sighs> Man, it's too late to get that one. It's already in the military base. But I got a plan. Me and Chop worked for the military the other day. We were given millions of dollars. It's the reason why we even upgraded our house. So maybe they know us, you know, we got some good recommendations going. I reckon saying the right things, we could try and sneak in there and leave with that truck and everything inside. Not so fast. Ah, oh, I had to put the barrier down. Hey, yeah, sorry about my car. We, we, we had a crash on the way, but, uh, yo, Joe, man, I missed you, man. <laughs> What's it like in there? I can still see the truck. It's right at the end of the bridge. This is so frustrating. Um, I'm doing good. Yo, how are you? I, I, I'm, I'm doing great as well, Joe. Y you know, I just, I left something of mine in the base. You know, when we were working there the other day, I just really need to go inside and get it. Can you just let me in, Joe? No. Oh, come on. I thought we were friends. The base is a restricted area. You're not allowed inside. You know that, Frank. Oh, come on, Joe. I'm your friend. I, I, I saved your life the other day. I'm pretty sure I did. Hey, you're putting me in a tricky situation, man. I'm not letting you in. Fine. All right, he's not going to let me get to the base. I see how it is. Looks like we got to find another way in then because this guy is not being my friend anymore. Come on, shop. We're leaving. Don't expect a Christmas card from me, Joe. Uh, I don't think I've got one yet. Oh, how can he hear me? Oh, yeah, the window smashed, of course. All right, well, let's get out of here. I need to figure out a plan to get inside that base. Hey, when did they build this thing here? There's a tower right outside. Okay, we'll use this, do some spying, and see what we can find. That's the exact truck we're looking for, and look behind it. That's it. That's what we want. I don't think I've used one of those on the dam, but if I remember correctly, I need to zoom in a bit more. Hey, use your binoculars. I knew it. That's the biggest device in the entire world. We use that on the dam. It's gonna blow the entire thing into 20 million pieces. Hey, what are you doing? Oh, my days. Wait, I think I've been... Oh, no, I have. They've seen me. Hey, I'm sorry, bro. <laughs> I need the uniform. Thank you. Looks like we got our way in. What do you think? Do you reckon we'll pass? I think we will. <laughs> yeah. Thanks, buddy. You have just saved my day. The moment of truth. Oh, better put this thing away. Don't want to. Oh, no, no, don't, don't put that out. Don't. <laughs> Franklin, just walk straight, okay? Don't want to scare this guy. Hey, I'm sorry I'm late. I was just out to get some coffee. Do you want to come in? Yeah, yeah, I would love to. Th thanks. Uh, appreciate it. <laughs> so I didn't even need to do an excuse. He just let me in anyway. Oh, no, it's not here. And it's empty. Hey, uh, excuse me. Do you know where the, uh, the thing went? There was a problem with it. Kind of needs to be fixed. <laughs> You know what I mean. Check the elevator. We just loaded the map. Thanks. Thanks. Uh, should I tell anyone? No, 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 no. It's fine. Honestly, it's absolutely fine. So they loaded them into the elevator. That's quite a tight squeeze. How do they fit this thing in there? Whoa, check it out. I'm in one of the most restricted parts of the base. And nobody knows. <laughs> Shh. I can hear someone this way. We're close. We're really close. Let's just act natural, Franklin. We belong here, remember? I'm, I'm not trying to... Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> we fell down the stairs. We're not trying to fool anybody. I do believe long here. I've got the uniform. Hey, gentlemen, I'm just, I'm just here to pick up a few things. The, uh, commander wants to see you, by the way. Pretty important stuff. I think they're about to deploy somewhere. What's this guy doing? Is that generator okay? Uh, what does the commander want us to do? Uh, I don't know. That's why you need to go up there now and find out yourself. That's an unusual request. He never wants us to go anywhere but here. Well, it's the request he really wanted to make. Don't worth now, Chop. Was that a dog? No, no, it was not a dog. Okay, it was a dog. We got some training we're trying to do. The dog needs to sniff out dangerous things like these, you know? So can you please just go to the commander? He wants to see you guys. Fine, I don't like dogs. Great, dogs don't like you. Now go. Next time, don't blow my cover, please. I didn't need your help anyway. I had this. Hold on, stand 100,000 meters away? I'm pretty sure that's meters and not miles, right? I mean, how big are these things? Okay, maybe that's a little bit too much. Uh, we don't need to... 
It's something that's gonna ask us to stand a hundred thousand meters away. That's like a hundred kilometers away. We're not doing that. No, 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 no. What about this? A hundred meters away. We used those on the dam before. It didn't break the dam. Stand 10,000 meters away. You know what? That's a good compromise. This? This'll do. And we can fit it in a bag. And it's not as powerful as that. I don't want to destroy the entire world, okay? I, I, I still want to, you know, do stuff in this world. We're just gonna walk out of here nice and calmly. Is that the siren? Are you kidding me? I triggered the alarm. All right, we better run now. Go, 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 go. No, I can hear them. I think they're coming down the stairs. Stop right there. Okay, officers, you got me. <laughs> this sucks. Give me the bag carefully and follow us. No, 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 no. This is the last place I wanted to be. Man, I'm stuck in jail. I don't even know where I am. I haven't been here before. Where's Chop? Why can't I get Chop? Who's a good dog? Yeah, you were. How would you like to join the army again? You do realize that they tried to take something dangerous and you want to let him back in? He's just so adorable. Don't listen to the mean man. Are you kidding me? They put me in jail and they didn't put Chop in here? Chop is out there having the time of his life. Well, it's a good job I can play as him. Playtime's over, everybody. Oh my days, they're kicking me. Come on, Chop, get them. <laughs> and this guy, yeah. <laughs> Whoa, that was super duper easy. Okay, let's go and get Franklin out. Franklin, <laughs> I have the keys. Are you in there? There you are, Franklin. Wow, look who's in jail. Huh? I can't believe they did not put Chop in there. Can you believe it? I can't. We don't tell anyone about this, all right? Boy, this is embarrassing enough. Now, how do we get out of here? I'm not hanging around. We're leaving this place as fast as we can. What? What? Where am I? This is insane. Okay, run, 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 run before anyone notices what we've done. This is so crazy. You know what? I think I'll take the lift this time. I am 10 floors down. Come on, open, open, and get me to the top. Finally, we're out of here. <laughs> and no one even knows what we've done yet. We better be quick. Hey. Uh oh, no. No, no, no. Hey, uh, what's up? Did you find what you needed? Yeah, everything's fine. Oh, good. Uh, for a minute, I thought I had to go home early. Oh, uh, no, don't, don't worry. You gotta stay here for the day. <laughs> okay, I just, I gotta leave. Wow, you're in a rush. Oh, what's up? Uh, nothing, nothing. I just gotta get out of here. I'm just, I'm taking a plane. You know what? That, that's the best option here. We're taking a plane and we're leaving. Ah, oh, perfect. And I don't think there's anyone in here. All right, no, Chop, don't get him. Don't, don't. <laughs> for a second, I thought Chop was gonna get him. <laughs> Chop, get in now! All right, you're gonna want to move from the runaway. Ooh, I really thought I was gonna go into him. All right, let's do this. Three, two, one, and we have takeoff. We are out of the base, and no one knows what we've done. They're gonna regret that. This is giving me an idea. I might have something which will break the dam, but I think I have something else. What if I fly this into it too? I want to make sure whatever we do, that dam breaks. Line it up. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. And bail! Now, come on, Chop! We're leaving. Franklin, come on, leave now. Oh, my days. This is insane. Oh, no. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> it's still there. How is it still there? Oh, even the fire brigade have come out. Yo, you guys are quick. I would leave right now because the job ain't done. Even one of the engines came off. Can you believe it? Whoa. <laughs> All right, guys. Seriously, seriously. Clear the area because this is going to be huge. There we go. It's down and it's ticking. It's ticking. All right, run, run, run. I need to get to 10,000 meters away. How are we going to do that so quickly? I don't know how long the fuse is, but uh, we're going to find out pretty soon, either in a really bad way or in a not so bad way. <laughs> Come on, run, Franklin, run. We have not stopped running. We are literally in Los Santos now. I don't know if this is 10,000 meters. I'm just going to say it's not and keep running until that thing explodes. Like, what if we destroy the entire of Los Santos? What happens then? My house will be gone. <laughs> I can't afford that to happen. We have the best house upgrades ever. Catch up, jump, catch up. Good job. All right, I got an idea. Wait, no, actually, don't go down there. There's gonna be a big tsunami down there. <laughs> we gotta go somewhere higher up, actually. That's an even better idea. Go somewhere really high up where the water won't get us. Don't! Whoa! <laughs> Are we alive? We're okay! Uh, we're not gonna be okay for long. I can hear the water. It's coming down. Quick, get somewhere high up! <laughs> now! <laughs> we got to the perfect spot. Hey, if we didn't go up to this park, we would be down there in the water. We might have even been swept up. Okay, we've done a little bit of flooding. It caused a little bit of a tsunami, but this is perfect. This isn't our goal, by the way. Our goal is even better than this. Now we've flooded the area, I'm gonna pump it to my house through the sewer system. It's pretty crazy what I got set up. Man, any deeper and it would have cut off this entire neighborhood. <laughs> hey, I kind of want to go for a quick swim. How deep is this exactly? Whoa. 
Whoa, this is the drain. Wow, I am swimming in the drain. This is kind of gross. Maybe we shouldn't do that. <laughs> Come on, let's go home. This water ain't gonna be here forever. So, this won't be too tricky. We just gotta open this drain up. Oh my days. <laughs> this is gonna be crazy. <laughs> Wait, it's coming up from there and there and there. This entire street is getting filled up. Are you ready to have your mind blown? We've just upgraded our house again, completely knocking this one out of the park. And this one is still amazing. Come on, let me show you around. So up there is Franklin's first house upgrade. And down there is Chop's house upgrade. And here is my very own private beach upgrade. <laughs> I think it was worth it. I mean, uh, yeah, we may have flooded the entire city. But come on, check it out. This is my garden now. I even got yachts and boats. You could play a little bit of snooker or jump over the fence onto my little beach. And then jump onto the decking over here. You can walk along this. You can look out at the beautiful view. Or you can see what he's got to offer. I built this the other day and I was just waiting for a little bit of water to lift it up. There's bars, there's studios, there's even a concert area. Like, check it out, guys. You see that thing over there? That's where we get to do concerts. I'm gonna have one every single night. I could have lobster for breakfast, burgers for lunch, and pizza for dinner. This is a dream. So, let's use it like it's meant to be used and do this jump. Yeet! Whoa! <laughs> don't go over there. You don't want to do that, guys. There is a massive drop all the way back down. If you want a bit of privacy, then welcome to the private island I built in my garden. Oh, my neighbors. Of course, I forgot about those guys. Yeah, you gotta see this, by the way. You wanna know what happened to them? We bought them out. That's right. We flooded their houses. <laughs> What are they gonna do, eh? They, they moved out. You know you're a boss when you can do this in GTA 5. Like, I just flooded the entire street because I wanted to. We're on a secret mission, but don't tell anyone. We could get into a lot of trouble. The other day, Chop and I discovered a secret base under Fort Sancudo, and inside were tunnels, rooms, and places I'd never seen before. We only popped in for something. I needed to blow the dam up so I could turn my entire house into a water park. <laughs> mission succeeded. <laughs> but when I was down there, I realized there's a lot more that meets the eye, and you'll never guess what I found. So that's right, money trucks. Not one, not two, not three, a fleet of them. And they're heading straight down the road. This mysterious entrance, and this can mean only one thing. There is a super vault under Fort Sancudo containing gold, gold, and lots of gold. I know it's not gonna be easy, which is why we did some training this morning. We played fetch, you know, to get his stamina up. But then I wanted to step things up a little bit and see how Chop would do when he goes after somebody else. That's my boy. Good work. And then we did more stamina and practiced our driving. You know, see how fast we could get away from the police. And you know what happens? We lost the police in record time, which can only mean one thing. We are ready for the mission, which remember is a top secret mission. I don't want any of you guys leaking this to anyone. All right. In fact, to make sure I can trust you, I need you to smash like on this video right now. And maybe if I trust you enough, I'll bring you along on a couple of other secret missions we do, because this is just the beginning. And now we're prepared. We're breaking in and I'm not holding back. I'm taking everyone down and I'm grabbing all of the gold. <laughs> Starting off by going into this tunnel. Hey, what's that? That's not a money truck. No. Guys, that's a miniature car. And there's a dog inside. Change of mission. I'm getting the gold and we're getting that car. Oh, jeez. Okay, there's a lot of officers around us. Can I help you? <laughs> Yes, actually, you can, as a matter of fact. You're not supposed to be here. Can you turn around? Oh, wait, am I really not supposed to be here? Man, I didn't even know about that. Just play it down, play it down, okay? Shall be ready for this? All of our training is about to come into action. What are you holding? Uh, oh, no, uh, nothing, nothing, nothing. Just one of these. Get him, Franklin. Come on, come on, shop. I'm gonna need some help here right now, boy. I'm gonna need some help. <laughs> oh, boy, get behind the car, get behind the car. And this one, and that guy. Oh, my days, their arm is too good. Oh, thanks, boy. You really saved my back. He was behind me. Well, well, it looks like we found a way in. But first, I think I need to get an outfit. Let's see. I reckon this guy will do. I'll just drag him into the bushes and make sure no one sees what we've just done. Da -da -da. And perfect. There you go. You can't even see what we've done. All right, Chop, help me with the others. Re you gotta help me, boy. Come on. This is gonna take forever. When the next person drives past here and realizes that we have taken down the entire team, they're gonna raise the alarms and it's gonna be mission fail. Oh, man. Okay, that was quite the task. We had to drag so many people into that bush. But I now have uniform. We're gonna blend in. We're going inside. And now's our time to shine. Now, how does this work? Do we... Oh, it just opens. It literally just... <laughs> 
<laughs> that is so cool. Hey, okay, Chop, we will get your car, okay? We'll find it. But right now, let's just focus on the goal. This is wild to think I am underneath the base right now. Check it out. This is the base. So I guess the gold is at the end of the tunnel, but wait, it splits off. Oh, I don't know which way to go. Do I stay up here or go down there? This is tricky. Uh, which way do we go, boy? Down or up? Okay, he wants to go down. Okay, we're going down. We're going down. We'll go down then. Let's see where this goes to. Oh, here we go. The tunnel narrows. You know what? You might be right, boy. I'm pretty sure this might be it. It is cold down here. Whoa. Hey, what? <laughs> what have we just found? <laughs> Okay, guys, I have found a crate full of random stuff that belongs to Fort Sankudo. That- <laughs> I found Thormite! That's insane! And flares. No, get out of there, boy. A highly flammable container, okay? I don't want you touching anything just in case. So we've already found some secret materials, but so far, no vault. There's a truck full of boxes. That's not a vault. Barrel on fire. Okay, and more crates and containers. Hmm, guys, this is getting pretty tight. You know what I'm thinking? I don't think a truck could get down here. That's what I'm thinking. Oh, a firing range. Yeah, okay. Yeah, this is not the vault. We're in the wrong place. We shouldn't have gone down. We should have stayed on the main route. Guys, check it out. I found the money trucks. We've been down here for ages searching for them, and I finally found them. All right. Why did they park there? I think their engine's still on as well. The lights are working. Working. Well, you know what I'm thinking? I reckon we just open the door and see if there's anything inside. Ah, man, there's nothing. They must have unloaded the gold and taken it into the lab. Why would they go into a lab? Are they melting it down? What are they doing with this? Authorized personnel only. It is way too late for that. All right, I am I am deep under Fort Sankudo. This is where I am. We are so far down. I left my car behind because we had to crawl through some tunnels. I got to admit, though, it feels pretty empty. I've barely seen anyone since I've been down here. Another restricted area sign. Oh, you don't say. <laughs> Just happened to stumble in here myself. Very right, careful. There could be someone there. Is there anyone there? Oh, yep, there is. There's someone right there in the labs. Well, I got a uniform, so I reckon we can just walk straight in. Do -do 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 -do. Can you imagine being this guy having to work down here all day? I don't know how deep under the base we are, but it can't be much fun. Hey, what's up? Name. Uh, let me just check, actually. What is our name? Is there a badge? Uh, I don't know. I, I think I'm on the service, though. Name. Uh, I, I'm, all, I'm, I'm down there. Okay, I'm literally on there, dude. Name. Okay, he really wants a name. Fine. My name is, uh, Jeff. It's gotta be a Jeff, right? It's gotta be. I haven't seen you in a while, Jeff. Come on in. Oh, wow, there is. <laughs> I'm so glad. <laughs> Thanks, man. You're the best. Well, it looks like Jeff was the right name after all. Name. Oh, wait, 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 wait a second. Chop? <laughs> You're not asking Chop for a name, are you? I'm just kidding. Come on through, boy. Uh, yeah, this guy's actually kind of nice after all. All right, let's see where this gold is. So far, so good. No one suspects a thing. What? There's a corporation under here. What's going on? Main vault. Got it. I got it. I got it. <laughs> we are 18 floors underground right now, and I found the main vault. It's some sort of weird corporation. Oh, this is crazy. They got like ventilation fans, everything to make sure everything's secure. Now, best behavior. We've got a couple of people here and they look very scary. Why are there so many officers? <laughs> we gotta be getting close, right? We gotta be getting close. Hey, I'm just, uh, just sent down by the commander. You know how it is. Just, uh, me and my dog don't mind us. Just going to check out something to do with the vaults. Someone told me it's a bit faulty. Should I say vaults? You get it? Get it? Because it's... it's oh, okay, I'll be quiet with my jokes now. Hello? Is there anyone in? There you guys are. I've been looking for you everywhere. They're in the FIB. I didn't realize you work here in the base. What brings you down here? A uh, message from the commander. He told me the vault needs uh, looking at. There's something, something about the door being faulty. Looks good to me. We had a check the other day. And it passed the check? Yep. And how long ago was that? Two days. Maybe three. Two or three days ago it passed the check. Well, the commander wants me to check it again, so I suggest you keep your mouth shut. Let me check this vault again. This is working. This is working. I'm almost there. Oh, my days. They're opening it up. Brilliant. I'm literally in the tunnel to the vault. How deep does this go? Wait, what's that? Wait, what? Huh? Chop? Where'd you get that from? I thought you were behind me this whole time. Oh, wow. You, so you found the car then? <laughs> All right, you know what? This might actually come in handy. A bunch up. I want to get in. Okay, Chop, we'll go into the vault together. <laughs> I can't believe we found this car. I wonder what they saw when they saw Chop driving past. Did they not think to comment on this? Anyway, we found the end of the tunnel. This is it. This is this is the one. Oh my goodness. 
this radiation area? What kind of defense system have they got? Oh, hey. Why are you down here? Oh, yeah, that's because no one, oh my days, he's got good moves. Get him. No one is going to tell you about me because we are here to take the gold inside. Take him down. This guy's strong. He's really strong, but not strong enough. Franklin is stronger. <laughs> ah, Chop, did you see that? Oh, they still have a cup. All right. Well, you stay in the car for a minute. I'm going to see if I can open this door. So, it looks like it's got a keypad scan. How are we going to open that thing up? Is there a code I can use? Anything this guy has? What about on the computer? Uh, no. Okay, nothing we can use on there. I think. What would the code be? You guys can give me the code. Wait, if you subscribe, you can give me the code? Subscribe now. I want to get the code so we can break in. One, five, seven, error. What? We lost on the last one? Really? We didn't get enough subscribers. Ah, oh, I hate it when that happens. Okay, well, we got the first three numbers, so let's just give them a go. Da, 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 zero. We'll start with zero and work our way up. Incorrect code. All right, let's do the same thing. Da, da, da. One. Incorrect code. At the same one. Okay, we'll do another one. Da, 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 two. Lockdown mode activated. Lockdown mode. What does that mean? <laughs> Come on. Press. I can't press any buttons. It won't let me. We've locked the vaults. I've come all this way and we've locked the chop. We've locked the vault. Secret mission over. I'm just kidding. You know what I did? When we found that crate earlier on with all of the secret supplies, I took a few things and I'm going to use it to blow the vault open. I, I thought it might be necessary. And that'll do the trick. <laughs> I don't know how powerful they are, but I know the military have some pretty powerful things. Okay, chop. Let's, uh, let's just back out of this room. <laughs> this is going to be a very big explosion. And it's already counting down. They're literally activated. Come on, get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> All right, any second now. Okay, let's check this out. Let's check this out. <laughs> what do you think, boy? Do you reckon it works? It's got to have... Oh, what? It's still locked? Are you kidding me? How am I going to unlock this? Come on, there's got to be something on the computer. There has to be something we missed. I don't understand any of that stuff, to be honest. What, what's this? Oh, a map. Wait, guys, check it out. There's the power room. If I can get to the power room, we can switch off the power and open the door. It's got a keypad. It's electric. Genius! And that's not too far away. But I want to keep Franklin here and send Chop to the power room. You know, make sure we keep guard over the place and Chop's gonna do much better walking around this base. Sorry, did I say walking? I meant driving. <laughs> yeah. Our job is to cut the power off. Make sure this entire base goes dark. Reckon we can do that, Chop? Ah, oh, that's my boy. That's my boy! Not a moment of truth. Are they gonna raise any eyebrows when they see me? Hey, uh, what's up, guys? Just, just gonna go around the back of you. <laughs> See me. This is brilliant. Now the power room is this way. Through this lift and it should take us basically right to where we want to go. This is the power room? I was not expecting this to be it. I'm pretty sure that base is run on that tiny green thing. It looks like a nuclear reactor or whatever. Yeah, this is probably not the safest place to be. How exactly do I switch it off? Wait, there is one person over here. Gotta make sure he's dealt with. Chop, go into the back of him. Ah! <laughs> and stay down. Hey, I didn't realize you know how to use one of those, Chop. All right, let's see. Is there a lever I can use? Oh, wait, there is. There is. So that's what I've got to pull to switch the power off. All right, we can do that. Oh, my days. Oh, we've done it. It's so dark. How are we going to get back like this? You know what? It's not my problem. Franklin's at the vaults. I I'm going to go there now. Yep, he really switched the power off. I can't see a thing, but I got a torch. <laughs> yeah. Right, let's get this open. Now I understand why there's radiation everywhere. They're running this place on nuclear energy. There's the keypads. Let's get this door open. Come on. Ugh. Technically, it should push. Uh, the power's off. Why won't it open? What if I just throw down loads of stickies on the door? Uh, technically, it's not even locked. We switched the power off. Look, it's pitch black. This is pretty awesome. All I can see is the door and just these red lights flashing everywhere. <laughs> All right, we're going to cover the door in stickies. Every single part of the door. And one more. Perfect. All right, stand back, Franklin. This is going to be big. Three, two, one. Boom. Come on, open, open. Are you kidding me? It's still locked. This is the most secure vault I've ever come across. Uh-oh, they switched the power back on. Intruders in the vault. What? Intruders? Oh, my days. Right, people are coming over. Guys, uh, I, I saw him. He tried to go after me. Go get him. Oof, I'm glad to be out of there. Luckily, they don't think it's us, but I don't want to hang around much longer. We need to think of another plan because clearly that door is impossible to get through. Man, just when I thought we had it, I could be leaving here with all that gold. What do you want, Lester? So, you want to take the gold? 
Yes, how do you know we're trying to take the gold? I've been watching you. I've been doing the same. You've been trying this as well? Hey, don't bother, Lester. I'm doing you a favor. All right, that door is reinforced. It's tight. You're not getting in. I'm not an idiot like you two. I have a better idea. Do you want to work with me? You know what, Lester? I do, actually. I want to get that gold. Let's meet up. Excellent. I'll send you my address. So, by the sounds of it, we're not alone. Someone else, a.k.a. Lester Crest, has been keeping an eye on this gold as well. Hey, look. Looks like you've been busy, Lesto. What's going on here? You got cement mixers, trucks, dump trucks, and what's on the board? Hey, what's this as well? Why don't you find out yourself? All right, well, I will. Let's take a look. Whoa, Lester dug an entire tunnel, and it's pretty steep too. You know, it's gotta be if we're going down 18 floors. So, how long is this? I kind of want to get to the end of this and just find out what we're working with. Man, I can't even see the end. Da -da 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 -da. You know what I'm thinking? I'm just gonna jump straight down. Yeet! <laughs> Ow! <laughs> Good job we got a helmet on, Franklin. That was a terrible idea. So I've made it to the bottom. We are so far down right now. Lester, what do we do? When you're ready, blow the wall. You're 10 centimeters from the vault. But wait! You need to have chop. I'm sending him down. What the? What are you doing with the rope on your collar? Uh, did Lester put that on you? Lester, why is there a rope? He's ready. Now blow it open and send him down. Uh, okay. All right. Yeah, I'll do it. All right, chop, stand back. I don't want you getting caught in the middle of this. Come on, get out of here, boy. I'll, I'll tell you when it's ready. Okay, that's got to be enough, right? Let's put some on the other side as well. And boom. Think we're in. Oh my days, we are. We're looking down at everything. Don't jump down. What do you mean? Why can't I jump down? There's lasers everywhere. Then chop down on the rope. Oh, now I see why he's got a rope. Okay, Chop's gonna have to be the one to get this gold. Easy does it. All right, I'm sending him down. He's in. Now what? Switch off the alarm system. The alarm system. Okay, let's give it a go. Let's take a little look around here. I don't think it's in this out. <laughs> Don't think it's in that room. I can see the lasers. I mean, look at my screen. It keeps flashing every time I go through one. But luckily, Chop seems small enough to dodge all of them. Whoa, this place is crazy. Check it out. Oh my goodness. All right, don't get distracted. Don't get distracted. Let's find the alarm. How do oh, we go? Okay, we found a keypad. Uh, Lester, now what? The code is 1235. 1235. Okay, we can do that. That, 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 that. that. Yes. Deactivated! Everyone can come in! Come on! And just like that, nobody knows we're even in here. So I found the gold they bought in. There's a lot of gold. We are gonna do so many amazing things with this. What else do they have down here? This is all top secret stuff. Uh, they got some very, very expensive things. Don't know what that is, but I don't think I wanna know. Uh, let's take a look. There's... Oh, my days. Okay, don't touch that. What's through here? <gasps> Aliens! There's aliens down here! No way! We're not gonna be able to take it all. And you know what? I don't think I want to take it all. I don't want aliens, and I don't want things which are gonna destroy the world. I don't even know what this is either, but we got some very interesting, mysterious chemicals. Nope, not for me! I think we're just gonna stick with the gold. I don't even want that egg either. You know what? I'll leave that thing over here for you guys. I don't want to take anything I don't understand. What I do understand is gold is worth a lot of money, and that's what we're here for. Come on, grab everything! And just like that, it's as if nothing ever happened. Let's do a business with you. Thanks for including us on the plan. Now take your gold and get out of here, because I got things to do and stuff to upgrade. Franklin has a new bike in GTA 5. It's ready to be picked up. I paid a little bit of money for it, and it's gonna blow your socks off. Because you see this old machine? I've been dealing with it for 11 years, and there's one big problem with it. When I get on this bike, yeah, it might make a noise, it might sound mean, but Chop won't get on. See? He doesn't like it. And I can drive anywhere I want to, and he will follow me around, which is great if you want to exercise, but it's not so good if you want to hang out, which we've been doing for a while, as you can see. I upgraded my house, Chop upgraded his, and we built an entire lake together. We've done some crazy things. And did you know that if you press the subscribe button, something really weird is gonna happen to this video? Give it a go, and let me know what happens. Wait, uh, why can I see that too? This is weird. Quick, press like to make it go back to normal. Phew, that was, okay, that was weird. <laughs> Let's get this bike, because it's actually waiting for me in the car park of this building. Downtown Los Santos, owned by Vapid. I wonder if Vapid are the same people who built this bike. Let's find out. No, it's not in that car park. What about around this side? We're looking for a bike. You're not gonna miss it, guys. It's beautiful. Wait a 
minute. Is it in that box? It's gotta be in that box. Well, that makes sense, actually. Why would they park a brand new bike in a car park in the middle of Los Santos, which no one is even supervising? I don't even see any cameras. Okay, right, that's fine. We can do this. Have we got a crowbar? We'll just open this up. Yeah, we got a crowbar. All right, let's get this thing open and take a look at this bike. I can't wait to see this thing. It's literally in this box. All right, let's get this open. I'm gonna try over in this corner. <laughs> Uh, so this wasn't what I was expecting. I've just been given random parts. They gave me car doors. Why do I need one of those for my bike? What do they give me? Uh, that's a BMX bike, so I don't know why we got one of those. I mean, I paid like $3 million for this thing, so I, I'm a bit annoyed. They sent me everything in parts. That's literally the front of Franklin's Buffalo. Are you kidding me? Well, that looks like the main frame of the bike. Even that thing looks pretty rusty. How am I supposed to build this? I'm not a mechanic, but if I take this to a mechanic, they will build it for me. Thanks, game. You're a savior. Honestly, if they didn't tell me that, I would have been so screwed. Okay, let's get this stuff, take it to a mechanic, and get this bike built. And I know just the person to go to. Simeon's store is right around the corner. We'll just ask him to build it. He's got a workshop. Sash knows how to build these things. Yeah, this will be easy peasy. What? His store's closed? Out of all these years, I don't think I've ever seen Simeon close his store. He's barricaded the whole store. What? Are you kidding me? Come on, Simeon, open up! Is there anything in there? Okay, there's one car in there. That's literally it. He he's locked the entire store. So Simeon's gone. That's, you know what? That's fine. I don't need Simeon's help. We'll go to the Los Santos Customs. Those guys are way better, actually. You know what? I only went to Simeon's because he was the closest store to me. But that's so strange. Why is he close? He never closes his store. He's too interested in making money. Los Santos Customs. Man, I love this place. Hey, what? Why are there so many people here? Hang on a second. There's people in their cars as well. Oh, they're queuing. Are you kidding me? Hey, how long is this queue? You know what? I'm going inside. Maybe we can try and fast track this. Me and the mechanic go a long way. We literally saved him the other day. All right. This guy's got big respect for me. Hey, man, I got a bike that he's building. You reckon you can do it for me? Oh, I got a little bit of money. I'm happy to pay. Sorry, Frank, but I'm booked up. Booked up? No, that's not the man I know. The mechanic I know is the guy who will get things done straight away, just like that. Not today, I'm afraid. Come back in two weeks. Ah, oh, you're not the person I remember. You know what? Fine. I'm not gonna come back in two weeks. I'm going somewhere else because I know somebody even better than this guy who will build my bike. Come on, Franklin. We're leaving this place because if Simeon's close and that guy's too busy, then those two people don't even deserve my business. I'm going someplace where they actually appreciate me. Who would have thought building a bike would have been this tricky, Frank? All I wanted to do was have this new bike that's all I wanted to do! Anyway, Benny, my man, is always someone I can count on. And it looks like he's... Oh, seriously? He's already working on someone else's car. You know what? I'm not taking no for an answer. Michael, is that... But this is, is this Michael's car? It is. Are you kidding me? How did you know about Betty, Michael? This guy's cool. You're not. You're not meant to know about these things. Oh, hey, Frank. How you doing? My day ain't going too well, but all of that's going to change, Mike. All of that's going to change because Betty, my man, you know, I mean, you go way back and everything. You know, I saved you. We've done some crazy stuff. I need a bike building, Betty, and I'm willing to pay you a fair bit of money to get it built. I'm closing after this job. Wait, closing for good? No, just for the day. I got a date. Oh, no, Benny, you can't do that. You can't do that. I need this bike built today. I literally bought it this morning, and I got thousands of people waiting to see this bike. Hundreds of thousands. Sorry, no can do. There's got to be something I can do. There's nothing I can do, man. Michael, stay out of this. Okay, just stay out of this, all right? It's, this is your fault in the first place. Benny, please, man. I know you got a date tonight, but come on. I'll literally do anything. I'll pay you tons of money. Please build this bike today. Okay, I'll tell you what. I don't need your money. I need you to do something for me. Now we're talking. And if I do this thing for you? I'll build your bike straight after this. Brilliant. Okay, I'll do whatever it is you want me to do. Just give me the task and I'll get it done now. Burn down Simeon's store and bring back his car. It's expensive. Burn Simeon's store to the grounds? Are you out of your mind? <laughs> this has to be the best job I've ever been given to get something I want in this game. With pleasure, Benny. Well, it looks like Benny and Simeon don't get along anymore. Now, how exactly am 
I gonna get in? There's gotta be a window or something I can use to break inside. <laughs> This is gonna be awesome. All right, we're burning down his store. I'm taking the car and we're leaving and getting the new bike. This window hasn't been barricaded. All right, this is the one we're going through. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> hey, man. Yes. And this is the car he wants me to bring back. It's a Lamborghini, by the way. These things aren't cheap. They're worth millions of dollars. All right, this is gonna be awesome. Let's see. Where do I want to start the fire then? <laughs> <laughs> is anyone in, actually? Does Simeon know I'm doing this? He's not even in. Brilliant. This is just us. <laughs> All right, buddy. Let's get started. Oh, and by the way, don't tell anyone I'm doing this, and especially don't tell Simeon. He still gives me some pretty good jobs here and there, and I don't want to lose them. All right, we'll get the carpet as well. I'm sure this stuff's pretty flammable. The doormats. Oh, these cardboard things. Yes, gotta light those things on fire too. And this one, and voila, we are done. Okay, right, I put gasoline all over his floor, which means I can take the car, set it on fire, and leave. Engine on, it doesn't even have a name, by the way. There we go, oh my days, okay, we gotta go. We seriously gotta go now, go, 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 go. <laughs> <laughs> there he goes! Oh boy, yeah, let's get out of here. I can hear the sirens already. Go, 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 go! <laughs> yeah, I don't want to be anywhere near this scene when the police turn up, but Benny is gonna be so happy with this. Simeon won't be trading for a while, and now his best car's gone. He won't be trading at all. Oh, sorry guys, didn't quite see you there. In fact, I didn't see you at all. I wasn't even looking ahead of myself. I would love to see this car upgraded. I wonder what Benny can do to this. <laughs> let's follow. Whoa, whoa, what? Why the police outside? That's Simeon. Oh my days. You're under arrest for burning down Simeon's store. How dare you, Benny? That was my baby. Simeon must have known it was him. These guys clearly have beef. I'm following that car. If we don't rescue Benny, I don't get to build my brand new bike, and I really want to build it. One trip straight to the police station, of course. We know it was you, Benny. Now get to jail. Who was it, officers? How do I explain that any clearer? So they've taken him downstairs and probably put him straight in jail. I still can't believe they took him in. I don't care what beef he's got with Simeon. He has an alibi. He was in his workshop when the fire happened. Oh, look who decided to turn up. Of course, Michael. How lovely to see you. Is that your new car, by the way? Is that what Benny worked on? Really? Why are you beeping your horn at me, bro? <laughs> I would have had a new bike. All he did was add a roof rack and a spoiler to your car. I mean, it's hardly that good. Come on, let's go. I like the enthusiasm, Mike. Okay, <laughs> let's do this together. Looks like we got a partner today. Don't know why Mike's helping, but uh, I'll take it. Everybody do as we say, and you get to go home for dinner. How does that sound? Hey, where is everybody? Benny, this is the easiest escape ever. Benny? That doesn't sound good. That doesn't sound good at all. Someone's in the station. Just be careful. I don't know who this is, but whoever this is may have just broken Benny out of jail. And uh, who's that? Quick, get behind here, just in case. Ah, uh, don't shoot! Don't shoot! <laughs> Trevor? Hold on, is that you? Gotta run! Come on, Benny! Let's go! Oh, no, 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 no! Oh, man, we just missed them! It's not over yet. I'm not losing them. I'm getting my car and we're following them down. Why would Trevor rescue Benny? That doesn't make any sense! All I wanted to do was get this new bike so I could finally ride around with Chop. That's literally all I wanted to do. And now we got all of this to deal with. At least I can still hear the police. They're really loud. <laughs> You can hear them anywhere in the city. Found them. There they are. Straight out of Los Santos. Of course. Oh, my day. One of them just crashed. <laughs> this is insane. Trevor, come back here. You've got Benny. He's mine. He ain't stopping, huh? If I know one thing about Trevor, he ain't stopping for nobody. Oh, my goodness. They knocked him off the road. Are you kidding me? Where is he going? <laughs> well, he split up from one guy. Right, let's see if I can help him. Hey, get off him. Come on. Oh, my days. No. <laughs> oh, come on. He's driving so fast. Well, at least I... I shook off one officer. There's a little bit of space between him and Trevor now. There we go. Finally caught up. Man, this is a Lamborghini, and I'm struggling to keep up with Trevor and his rusty old body, whatever you want to call it. I mean... Bro, that's not a Lamborghini. All right, come on, get off the road. Give me Benny. Come on, Trevor. What's your plan here? This ain't funny. You got a police costume on. How do you get one of those? He's not budging. I'm gonna have to wait until he stops driving. He's gonna have to run out of fuel eventually. There you are. Finally, you decided to pull over. Benny, can I please get this bike? Please. Come on, the parts are at your store. Not so fast. What do you mean, not so fast, Trevor? What are you gonna do about it? I've been waiting all day to get this new bike. He's upgrading my car first. No. No, 
he's not, Trevor. No, you're not. Benny, you're not doing that, are you? Well, he did just save me. What can I do? You can start by working on your promises, Benny. I burned down Simeon's store for you. Yeah, I know. I went to jail because of it. You should have covered your tracks. I, I did. I covered them really well. You know, burning down a store isn't exactly a, a, a stealthy thing to do. Everyone can see what you've done. Oh, and look who else showed up. What's up, Mike? When you gonna upgrade my wife's car, huh? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. All right. Amanda can wait a second. All right. Trevor, you can wait as well. I was next in line. You upgraded Michael's. Just build my bike. All right, that's all I'm asking. I can give you so much money for this. I've waited ages. Please, shop needs this bike. Uh, I don't know what to do. I'm sorry. I'll tell you what we do. Us three play a game of golf. Winner gets to go first. That, that sounds like uh, the only solution, I guess. All right, Trevor, you in? Yeah, I guess. Brilliant. All right, we figured something out. One game of golf. Do you want to ride with me, Mike? Come on, get in. No, I'm kidding. You got to ride with Trevor. <laughs> Loser. Who is so going to win this? So let's increase the strength to 104. And the wind's pushing a lot left. I think that is going to be the perfect shot. Let's go in the yellow. Oh, the practice swing. Practice swing. <laughs> Bosh, there we go. Nice. Nice. No, no. Don't go. Oh, that was so close. If he went in the soil, we would have got a penalty. Points. I can't afford any of those. Michael has literally hit the ball out of the golf course. <laughs> he has got a penalty point. How did you do that? In all of my years, I've never seen Michael do that at all. Oh, there we go. We finally managed to do it in a straight line. Kind of. Kind of. Almost got it in the sand. All right, Trevor, you're next. That was the best shot I've seen anyone do. And with him in the perfect position, he just whacked it right at the tree. Yeah, it hit the tree. That's out of bounds, T. Out of bounds. Maybe we might just win this. Practice swing, of course. And again, another practice swing. I promise these are definitely intentional. <laughs> okay, nice. Yeah, perfect. Couldn't get any better than that. You know what, Franklin? We are so ahead on this. Let's watch Mike whack the tree. Oh my days. Literally, Ryder, do you want Amanda to have her car upgraded or what, Mike? Finally, he gets it away from... Oh my days. He literally... He hit it out, out of the course. And passed the patch. Trevor, on the other hand, is basically... Oh no. He's next to the hole. How did you do that? Okay, all right, keep it together. Keep it together. At this rate, Trevor might actually win, and I don't want that to happen. The wind's pushing a little bit left. I'm so nervous. I am so nervous, dude. This is it. Get it in the yellow. Get it in the... Come on. Oh, no, 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 no. Trevor's closer. I need to get it in on the next shot. Oh, we've lost. Michael, I've... He's, he's you know, Michael's out. <laughs> Straight up. He's on like his eighth shot. Don't screw this up, Franklin. I am counting on you. There we go. I think that's the one. Ew, that might be too powerful. Oh, no. It's straight past. Don't get it in. Don't get it in. Don't get... Oh, gets in! <laughs> Trevor got it on bar, which means I think we might actually be able to beat him. Michael's in. Double bogey. Man, if one more shot than that, he would have failed. Don't miss. Yes, but this means me and Trevor are neck and neck. We gotta do another hole to find out who wins. Why couldn't Benny have just been the man and said, Franklin, I'm giving you your bike first. We made the deal first. I mean, that makes sense, right? And this hole, I'm never good at this one. There's a tree in the way. Do I risk going through the tree and maybe hit the tree? Or do I go a little bit to the left? Yeah, let's do that. Over the tree, go a little bit into the middle. Might be a little bit too left. I gotta go through another tree. All right, how's Trevor gonna handle this? Please screw up, T. Wait, is that gonna hit the tree? Yes, it hit the tree. Michael, over the tree, basically did the same thing as me. Look at that, exactly the same. Okay, I see how this is gonna be. You guys wanna play tough? I'll play tough as well. I can play tougher than you both. Trevor's in the best position because he's got a straight line to the hole and he follows through. But he's in the sand. Trevor's in the sand. Stay in the sand, T. This is what I meant, by the way. If, if I was where Trevor was, I could have just gone straight line to the hole. Because I'm here, I gotta go over this tree and I don't know if I can. All right, we're gonna send it over this tree. Straight over. Yes. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. All right, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's okay. Michael did the exact same thing. Trevor is still the furthest in this. So he still has the highest chance of winning. Really depends on what I do with this next shot. I got to get this next to the flag. Pressure's on, Frank. Pressure is on. We've got a five mile an hour pickup wind. I kind of want to trust this. Do you reckon if I hit this here, we'll roll into the hole? I think so. Yeah. All right, that's it. That's the one. That's the one. That's the one. There we go. A little chip. Send it over the sand. That was perfect. That was beautiful. Uh, how are you going to do, T? On the green. Oh, my days. It almost went in. He's really playing good. I've never seen Trevor play this good. He must really want this upgrade. Michael coming in clutch, getting one on par. He's still two shots behind us. I don't think he's going to win this one. Trevor missed. 
He missed. He missed. This means if I get it in, if I get the ball in now, we've won. And I get my new bike. <laughs> Get in! We got it on par! Alright, Trevor and Michael, you gotta wait your turn because Franklin is finally getting his brand new bike. Hey, Benny, guess who won the game of golf? That's right, I did! Now, please, can you build my bike? I'll keep a watchful eye out as well, just in case anyone tries to take you away. It's done! Really? It was that quick? Oh, wow, it is! Whoa! You did that really quickly! So, this is the bike? Oh, my days. This looks even better in person than it does in photos. Hey, wait a minute. Did you put the police logo on the side? So they don't chase you. So we got a police logo so they think we actually belong to the police force. Whoa. Okay, you know what I want to do? The one thing I wanted to do all this time. Chop, get in. This bike is for us. This is the best thing ever. Check it out. Chop's in the side. Franklin's riding along. <laughs> Benny, thank you for finally building this bike and putting it together. But we officially have Franklin's new bike in GTA 5. What are you guys think? Do you think it looks pretty good? Let me know in the comments if you do. But do you know what? It doesn't matter what we think. What matters is what Chop thinks. And right now, it sounds like he's loving it. <laughs> he's having a great time. I got all of the features I could possibly need. It can go up to a cool 60 miles an hour. Watch out for the- Whoa, we're going to do it a wheelie now. He's still good? Yeah, Chop's fine. He's A-OK. -okay. <laughs> he's just enjoying the ride. I got spare wheels, all of the kit we need. Yep, this bike has everything. Even a super duper long exhaust. This is the life. Catching a turn, getting some rays, and hanging out with my best friend Chop on my brand new boat. So you guys can come aboard too. You just gotta subscribe to the channel. Oh, by the way, this is my garden. Yeah, I know. We made an entire lake. Man, I've been loving this place. I got like a theater place. I got a diving board. I even got bars like left, right, and center, and so many different boats. In fact, we just crashed into one right now. <laughs> oh, wait, check the news. Why do I need to check the news, Michael? What's going on on the news? All right, Franklin, we better get up. Something's happening in Los Santos. Okay, I'll see you at home, boy. <laughs> I'm gonna go check the news. Oh, by the way, these are my neighbor's houses. I bought every single one of them out just so I could do this. <laughs> and let me tell you, I have been loving life since. We've done so many crazy things. Oh, Chop doesn't mind me going through his kennel. Yep, this is his kennel, by the way. We did a few upgrades the other day. <laughs> He's even got a gaming laptop. Like, what kind of dog needs one of those? Oof, we gotta do a tidy up. There's just too many things around here, Franklin. Like, how many sun lounges do we need? And when did we get that slide? Right, you know what? Those are problems we can figure out another time. Right now, we just gotta check the news. Michael never texts me about the news, so this has gotta be important, right? I mean, if he's telling me something which I gotta see, then this has to be pretty important. Oh, man, hey, what happened to my sofa? Wait, did we do that? Alright, you know what? Ignore it, Franklin. Let's check out the news. What do you think's going? Oh, my days. What? There's a sandstorm. That's not too far from here. It's covered in sand. Okay, that's fine. You know, just, just a sandstorm. Uh, how bad can can it be? Apart from the fact it covered an entire island. I mean, that island is, is tiny anyway. Los Santos is so much bigger. I would like to see it try and bury this place in sand, but just in case it does, we should probably gear up, Franklin. Hey, actually, I know exactly what we can do first. We can put our vehicles in the garage. That's a great idea, actually. Yeah, yeah, fantastic. Well, we'll do that. Make sure those things are secure, because uh, I got some pretty nice cars. I got, I got my bike. No, I actually don't care about this thing. What I care about is my golden car. I mean, come on, it's gold. How can I not care about this thing? Put it in, keep it in the garage, and at least in here, they should be safe from any sort of sand that comes over Los Santos. I mean, this is actually kind of exciting. I gotta make sure my gold is safe. I mean, this is literally all the money we have. All right, we'll just keep this in here, and I'll lock this window. Safe and sound. Now, the gold won't be some treasure we gotta search for afterwards. I mean, can you imagine the sand getting as deep as this house? Because I can't. I am literally really high up, and what's even gonna happen? to my lake. Last time I checked, sand can't float on water. It sinks to the bottom. Yeah, there is no way it's gonna destroy this house. But just in case, we better take a few more precautions. Like locking up my garage with all of my supercars in and barricading the entire place. This might take a while, but it's gonna be worth it. Chop, wherever you are, boy. We need to get to work. Oh my days, he's still on the yacht. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Come on, boy. Get inside now. I barricaded my garage, my front door, and every single one of my windows is locked and sealed tight. Except for my kitchen window. We ought to get around to that one. But that's the last thing we gotta do. And now, 
now we're safe and sound. Ain't no sand getting into this house. <laughs> Ain't that right, Chop? Oh, what, Chop? Oh, my days, you're outside. <laughs> Come on, get in! Oh no, I think he's hungry. Hey, come on, you got like a steak over here, Chop, and uh, we got some chicken food as well. Is there anything else we can give him? There's always fruits. Chop never likes to eat fruit. What about pizza? I know you like pizza. Have we got anything else? I guess there's some old fries from Burger Shots. Okay, we don't exactly have much food, and if this sandstorm really is as bad as it's meant to be, we should probably get some supplies. I don't want to put up with Hungry Chop. He gets hangry, and you don't want to see that. Okay, how does it look out there? You know what? That's blue sky. I can see the sun. Yeah, we got plenty of time until the sandstorm arrives. Come on, Chop. Let's go get some food. Now behave yourself, Chop. Keep all paws inside the carriage, all right? Last thing I want to do is have to bandage you up again. Man, my garden really does stretch out quite far. That's the end of my lake. <laughs> we literally have all the way to Vinewood. Wow. Anyway, I'm pretty sure there's a store down this block. No, it's not that way. It's... Oh, this way. Yo, what? Why are there so many people outside? They're not for the store, are they? You guys better not... Oh, my days, they are. Every single one of them. They're queuing for the store. Are you out of your mind? Okay, right, that's fine. I'm just gonna pretend I know someone. Hey, what's up, Jerry? Nice to see you again. Thanks for saving me a spot. Oh, these guys aren't too happy about this. Oh, my days. Okay, right, you know what? I, I think I'm just gonna back out. I, you, I, I actually, I, I, I missed his face. That was not Jerry. I thought it was. Okay, he really wants me to get back on my bike. Okay, fine. I'll go find another store then. That's fine with me. I can't believe this. There's such a queue, and they won't even let me skip. I know, Chuck. They are really mean, aren't they? How dare they think they can just starve both of us? Actually, wait a minute. I think I've got an idea. All right, Chop. Stay quiet. All right, we're gonna go on a secret mission together. Yep, we're doing another one. We're gonna break in through the back. If we do that, then we'll be able to take however much food we want to. No one will be able to stop us. Not even that guy. Okay, apart from... Maybe this fence. Careful now, careful. Not even the people in the queue, though. And it looks like that is the door we gotta use. This must be their door. And using my professional skills... <laughs> <laughs> they really think they can stop us? Well, think again. What do I want? Mm, let me think. I might take some of those boxes, although I'm pretty sure that's just soda. I would love some food. Let me see. Oh, this. All right, we'll take the entire trolley. Yeah, that ought to do the trick. Hey, Chop, look what I got. I'm pretty sure there's burgers in here. Whoa, wait a second. Oh, my days. The police are here. No, what are you doing? D don't do this, Franklin. Oh, my days. We could have taken them. Well, that's that. There's only two officers. Oh, wait, though. There's even more officers over there. Well, whatever you do, don't take Chop, all right? He's got nothing to do with this. Oh, great. Now I'm going to jail. This is the last place I wanted to be. Hey, wait, have you guys seen the weather? Oh my goodness, it's happening. The sandstorm's happening. Hey, come on, man, you gotta get us inside. I don't care where we go, just get us inside. And here we are, back at the police station. whoop dee doo Man, it's so dark in here. What's up with that? Don't you have electricity or something? I'm pretty sure it's working. It's just really low. I've, I've never seen it so dark inside the jail. Don't worry, Chop. It's gonna be fine. They'll let us out soon enough. It's just a little sandstorm. In fact, I, I think I can hear updates on the radio. Don't, don't bark, okay? I just wanna listen to this. Lock your doors. Lock your windows. Overnight, the world will be buried. Don't say I didn't warn you. Overnight, the world's gonna be buried? Well, it's a good job we barricaded our house, ain't it, Chop? <laughs> Make sure that place is sealed up and airtight. Just hope the police station is the same. You know what? There's nothing we can do right now. I'm gonna get some sleep, and in the morning, we'll see what this sandstorm has really done to the place. I don't believe it's gonna come along, Santos. <laughs> Oh, this won't be too bad. Don't release me in no time. All I did was take a little bit of food. Ugh. Oh my days. I had the craziest dream. I was told that if you subscribe to this channel and press that button now, then something really, really weird is gonna happen. But I don't know what it is. So you're gonna have to tell me if something does. Have you pressed it yet? I don't know if this dream was lying to me or if it was actually real. It felt really real. <gasps> Wait. I think, I think it's happened. Oh my, oh no, no, it's, it's, it's gone again. Oh, that was weird, <laughs> really weird. Weird, hey, wait, do you hear that? Hey, turn around, Franklin, wake up. I don't even know what time it is, but it's, is it the morning? It's definitely lighter out there. Hey, I think someone's banging on something. Hey, come on, stop banging. What are they up to, man? They're really banging at something. Hey, come on, can you let me out of prison? I don't even know what time it is. I've just been asleep and no one's even come to say hi. Get up, bro, we gotta figure out a way out of here. I mean. Something's going on at the station.
attention. They're banging on something. I'm sure we can figure out a way to escape. Well, what have you got in that collar? Is there? Oh, perfect. Let me just take that metal thing. And I'm gonna use this to try and break the door open. Alright, we got this. Just gotta do Yes, I got it. We're out. Chop. We're leaving this place now. And there's no one down here. This is so weird. Why is no one down here? Right, that's it. We're taking the back door. What? It's locked. Why is it? Come on. This door's locked. All right, one minute. I'm gonna jump straight into it. This might hurt a little bit, Franklin. Ow, come on. Still locked? Okay, I've got one more idea, boy. But uh, this is gonna be a lot of energy. All right. <laughs> We're both gonna run to this door. Are you ready? Yeah, he looks ready. Okay, here goes nothing. Three, two, one. Oh, seriously? It's still closed. All right, there's no way we're getting this door open. We gotta find another way out. Suddenly, it's got really dark again. I don't like this. We're getting really weird power cuts in here. There's no one here. Why is there no one downstairs? Did they not think I would escape? Yeah, probably not, actually. I mean, <laughs> I was in jail. Okay, let's find a way out of here. I can't go through the back door, so that means we're probably gonna have to go through the front door. I just hope there's no one up there, but I'm not gonna lie, the banging is getting even louder. No, 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 is it coming from here? Yeah, guys, I think it is. It is. They're completely blocked in. Is that sand? Was that from the sandstorm? Are you kidding me? Maybe they were telling the truth. All right, we can't go through there. What if we, uh, it's a good idea, actually. We'll go upstairs. We'll go to the top of the building, get to the roof, and see what it's like through there. There is no way this entire building is covered in sand in, like, one night. I don't even know what time it is, dude. All right, carefully does it. Be quiet. We don't want to alert anybody. After all, we have just escaped, and they won't want me out and about. One foot at a time. Last thing I want to do is alert anybody and someone is in here. You can hear them, guys. And they're trying to get out of the door at the top. Are you crazy? How much sand landed in Los Santos? Clearly a lot of this guy's trying to get out. Hey, buddy, you should have looked behind you. Oh, I see how it is. You want to try and get up and take me down? Guess what? You're gonna lose anyway. <laughs> Job, it's safe to come up. Come on. Yep, we're struggling as well. Man, come on, Franklin. We gotta get this open. All right, I'm not taking no for an answer. We're getting out. I am not being trapped in the police station. Three, two, one. Burst. Wait, I'm out. Uh, yes, we're out. <laughs> Whoa. Wow, this place really is covered in sand. Oh, my days. That's Los Santos. Are you kidding me? We must be like meters deep. Seriously. I'm pretty sure there's a bridge over there. What are these rocks here for? How did they appear overnight? So I'm on top of the police station, believe it or not. And somehow there is a helicopter up here. <laughs> You know I'm taking this. Wow. And my helicopter still works. So that's the police station down there. I wonder why we couldn't get out. So oh, it's very windy though. This helicopter's really struggling to fly. Maybe taking this was kind of a bad idea. We got this though, right? I mean, apart from the beeping and all of those error sounds. Okay, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna try and get home. I can barely see a thing. Apparently, I'm looking right into Los Santos. Just watch out for the buildings, of course. Oh, don't go into the ground. This is crazy. All right, hold on to something, boy. This is gonna be a very rocky ride. Whoa, how did that happen? You know what? Let's just get home. Luckily for us, I barricaded the place, so everything should be a-okay. I think that's the Eclipse Towers, buried in sand. I'm a bit nervous now. I mean, is my house even gonna be there? There is a good chance it might be buried. Don't freak out, Chop. If we get home and we have to dig down to our house, I will do it. I will do anything it takes to get back home. That's it! I can see it! <laughs> no way! Our house is kind of okay. We haven't got the lake anymore, but it's not buried. That's incredible. I can see all of my supercars. Yo, we gotta land this helicopter. We gotta get down on that roof. What in the world? I don't recognize those cars. Hey, okay, wait, did I just lose my money? Huh? That's not fair. How did that happen? Yo, we gotta land on the roof. Something's going on in my house, guys. There's people here, and I've just lost all of my money. All right, let's see. Yeah, I don't recognize those cars. They don't belong to me. Someone's in here. Hear them too. They just smashed something. Okay, whoever these people are clearly aren't too friendly. They took all of my money. I'm gonna get them. I'm gonna make sure they pay for this. Oh no, Chop, don't look down. Your house is uh kind of buried in snow. 
Alright, which is the easiest way down from the roof? I haven't actually done this before. Wait, my cars! They were there a second ago! Where have they gone? Okay, these guys are so going down. They took my cars, they took my money, they're in my house, they're smashing my things! Chop and I put so much love into this place, I'm not willing to have everything taken away from me just like that! Oh man, look at that, my sun lounge is covered in sand! Well, wait a minute, I thought I barricaded my house, how is this covered in sand? Come out, come out, wherever you are, are you downstairs? I don't think so, that's covered in sand too! So where could they be? Wait, is that digging? Someone's digging outside! Stop right there, you know what, I'm not even gonna talk to him, let's take him down and I'm pretty sure no way guys it's Simeon seriously you thought you could have robbed me in a sandstorm oh man I'm so annoyed but there's two cars which means someone else has to be here hello I know you're here shop's not even doing anything come on don't be lazy we gotta get our stuff back Man, guys, I can't see them. Looks like it was just Simeon. Whoever else was there clearly got away. Come on. What are we gonna do now? I have no money. My house is a mess. That's my car. I put that in the garage. It's buried in sand. I can't get that out until I get a tow truck. I mean, I can try. <laughs> Let's see if we can kick this thing out. It's my favorite car as well. It's a golden one. Oh, wait. I got it out. All right, that was super duper easy. Well, at least something's going well today. Okay, well, let's see if anything else will go our way. Maybe they put the money somewhere in my house. You know, for another time. It wasn't where I left it, so maybe they put it, I don't know, like maybe on the top floor or something, where the helicopter could pick it up. I mean, that would make sense. Is it in the gym? No, it's not in the gym. What about down this way? What was that? Do you feel that? Oh my days. Guys, I gotta get out of here. This place is gonna fall down. Ah! No, it destroyed my house. Oh, my head and my leg. Wow, that was crazy. Okay, well, that's the end of that then. I love that house too. Oh, come on, the entire thing fell down. That's a lot of smoke. Chop? Oh, no, 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 please tell me he's okay. I can live with my house falling down, but not Chop. Where are you, boy? Chop is everything. Oh, phew, he's okay. Man, for a second, I thought maybe he was trapped under all the rubble. That's a lot too. Hey, look at this. At least your house is okay. How lucky. All right, Chop, listen to me. We gotta get out of here. We can't stay here. It's not safe. We have no money, we have no food, and we have no place to live. We better make some changes to that right now. And luckily for us, where did the cars go? Are you serious? Hoot! Okay, whoever was working for Simeon really messed me up. Is my car still there? Oh, yeah. All right, at least we still got our car. If there's one thing I'm good at, it's always bouncing back. Ain't that right, Chop? You can knock me down so many times, and we're still gonna get back up. Because right beneath us is the bank. Oh yeah, that's right. We're gonna take a little bit of cash in the middle of a sandstorm. I mean, who's gonna stop us? Let's be honest. Everything is covered in sand. Now, according to my calculations, we should be right above the door of the bank. That's it. That's the door. Okay, let's do this. I got a little shovel and we just gotta push some sand here, push some sand there, and more sand this way. This might take a while. I'll see you when I'm done. I got some bad news. I didn't get in. Every time I dig sand, out more falls in and we can't even dig down i'm not giving up i will find a way in we need some money i mean when all this sand disappears how am i gonna build my life up again i'm gonna go searching there's gotta be something around here even a bulldozer or a dump truck or even a giant drill i will take anything i can if it means i can get down to that vault Wait, I think I found the vehicle of our dreams. Let me just take a little look at this thing. That looks amazing. That's a giant car with, like, giant wheels. Okay, here goes nothing. I'm taking them down. Bop. Oh, no! Where am I? Wait, have they seen me? Nah, this guy hasn't seen me. He has no idea where I am. Well, that was super duper easy. Let's go take a look at this ride. Find out one thing. That car looks way better than my car in a sandstorm. <laughs> I mean, I keep crashing into so many things. Ooh, look at the engine. <gasps> yes, it's got a digger at the front, too. All right, Chop, get out. We're taking this. This is going to take us all the way down to the bank front. Pleasure doing business with you, fellas, but uh, I got to get out of here now. Let's go. <laughs> look at the tire tracks. <laughs> okay, one second. I know I got a golden car, but I got to drive this into it. <laughs> this is such a beast vehicle. Hey, Chop, with this, no one's going to tell us what to do with it sandstorm. Not even the police. Wait, I can fire things too. Oh, yeah. We can fire stuff. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm in.
Check it out. They got power down here. Honestly, I'm amazed they even got power down here. All right, let's see. Hello, is there anyone? Oh, my days. There is. There is. Ah. Uh, Oh, okay, they've seen me. Yeah, I I, uh, I, I'm, I, am rescuing you. I'm setting more people down after this. I promise I'm just here to check something. All right, just bear with me. Oh, they don't look too good. <laughs> They're trapped down here. Yeah, it's, it's pretty bad up there, by the way. You're literally like 30 meters below sand. Uh, anyway, let's just uh, get to the vault because that's what I'm totally here for. I got a job to do, remember? Just gotta get through this. Oh, fantastic. All oh, the doors are open. Who left them open? Moment of truth. Did they leave this thing open as well? Let's see. All right, press door release. Access code required. Okay, right. We still got to get this thing open. There we go. Nice, 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 nice. Oh, no, you don't. Yeah, I'm in. Now, whatever you do, don't lock behind me. Oh, my days. The last thing I want to do is get locked in the vault. I've left my shoe in the door. All right, let's see. What do we go? Whoa. <laughs> we are dreaming right now. Look at this. So much cash. All right, Franklin, we're grabbing all of this. Job's going to be so happy. And please confirm the vault has been cleared. I'm just gonna take this to the authorities and they'll be down to save you, okay? Yeah, yeah, you don't worry. You're gonna be fine. Everyone's gonna be fine, okay? Just, uh, yeah, hang on in there. You'll be okay. Oof, I'm glad to be out of there. Can't believe there's people actually in the bank. Anyway, now I've got a car and a bunch of money. We need to find somewhere to live. And I got just the right idea. Yeah, we're not getting in that. No way. Not a chance. All right, we're gonna find somewhere else to stay. You reckon I can drive up Maze Bank, though? I mean, I gotta give it a go. We have tons of money. We have a really cool car. And I'm driving up Maze Bank in a sandstorm. <laughs> this is so awesome. Oh, man, we fell off. At least this tower blocks, all right? Yeah, we'll go in there. Hey. Hey, I like the decor. Check it out. Oh, wait. There's someone in here. Uh, bear with me. Let me just get a little bit closer. And bang. Uh, sorry, man, but I got to take this place now. It's mine. So welcome to my brand new place. This is where we're going to be hanging out for a little while. I hope you like it, shop. All right. Take a look at this window. All we can see is sand and more sand. Oh, there's a telescope, though. Maybe we can see a little bit more than just sand. Is there anything else out there? Let's see. All right. Let's see a lot of sand. Lots of sand. Lots and lots of sand. Oh, wait. What's that? It's the thumbs up. Oh, it means you guys have got a thumbs up this video. Press the like button. What are you doing? I'm just kidding. I, I can't see anything else out there other than the big old thumbs up. Did this guy have anything cool that we can use? Like, uh, ooh, books. Nice. Okay, he's got lots of books. Balcony with the blinds half down. But what kind of clothes has this guy got? I want to find something that's more suitable for a sand store. Guess who ain't gonna be bothered by sand again? Franklin. Check it out. <laughs> I mean, with goggles on the eyes, we're not gonna get scratches with a hat on the top. And also this balaclava. I mean, we're gonna be just fine. So I'm gonna get some rest. And I'll see you guys in the morning. Morning. Rise and shine, Frank. Hey, what's that noise? Oh, no. I think he's awake. Not to panic. Not to panic. We will just... What? Was there more sand? What's the military doing here? Uh, hey, can I help you? We're here to evacuate you. Come on. Oh, wait, you're evacuating me? Uh, thanks. Yeah, let's go. Uh, Chop, we're leaving. Where are you, boy? <laughs> Chop. Where have you gone? Well, man, I've lost him already. Okay, I'll, I'll be out in a second. Just gonna find my dog. It's only gonna get worse. We're going to Mount Chiliad. Wanna come? Yeah, actually I do. I, I didn't think the sand would get even higher than this. Uh, hey, mind if I take my own car? I go on around the corner. Uh, I think that'll do a better job than your trucks. Uh, j just being honest. Oh, wait, my car is not around the corner anymore. Looks like that thing got covered. Okay, I'll take one of your trucks then, but I'm driving. Uh, I don't even know which way Mount Chiliad is. Okay, we're pointing in the right direction. We just got to go up and up and up until we reach the chili at. It's quite a hill we gotta climb. Are you sure it's safe? I'm positive. Just keep driving. This is kind of nerve-wracking. We are evacuating in the middle of a sandstorm and we have finally reached the bottom of the mountain. You can see boulders which may have even fallen straight off. Right, which way do we go up? I mean, there's still quite a climb. No way! They built a house on the mountain! <laughs> okay, alright. This is the best evacuation we've ever done. And these guys better let me in. Hey, come on. We've come all the way from Los Santos. Can I please come in? Yeah, they're letting me in. <laughs> Welcome to our brand new home on top of the entire world. It's really windy up here, but good job Franklin has everything he needs. So I've already found Tracy, who managed to make it out alive in this storm. Anyone else I know? <laughs> I can't believe Tracy's here. Out of all the people, Michael, Jimmy, Amanda, it looks like Tracy might be the only survivor. Ooh, they got a kitchen. What are you cooking over? There, it smells really nice. Let's see, anything good? Oh, 
Got some steaks. Hey, are those two steaks? No, it's just one. All right, I want to see two on there. Franklin and Chop have just arrived in the house. The well-stocked fridge. That's what I like to see. Pasta, rice, even slushy machines. I don't think we need any of those. These are the bedrooms, by the way. Check them out. We get to pick any of them. And we're not even done because there is an actual upstairs, which I haven't even seen. This is the upstairs. And over here is... Hey, Michael and Amanda. Looks like his entire family managed to survive and evacuate. The sandstorm is over and my entire house upgrade got destroyed. I lost all of my cars. I lost the rooftop on my house. And most importantly, we lost shops kennel. I love that place and he loved it too. But all is not lost. The builders came by and they said they will move my house anywhere I want to for 50 million dollars. Can I build it in the ocean? No. Can I put it in space? No, not that. Well, clearly you guys are lying to me. Where can I build this house? Anywhere but those two places. Alright, I'll let you guys off because I don't want this in space. I want to put it somewhere much cooler than that. And it's about time we move this too. I wasn't getting along with my my neighbors after all the noise shop was making and a few other people on the street moved back in and they weren't too happy with the flood I did down below. Besides, a fresh start doesn't even sound that bad. So, if you had one choice on where you would move this house, where would you move it to? Let me know in the comments below, but right now I need to get some money. We robbed the bank the other day and I got tons and tons of cash right downstairs. Enough money to move this house a hundred, no, two hundred, no, five hundred times in this world. We made a a lot of cash the other day. That's a lot of cash. Anyway, with 50 million dollars in my pocket, it's time to finally move this house. And whilst they're at it, maybe we can get some upgrades to the inside too. Like new arts or new flooring or hey, even a new table. Oh my goodness. Where did you guys come from? All right, nice and easy now. Nice and easy. There's a couple of police officers. Oh no, they blocked the roads and they've taken shop as well. How dare you guys. Wait, are they taking photos of this? Right, that's it. You're going down. Take that! Are you serious? They took me out. You're under arrest for robbing a bank. Oh, yeah, I get it. We robbed the bank, didn't we? They must have caught me on their cameras. No, they've taken all of my money and we're going to prison. They're not even taking me to the station. Hey, come on, slow down, man. I don't belong in here. I didn't know I was going to get caught. If I knew, I wouldn't have done this in the first place. I just wanted to make some money because someone took all of my money. Oh, man, you got to go after them. They're the reason why I did this and not even leave listening to me. We're still walking into prison. Oh, great. This is the last place I wanted to be. What do they do with Chop? He's all the way over there. That's a pet store. They're trying to sell him off. I gotta get out of here before they do that. I'm not letting that happen. Now, I did see a dollar sign on this door, so maybe we could... Oh, man, it's five million dollars to bail. I haven't got that kind of money. The police took everything away. All right, if I want to get out of prison, I either need to make five million dollars or find a way out of here. I'm gonna go with plan B and find a way out of here. So let's get cracking. If I can get on the roof, we'll be able to figure out a plan. Maybe figure out a weak spot or something. Or even get to the front gates. Great idea. Great idea, Frankie. Great idea. Let's see. Any guards around? No, this looks pretty clear to me. Alright, we're going this way. I can see one guard, actually. Hold on. If I can get that guard taken down, I might be able to grab something from him. Like a key. Alright, don't make a noise, buddy. Is he still there? Let's take a look. He's still there. He's still there? <laughs> Alright, tip Tower across. Do, 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 do. He hasn't seen me yet. This is great news. This is awesome. Do, 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 do. And hey, buddy, lights out. Got him. Did he drop anything? Oh, I got some cash. Five million. No, not five million dollars. Just 23 bucks. But he did give me one of these. Oh. <laughs> I would like to see someone try and stop me now. All I wanted to do was move my house. Besides, that's a way cooler thing to do than put Franklin in jail. There's no need to do that. Oh, my days. Another guard. Three. Oh, jeez. Oh, okay. We got him. We got him. <laughs> oh, that was so close. All right, two guards down. I'm getting closer to the front. Sorry about that, buddy. I, I didn't mean to do any of that. I, I just, I want to escape the prison, you see. All right, is there anyone around here? Empty again. It's all clear. All right, keep moving. That's tower block A, which means we're really close to the front. And I've made it to the front gate. There's no one around me. This is amazing. Come on, open. Seriously? Come on, open. Stop right there. Oh, no. They've already caught us. Great job, Franklin. Great job. And now I'm in jail. Come on, officer. You know I wasn't trying to escape. I, I was just having a walk around. Drop and give me 100. Now. What? Even though I'm in the cell? Surely you can't be serious. Do it. Okay. All right. Fine. We're doing, we're doing 100 then. One, two, 
three, four, five. Don't stop. But my arms hurt. Okay, seven, eight, nine, ten. Keep going. Man, this is exhausting. I'm gonna do a hundred of these. We're not gonna survive a day in here, but you guys can help out. If you press the subscribe button, we can play as Chop. Can you do it, please? I don't know what we're gonna do in prison, but it's not gonna be any good. Yes, a few of you guys are doing it, but not enough, not enough. Come on, guys, keep subscribing. I really wanna play as Chop. I'm playing as him. Thank you so much. <laughs> Oh, I've missed you so much, boy. Hey, come on, let's go rescue Franklin. But first, we need to get out of this situation. They've got me real good. This cage ain't opening. I, wait, is that what I think it is? Oh my goodness. They got a mountain lion in here. Hey, that's not safe. You can't have one of those. Get, get me out of here, man. Come on. They got a mountain lion. Oh wait, I think he's trying to buy me. Hold on, they're talking. They're guys, he's trying to buy me. Oh my days, okay. All right, here's the deal. When they open that door, I'm bolting. All right, we're making a run for it. Yes, yes, I'm out of here. Bye. Run, run, run. Oh my days, they're trying to get me. No, 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 there's only one person who owns this dog, and it's Frank, and they're best friends. All right, we don't mess with that. No one buys shop, no one gets shop, no one gets to be his friend. Well, that wasn't too bad, and now it's time to somehow get Franklin out of prison. How on earth are we gonna do that, shop? How are we gonna do that? So I've just arrived, and there is a van waiting to go inside. Here's my plan. I'm gonna sneak in just like any wild animal, you know, not raising any eyebrows, just me having a wonder. We're gonna jump straight into the back of that van. Slowly, no one seems to care. And climb in. Ooh, so many boxes. All right, I think I'll just hide here for now. Perfect little hiding spot. They won't even see me. And the truck's already driving. They're driving. We're going in. <laughs> At least I hope we're going in. That would be a big fail if they drove me somewhere else. Oh, we got to be inside. That was such a quick journey. You ready for action? Because we're going to need to do some action. Oh, no, he's not happy about this. Quick, go, 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 go. <laughs> You'll never take me in. Never. How exactly do we get Franklin out? He's in his cell, still doing push-ups, probably. Maybe this door would take him to him. I didn't exactly see how to get to his cell block. We just ended up there. Oh, I found it. So this is where Franklin's at right now. What a mess, eh? All right, Franklin's upstairs. I know that much. But before I go up there, maybe I should figure out how to open the door first. Hey, man, can I borrow the key? Thanks. <laughs> yeah. You're the best. Give me the key. Give me the key. Give me, just give me the key, man. It's not that hard. There's the key. Now, before anyone sees what I've done, I'm just gonna quickly go up to Franklin's door, open it up, and get him out. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. No, he's not in there. Franklin? Nope, nope, nope. Where is he? Franklin? I've got the key. Where are you, man? Oh, wait, there you are. That's him. Oh, he looks exhausted after those push-ups. Hey, I got the key. Check it out. You're free. Let's go. I didn't think I would see the day Chop would rescue Franklin from prison. You are one very clever dog. It's still there. The truck is still there. All right, we're gonna get on this thing quietly, slowly, and get in now. Okay, we'll hide here for now, close the doors, and that'll be that. We're gonna be just fine. They've unloaded everything. They have no reason to open the back doors. Oh, and before you leave, I need you to open the doors. Right, they do need to open these doors. When they open them, they're gonna realize what we've done, and they're gonna put us straight back in jail, me and you. What's taking you so long? Come on, open it. Oh, no, they're trying to open the door. Okay, you're not gonna like this idea, boy, but it's the only idea I God, we're driving out of here. Sorry, but we gotta go. <laughs> Just drive, 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 drive. I have nothing to defend myself with. We only have this truck. We got two stars. That's all right. We can still lose two stars. But now I'm in a really big vehicle. Maybe I can use this to run straight through the front gate. Right, here goes nothing. Open up, please. Open up. Come on, open. <laughs> please, come on. Get me out of here. I just want to move Franklin's house. That's all I want to do. I'll even invite all of you guys around as well. You just got to let me go. Oh, speaking of which, they're not going to. Oh, my days. They're going to take me out through the windscreen. All right, that's it. We're breaking through the front gate. Here goes nothing. Yes, I'm through. And this one. Oh, come on, open. Oh, we're going to want to get down for this, Franklin. They're really trying to take me out now. All right, rev those engines. And three, two, one. Go, 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 go. There's no way I'm going back. I'm getting out of here. I want to be on my sun lounger, drinking a nice ice cold soda, eating a burger, and even a bag of chips. Why not? Ooh, okay. This vehicle really has taken a bit of damage, though. <laughs> we got a lot of scratches. A dent at the side a little bit. And what? Jump with those guys. Whoa. <laughs> that was so close. I think it's about time we do a little bit of off-roading. Yeah, we'll just go up here. Chop, hold on to something. This is gonna be a very bumpy ride back home. Home sweet home. Man, I'm glad to be back. 
Oof. We're lucky to be alive at this point. And hey, they're even still here. Thanks, guys, waiting up for me. They must have known I was going to break out of prison at some point. Good time? Yeah, not really, actually. It, it was not very fun. But thanks for waiting around. So, you still want to move my house? Now is more important than ever because they're going to be looking for me soon enough. Yeah, you got the money. Oh, you know what? That's a great question. Let me take a look. No, I haven't got that money. Who do you think I am? Made of money? We need the 50 mil. Or else, no upgrade, you know? <sighs> okay, right, I still gotta find a way to make 50 million dollars. What is it, Lester? All right, one minute, I'm taking this cool. Wanna get rich? Yeah, I'd love to. But what have I gotta do? Find this man and bring him to me. Before I accept, I need to know exactly how much you're paying me, Lester. I need 50 million bucks. You'll get your 50 million dollars. Now, he was last seen near Digital Den. Are you in? All right, let's go find this person. I wonder what they've done to annoy Lester this much. So this is where he was last seen. Digital Den. He can't be far from here. Check all the people on the streets. It's not him. That's a police officer. No, we're not going after that guy. We're definitely not going after the police officer. And that's a police officer too. What about this person? Ah, uh, wrong close. They could have gone around the block. That's not them. I'm analyzing every single person. It could even be down there. I'm gonna search the easy spots first and then go into the alleyways and more complicated places. But I gotta make sure it's the right person. Bros Lester is not gonna pay us. That's not that. We're wearing a suit. This is so annoying. What about in this car park? I think I found him. That looks like the person. Not that one. Eating the bagel. I'm talking about this guy in the car park. Hey. <laughs> That's him. We're in the right suit. Same hair. And it looks like he may have broken down. That can't be a Coincidence, right? What did you do, Lester? Okay, we're gonna make this nice and simple, all right? Nice and quietly. We're gonna pretend we're parking and go get him, boys. Come on, get him. <laughs> oh, man. Today is not a good day to be you. Get him in the van. Now, throw him in. Nice. Okay, I'm just gonna take you back to Lester. He's gonna ask a couple of questions. I'm gonna get paid and everyone's gonna have a great day except for you. You might not have a good day, actually, but you never know. You might even want to give you some ice cream. You could be long lost friends or something. Or he might want to give you some money. Who knows? Lester, I got you, guy. I'll just get him for you, and you can decide what to do. Come on, boys. Bring him out. Bring him out. Well, <laughs> I got a whole team. You're late. I'm docking your pay. What? You promised me 50. You gave me 40 million bucks. That's not enough to move my house. Don't do anything stupid, Franklin. Oh, but I really want to. I want to take him down, but the last thing I want to do is end up in the back of that van. Fine, fine. Do you have any more work I can do, Lester? I'll do anything. Just please give me the extra 10 mil. No more work left. Enjoy the rest of your day. Someone woke up on the wrong side of the bed. I can't get the money from Lester, which means I need to find a way to make 10 million dollars. And why is Trevor calling me now? All right, let's see what he wants. Hey, Trevor, now is really not a good time. I'm trying to make some money. How much you make? Ten million dollars. Can you help me out? Yeah, let's meet up. I got a really fun job you can do. And it pays 10 million? Yeah, 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 come on. Oh, sweet. I got a really fun job I can do with Trevor. So, you said you got some work for me? A cargo plane crashed this morning. I think it was carrying a really nice supercar. You reckon you can get it for me? Yeah, sure. A cargo plane carrying a supercar? That sounds like my kind of thing. You just tell me where I landed and I'll get the car. This must be the plane that crashed. Which means somewhere on this plane is a car Trevor wants. Let's see if I can get it. But it doesn't look like I'm the only person here. That's someone else's truck. And there's people over there. Do you mind if I just take that thing? No, okay. They don't want me to take the car. Fair enough. It's a very nice and very expensive car. I gotta take them all out, guys. Oh, my days. There's so many of them. Okay, get around this. And use it as cover. And take out the rest of them. Hey, come on. Chill out. I just want the car. We can all be friends, right? Oh, my days. There's people in the bush. There's gotta be all of them. There has to be. Oh, no. He's still alive. Get him. Get him. Ah, nice. I'm with that job done. Let's see what we got. Oh, wait, there's still someone alive. Get him. Sorry, buddy, but I need to get this guy. Seriously? How are we still kicking, Franklin? That was crazy. All right, so this is the car Trevor wants. It looks really nice. I've never actually seen this one before. It's a Lamborghini. That's good to know. Lamborghinis are very expensive. It looks really fast. Whoa, it's got nine exhausts. Or is that... Are those the lights? They just look like exhausts. All right, this is a really nice car. I gotta jump in and get this thing back to D. He's gonna be so happy when he sees this. It hasn't got a name, so this is just a top secret Lamborghini. There's a glass sunroof. I love the vents on the back, and that engine looks amazing. And the inside's pretty good, too. I'm still not getting any ideas on what kind of car this is. It just says Lamborghini. And considering it was involved in the plane crash, it's 
actually looking pretty good. Barely any scratches, it still drives, and it feels good as new. Look how fast I'm going. Hey, once I move my house, we gotta go back to Trevor and get this car back. Oh, Trevor, guess who's back? Let me do one big drift. <laughs> I got the car you wanted. Now, I think you owe me uh, $10 million, right? Are you gonna come down, or are you just gonna hang up there? Oh, finally, he's coming down. Trevor, check it out. I got the car for you. It looks amazing. Love the enthusiasm. Love the enthusiasm. Now, I'm not gonna give you this car until you give me my money. Okay, a deal's a deal. Can I at least see it from the inside? Yeah, sure thing. Hey, what? Hey, that is so not cool, Trevor. Let me in. He locked the doors, too. Wow, this is a nice car. Hey, take your money. Seven million. No, we didn't agree on seven. Oh, uh, yes, we did. No, it was ten. You guys know it was ten, right? I'm not going crazy. It was definitely ten. Come on, Trevor, give me the rest. No can do. See ya. Don't you dare drive away from me. No, don't do it, Trevor. Come on, give it back. That's my car. I will. Oh, come on. No, come on. Give it back. I just got completely ripped off. You're not getting away with this, Trevor. Oh, no, you don't. Right, that's it. I'm hunting him down. There is no way he's gonna rip me off like that. What does Michael want? Fine. Mike, what's up? You're going down. Uh, Michael, is everything okay? I'm in a bit of a situation right now. Meet me at the golf course now. The golf course? What? Um, he wants to play a game of golf. All right. Well, if we can make a deal out of this game, then maybe we can still make the 50 million. So what exactly are we playing for? If I win, I get your house. If you win, you get mine. Ooh, I like the sound of that. Michael lives in a pretty good house, too. I love how even though he loses every single time. Like, we played a lot recently, buddy. And you keep losing. You keep on calling me to play more games. I could end it right here. I could take him down right now. But I'm not gonna do that. I'm a good sportsman. We're gonna win. Increase that strength. Send it down there. And with the wind blowing to the right. That ain't a bad sh shot. Get away from the path. Okay, that is a bad shot. I thought the wind was pushing even further right. And I think... No, Michael is ahead of me. He's in a way better position. We might have just screwed this up. I need a miracle to win this. What if I try and cut the tree under? Yeah, okay, that might just work. If I try and cut the tree under, we could probably get a decent swing out of this. Nice, under the tree, and we're on the fairway. Oh, what a recovery. Stress over. All right, let's see how what you do with this. Go further than me, that's for sure. But he's not on the green. We can still win this. I am actually sweating a little bit. I, I don't want to go through this entire video knowing I've wasted everything because I tried to play a game of golf against Michael. Surely there would have been other ways to make $3 million. Where is it? Have I gone past my ball? Oh, it's right over here. Right in the middle, too. All right, if I get this on the green, everything's going to be fine. The wind's pushing back and to the right. I don't to do it. Practice swing, of course. Got to get one of those in. And bam! Oh, <laughs> couldn't be better than that. Get it on the green. Get it on the green. We're on. Yes. All right, it could be a little bit closer. That could have been better, but we're okay. Let's see what he does. He's further than me. We're in a better position to win if we turn this around. That's one little hit in the sky and a wasted shot from Mike. No pressure. No pressure. It goes nothing. If I get a little bit more power, I should go in. Oh! Oh, I thought it was gonna miss. Buddy, let's go. i like to see you try and do that. That's right. You can't. You got it on par. You owe me one house, Michael. I can't believe I got that in. That was such a good shot. Now, come on. Cough up. Give me the keys. Thanks. Now, I never want to see your face again. It is officially for sale. How much are we gonna get for this? Yo, Michael, you made a terrible decision playing that game of golf, buddy. You're gonna lose your house. It's been years since I sold this place, so it's gonna be worth more, right? Hey, I've already got a call. Hello, I would like to buy this house. Well, my friend, you have a deal. You pay the money, I'll give you the house. And just like that, we, we were. Eh, what? 2.9 million. I thought it was worth more than that, Michael. Think about your prime location in Los Santos. 2.9? What do we do now? Hey, can I sell your cars, Michael? I would love to do that. I suppose we have some cars we could sell. I could try and take the one from Trevor. I know that's expensive. Or... You could like the video. That gives me money too. You know what? That's a way easier solution. Can you like the video? And if you do, Franklin's gonna get a little bit of money. Whoa, $10,000. That's a lot of money for one like. All right, we just need 10 more. Oh my days. Okay, you guys went crazy. I just made more than a million. All right, thanks for liking the video anyway. Let's go move my house. So, thanks for waiting for me. I got you 50 million. I hope you're happy. Yes, sir, we are. All right, boys, let's get to work. Are you ready to see my brand new house? It's been moved. 
move to the beach. <laughs> this is the best place I gotta put it, let's be honest. I got a hot dog stand right outside. I can look at the pier and the fairground, ride the roller goes whenever I want to, and I'm looking directly onto the sea from behind. But let me show you guys inside, because yes, we can go inside this place. Even Shop's got his kennel. I kept a swimming pool, because that's basically the best part about this house. Jacuzzi's still here. That's where Shop's gonna sleep. And check it out, guys. My bedroom is right down here. Uh, we gotta get some curtains in here, Franklin. That, <laughs> that's quite the view. I mean... <laughs> Yeah, we're gonna have to buy part of this beach or something to stop people sunbathing right outside. But everything's here. We got a few boxes because we have moved the entire place. But now we've moved the house, the police won't be able to find me again. Which is exactly what we needed after this morning. I mean, this morning was so crazy. I still can't believe I can just see the beach from here. This is the strangest view ever. I am not used to it. We may never see Franklin or Chop again. The other day, they moved their house from Vinewood to the beach. Life was good. They threw parties, watched my videos, but then suddenly they disappeared. I searched everywhere for them. Friends, families, places they usually go to, but they weren't there. But that's when I turned on the radio and heard this. Sea monster alert! Stay away from the ocean! I stopped searching and went straight to the coast. I had to check it out myself, and that's when I realized Franklin and Chop weren't missing at all. They were, in fact, the sea monsters. Okay, team, fire it well. Oh, God. Wrong well! What are you doing? Oh, man, these guys are useless. You're meant to be firing at the sea monsters, not literally Will. <laughs> Alright, at this rate, the military are gonna do a terrible job, but not to worry, because we're here. And you guys are not taking over this world. You might have done it already, but I can't believe they're actually sea monsters. Whoa! Chop is massive. Get out of here! Uh oh I'm not getting too close. That's so loud! <laughs> you guys can deal with it. <laughs> I'm gonna hide behind this car. Hey, where did they go? Wait a minute, did they disappear? Huh? Oh man, where did they go? We lost them, boys. I want every one of you to search the ocean. Find those monsters and bring them back to me. First, I gotta get some scuba gear. And this place, Sharky's Bites, has the best gear in town. What did I say? You look great, Mike. <laughs> and for a nice hundred dollars, we can finally go out and find Franklin and Chubb. I even got some flippers, too, because why not? I love flippers. And we can swim super duper fast. Now, somewhere in the ocean is Franklin and Chubb swimming around. I actually can't believe they're sea monsters. Wait a minute, that boat's sinking. What's going on? Is that Franklin? Franklin and Chop? I don't see them, but that never happens. They gotta be over there. Come on, Michael. We haven't got much time. I think I found them. I gotta get to them before anyone else does. I don't know what they're gonna do, but it won't be good. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, it's still there. It's still there. They haven't eaten the whole thing yet. <laughs> okay. All right, Michael. We're almost there. Just be very careful. I do not want to end up in their bellies either. Okay. I'm keeping my distance for now. It could be right under us. Right, I'm gonna very slowly get out and just check out under the water right now. Oh, they're not there. Okay, so they're not there. And they're not behind us either. Did we scare them away or something? How did that boat start sinking? I mean, there's gotta be sea monsters, right? There's no way that boat just randomly began sinking. Like, that doesn't usually happen. I've never seen that happen. Maybe it did. Maybe it's the first time for everything. Okay, so I don't actually know where they are, but they're not over there and they're not over here. They could be anywhere in the ocean. We better keep searching, because I I don't think they've gone far. Maybe the yacht. You know, if I was a sea monster, I would go near there for anything like food, fish, or even to destroy the yacht just for fun. <laughs> and I know Franklin and Chop, they do a lot of things for fun. It's pretty choppy around here too. That's a telltale sign that there's sea monsters around. I guess we gotta find out ourselves. Hello, is there anyone down here? I don't see anyone. Looks pretty clear to me. Hello, is there anyone around? What about underneath me? This is freaky. I'm just swimming around knowing there's two sea Sea monsters about one of them is a dog. Looks clear to me. I don't see any sea monsters. Hey, Franklin, it's me, Michael. Where'd you go, man? You kind of gone that far. You're at the beach a minute ago. <laughs> came from over there. That sounded like Chop. Can sea monsters worth now? This is freaky. <laughs> Chop is suddenly a sea monster and he can woof in the water. Okay. <laughs> this is 
so crazy. All right, I'm following the wolf. Let's see where that takes us to. I honestly think I can talk him down. I mean, we got history. Uh, we've had drinks together. We've had barbecues together. We're friends with each other's families. Michael's even looked after Jop on many nights of the year, including the time he was a puppy. <laughs> I mean, come on. There's no way they'll eat me alive. Well, this isn't scary at all. I can't see a thing. I'm really deep underwater, and I still haven't found Chuck or Franklin. Oh, man. I'm seeing things right now. We've been underwater for way too long. Hello? I just want to say hello. I got some money. I owe you Franklin. I, you want money, right? You like money. <laughs> Franklin? Hello, guys. Oh, brilliant. Okay, we found the ocean floor again. Suddenly, I'm not so nervous. I can actually see things again. Hold on a minute. You guys seeing what I'm seeing? I think I found like an underwater base. This is definitely new. I don't recognize this. It's like an actual cave. This is the floor. Oh my days. This is crazy. How long has this cave been here for? Is anyone behind me? I gotta check this out. This is huge. I have found an underwater cave. Can you believe it? Oh, this is insane. Guys, I found a secret part of the ocean. <laughs> did they do this? There's no way they did this. They're not intelligent enough to build anything like this. <laughs> this is the weirdest day ever. There's no way the police would find this. Yo, that's crazy. What am I even looking at? Is that the sun? Okay, I'm coming up to the top. Almost there. Finally, I get to leave the ocean and check out what's up here. Oh, it's like a secret cave. I gotta get on it. I need to check this out. Guys, I found a massive skeleton. You won't believe. Whoa, Chop? Franklin? I don't think they're okay. This is literally like half the size of Michael, and that's just one vertebrae. Okay, we're in some serious trouble right now. I don't know what they're gonna do, but these guys seem pretty hungry, that's for sure. There's gotta be a whale, right? Well, at least it's not a person, so we should know we're safe, right, Michael? <laughs> And it came from down there. I don't think I want to go down there anymore. <laughs> Maybe I'll just stay. Oh, my day, Franklin. Franklin, I, I really uh, didn't mean to come in here, buddy. Hey, listen, it's just me, Michael. Okay, can't we just talk about this? I don't think he wants to talk. I I'm getting out of here. See you later, Franklin. <laughs> yeah, lovely, lovely meeting you, buddy. They do not want to talk. That means we got to take him out. I swim, Michael, swim. Oh, my days. I'm being chased by him. Is he still there? Oh, my days. He's still there, and he's not giving up. Quick, get out of here, Michael. Get out of here. We'll stay close to the walls. All right, that's probably a good idea. Yeah, stay close to the walls. We'll go through here. Just stay away from the really angry sea monster. Oh, it's huge. Franklin, please don't do this. I thought we were friends. And stay, stay between this as well. There's no way you can eat me through here. I gotta get to the surface. I gotta get to the surface. Oh, yes. A boat. Guys, you gotta save me. You gotta save me. Get on the boat. Get on the boat. Get on the boat. <sighs> Man, am I glad to see you guys. You gotta let me on. There's a sea monster down there. Take him out. Thanks. Oof, you really saved me there. All right, come on. We gotta get this thing back to shore. You have no idea what you're dealing with. Guys, guys, he's right in front of us. He's right in front of us. Yo, back up, back up, back up. I gotta get out of here. I gotta get out of here. Uh -oh. Oh, it just broke down. Why is it breaking down? Oh, no. Look, look. Why are you going to break down on me now? You're reasonable people. I know you, frankly. Come on. How long have we known each other? Oh, my days. Chop's here as well. Guys, do something. I'm trying. My friend's out of ammo. We're, we're trying harder. Come on. Take him down. This has got to be a way out of here. There's got to be... There is. Hey, down here. I'm coming down. Get ready to jump. Just a little bit closer. A little bit closer. Well, I actually can't believe we got out of that situation. To think we were down there. I got the feeling Franklin and Chop don't exactly want to negotiate. Yeah, I really don't think they do. They didn't even escape. I'm sorry, guys. I really am. Oh, man. How did they do that? Unit 7, do you copy? I repeat, do you copy? Sergeant, Unit 7 didn't make it. Look behind you. No! How? How did this happen? It was the sea monsters, Sergeant. Franklin and Chop, they're not willing to talk it out. They took him down and I was on that boat with them too. I can't believe it's still exploding. Men, this has suddenly become a dangerous mission. I need everyone to listen very carefully. Where'd everyone go, guys? Where'd they go? I don't think they're gonna wanna be part of this, boss. You saw what happened to that boat? I mean, they got annihilated. Listen, if you want them dealt with, then I think I know what to do. I've dealt with enough sea monsters in my time, but I charge a little bit of money. I got a price. Ugh, how much? Twenty-five million dollars. You pay me that money, and I'll make sure those monsters don't see tomorrow. Fine, you got a deal. Wow, that was super duper easy. We just got twenty-five million bucks. <laughs> All right, buddy, I'll get to work. We have a vehicle which might help. 
Take the keys. Thanks. Are you sure these are car keys? They look a bit old school to me. Trust me, you're gonna want this. Since nobody else is willing to deal with these monsters, they're giving me everything they have, including a vehicle which is apparently gonna really help us. Let's see what it is. Ah, uh, you didn't tell me I was getting something from NASA. Whoa. <laughs> have you seen the size of that? Once that's launched at Franklin and Chop, there's no tomorrow for them. Trust me. Anyway, let's check this out. I wonder if it's pretty fast. If it's made by NASA, it's gotta be, right? I mean, this looks like a machine. All right, the engines are spinning. What's the checks like on the inside? Everything looks good to me. Oh my days, I'm already locking onto something. Wait, that's the sea monsters. I'm already locking onto them. <laughs> come in, come in. Uh, wait, they're talking to me. Uh, yes? When you locate the sea monster, release your flares. I think I found them. Double check for me. We got a surprise. Okay. All right, I'll go check this out. Seems like we gotta make sure that's definitely the sea monster. He's gonna help me out with another surprise. Does he even need me to do this? Was this the easiest $25 million Michael ever made? All right, we're looking out for some sea monsters. It's gonna be hard to see them in all of this smoke. What does it look like down there? Okay, okay. I don't see any of them. Looks pretty clear to me. I didn't see any on that flyover. I need to wait for the fire to go out first. Coming in for another flyover. The fire's gone out, and this time I'm locking onto a few things in the ocean. Anything? I still don't see anything. This place might be clear. I'm gonna try this one more time and go a little bit lower. I gotta rule out this place before we go searching. You know, there's a lot of ocean to explore. Oh my days. Wait, I saw them. I saw them. I saw them. They're down there. They're right down there. They almost tried and took me out. Sergeant, I found them. They're both in the boat still. Excellent. Release those flares. You got it, flag gun. Okay, right. Let's put it right over the spot. <laughs> What's gonna happen when I do this? They're gonna be annihilated. I just know it. All right, three, two, one. Fire the flares out. There we go. <laughs> and now we wait. What's gonna happen now? Oh my days. They called in an airstrike. No way. <laughs> I'd like to see you survive that, guys. Good luck. Whoa. So many explosions just happened. What do you see, Michael? I'm gonna check it out right now. I'm doing a flyover. I see the boats. It's destroyed, all right. I didn't see any sea monsters, though. That was a very close flight over too. What do you mean? Are they not floating? No, they're not. I, I think they did a dunk. Man, you know what that means. They gotta be in the ocean. They didn't get taken out with the airstrike. And now they know we're doing this? Let me see if they're gonna pop their heads out. I mean, I did get lock on on a few of them. So if we're lucky, we can try and do the same. Tilt that over. No, I'm not getting any lock on. This is... I think they've gone. They've disappeared. What do we do now, Commander? I don't see them anywhere. I'm giving you a boat. We need eyes in the water. A boat? Okay. All right, I'll take the boat. Whatever you want to give me. Whoa. Hey, man, this is a crazy boat. You sure you want to give this to me? <laughs> All right, wherever they are, they're so going down. Hey, man, that's my boat. It's too late now. He's falling off the jet ski. All right, well... <laughs> That's going to cause a bit of a crunch when I start the thing up. Huh? Who's that? Lester. Out of all the people, what do you want? Take this. Huh? Hey, let me test this thing out. What am I supposed... These are darts. What am I going to do with this? Use them on Franklin and Chop. Why? Why would I do that? They're sea monsters. I I've literally... We've done everything to them and they're still alive. Trust me. It'll turn them back to normal. Oh, really? Huh? We can... What if, what if I use this on you? Not me. Come on. <laughs> Sorry, Lester. <laughs> Are we gonna get a Lester sea monster now? I just needed to test this out. All right, so Lester's giving me this dart thing. He's still still shaking. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna walk away. I'm gonna use it on those guys. <laughs> that was the weirdest thing ever. But check it out. I have this secret tranquilizer thing, which apparently is gonna turn them back to normal. I kind of gotta test this out and see if it works. I mean, that would be kind of cool, right? Being able to play as Franklin again. But first, we gotta find them, which is gonna be half the challenge. They could be anywhere in the the ocean right now. They left the boat alone and they don't trust us anymore. Now we started firing, you know, things into the ocean. So where could they be? Hello? Guys, come on, I just want a little talk. Any luck? No luck, Commander. I, I've been searching the ocean for a while and I haven't found them. Are you using your sonar? Oh, wait. I, I have sonar. Oh, that makes it so much easier. I can hear things under the ocean now. Okay, so every single time it beeps, it means we're over the ocean bed. But if it gets faster, it means something's underneath us. All right, we just got to listen out for when it gets faster. And right now, it's not exactly changing too much. Just the same old, same old, same... 
Oh, wait a minute. It's getting faster. It's getting faster, guys. Something is right underneath me. It's literally underneath me. I want to check this out through some observing, and maybe we might have just actually found the monsters again. There he is. I found him. Chop, I I'm taking you down. Oh, no, I missed him. I missed him. A quick go for his nose. <laughs> Did I get him? Oh, no, I don't think I got him again. Come on. What is this supposed to do? It's tiny. I right, don't screw this up. Don't screw this up. Stop wagging the head of yours, Chop. I know you're hungry. <laughs> One, bam! Oh, I, I got him! I got him! I got him! <laughs> wow, I can't believe one of these darts actually put him to sleep. Oh! Franklin, where does he go? Hey, listen, Chop's gonna be okay, all right? According to Lester, he's gonna turn back to normal again. There you are, I got you now. Who doesn't like normal, eh? Come on, take him down, Mike. Take him down. Oh, right in the head. Come on. One, boom, gotcha, there we go, both of them fast asleep, wow, Lester actually did something useful for once, I just gotta find a way to get this boat working again, maybe if we just jump on this side we can get it back down to normal, ah, there we go, did it, <laughs> alright, let's tie the ropes to them, and wait a minute, is that, no, that's not Franklin, you, guys, I don't know what to say, it worked, what do you mean you don't remember anything? You don't remember being a sea monster and, like, destroying a boat and me flying over. You built an entire house underground in the water, Franklin. What's the last thing you do remember? Ah, oh, watching one of my videos. You know what? That's great because we're actually trying to get to 7 million subscribers and you can help us get there by subscribing right now. Ugh, ugh, I had the craziest nightmare. I was a sea monster, and so was Chop. We were swimming around the sea, eating things, taking down boats. Man, that was a crazy dream. Who's at my door? Hey, why are you knocking so loudly? Come on! I moved my house for a reason. I literally built this on the edge of the beach. If you missed that episode, you gotta go check it out. I'm coming! What is- oh my days. Hey, uh, officers, what are you doing? You're going to jail! Uh, no, I'm not. No, no, go quick, run, 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 run. Why are the police officers in my house? Get him! No, 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 don't you dare. Oh my days. Wait a second. There's cars outside. There's so many of them. I gotta get out of here. Chop, come on, we gotta go. He's getting away. No, I'm not. I'm just trying to escape. <laughs> Uh, technically, I'm not getting away if you're already chasing me, right? Uh, Chop, we're gonna have to take this vehicle because mine is currently blocked by a bunch of police officers. Drive, drive, drive. Get out of here, dude. Get out of here. There is no way we were a sea monster. I don't want to believe it. How did that even happen? I mean, me, Franklin, and Chop, a sea monster. Oh, my days. They're shooting the windows out. Hey, come on. Chill out. The FIB are around as well. Is there anywhere safe we can go to? I got five stars. And how many people are chasing me? Oh, my days. That's a lot of people chasing me. Yo, chill out, guys. Come on. I didn't realize we we were a sea monster. Guys, can you press like on this video right now if we were actually a sea monster? Oh, and before I forget, if you subscribe, something really weird is gonna happen to the video. Please do it now, because I really hope it's us teleporting away from the police. Well, we didn't teleport, but did you subscribe? Oh my days, this is weird. This is really thick. Come on. <laughs> Knock it off. Don't worry, Chop. We're gonna be just fine. I'm a professional driver. I know my stuff. Go down into the underground, and we'll leave him through there. Yeah, that's a great idea. That's a really good idea. Oh, watch out. Oh, I didn't see the bollards. Uh-oh, that's no good. We gotta get out the car. Come on, get out. Man, my legs. Come on, Franklin. Stand up. Stand. Oh, no, it's no use, guys. I'm sorry for whatever I did. Ow, come on. Great. Now I'm in prison. I tried so hard to escape them, but they had like 20 police cars chasing me. What do we do now? My sentence is 114 years. I gotta find a way out. There has to be something we can use, like a ladder or a car or anything. Maybe this guy knows a few things. Hey, buddy. He's not talking to me. All right, great. Anyone else? Well, there's some people over there. All right, let's see if they can help me. This place is empty. I mean, where did all the prisoners go? There's like no one else on the yard. Wait a minute. What's going on? on. That... That's Chop. Chop. Oh my days, I'm so glad to see you. You're in prison as well? Hey, guys, back off, all right? That's my dog. You got a problem with him? You gotta go through me first. And believe me, you don't want that to happen, all right? I'm ready. I'll take you down. Whoa. <laughs> hey, listen. Did I say I would take you down? I actually meant I would, um, uh... Do, do, do anything to, to stop making you mad at me. Have you seen what they've got? Your dog bit one of my men. What you gonna do about it? Well, first of all, I'm gonna apologize. I'm really sorry about what Chop did, okay? Uh, I, 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 listen, you can get a bit crazy sometimes, and this is new. Not good enough. 
You've got to do something for me. Okay, all right, I'll, I'll do it for you then. Just tell me what it is and I would love to be out of your air, mister. I don't want any trouble in here. I would like to survive. Bring me the keys to the prison car by the end of the day. What if I'm late? There's only a few hours left of the day. Not my problem. All right, fine. Really haven't got a choice. Are you just going to stand there? I mean, those guys are making demands from me and you just... You're not even doing your job, man. I mean, that's easy enough, right? I mean, it's just it's just getting some keys for a car. I mean, bearing in mind I'm in prison. I don't even know where to start or begin, but I'll give it a go. I'll give anything a shot. Right, the garage is uh right over here. Oh my days, there's two people right there. Have you got the keys for the car? Yep, they're in my pocket. Why? No reason. I just wanted to know. He's got the keys. That's all I needed to hear. All right, let's take him down. I'm so sorry about this, guys, but I need the keys. Get him down. <laughs> Ooh, and he dropped this as well. Perfect. Okay, no one alerted anyone. Now, where are the keys? This guy had them in his pockets. Oh, got them. I wonder what the car even is. Hey, let's go and take a look quickly. Oh, my days. That's a beast. <laughs> I would love to take that right now, but they got chopped. And if I don't save him, then we might lose him forever. Jeez, maybe we can figure out a plan to get them back. Anyway, I gotta leave the scene as fast as I can. I was not there. I can trust you guys. You're on my side, right? Yeah, of course you are. Please don't tell anyone. I don't want to get into any more trouble. Hey, let's shave his fur off. No, don't do that. That's so mean. I don't want... The shop's had that fur his entire life, right? He's never gonna recover from that. I got your key, okay? Here you go. Take it and give me my dog back. That's not gonna do. What do you mean that's not gonna do? Am I gonna have to get my good old fist out and put this to rest? I mean, I know you guys are scary, but I reckon I can figure this out. Now I've got this, of course. <laughs> no, you're good. Thanks. Fair enough. See you guys later. Well, that's the end of that. I have no idea who those guys were, but they were really mean. I'm glad to have you back, though, boy. And next time you want to cause some trouble, don't do it without me. All right, if we're going to be fine if we stick together. Cold Red! Cold Red! Cold Red? What's going on? Come on, let's get out of here. Go, 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 go! So long, suckers! <laughs> oh no, they escaped! And the guards are freaking out! I don't think you'll catch them, guys. It was a pretty nice car. Whew. Well, at least they're out of this prison and we don't have to worry about them. Hey, Chop! Oh man, I tell you to stay with me and you've already disappeared. Where do you go, boy? Oh, this is so annoying. Why does he always walk away from me? Meet on the yard. Don't be late. Oh no, they want us on the yard as well. All right, that's it. I need to find him right now. Chop! Oh, what are you doing in there? Come on, get out! Ooh, at least I found him. Oh, tomatoes, of course. He must be really hungry. I do feed him quite well. <laughs> yeah. All right, come on, Chop. We're meeting on the yard. Something just went down. We're increasing prison security after some inmates escaped. What? You electrified the fences? I don't want to believe that. No way did you electrify the fences. Can I see them from here? Wait, what about this one? Did you electrify this one too? Find out yourself. Okay. Right, here goes nothing. <laughs> Did? Are you kidding me? That's not allowed, right? You can't put electric through your fences. Who are you going to tell? You're in prison. He's got a point. I don't think we can do anything about this, except somehow find a way to escape. Right. Is that it? Is that everything you wanted to tell us? Because right now I'm a little bit annoyed today. I, I just... I'm in prison for 114 years. You've now locked down every single staircase. I don't even think there's a way out anymore. Right, I'm going to my cell. At least we can share the same cell, Chop. Check it out. He's got his own bed. That's my bed. It could be worse. But they haven't given me a toilet or a sink or even a fridge or like anything to do with food. Hey, I I'm getting out of here. I want to see what else this prison is about. What's through there? The toilets, okay. And they look pretty clean. This is decent. And are these? Yep, showers. We've got a little bit of a coming from the ceiling. Wait a minute, can I see into the prison? Pretty sure I can. There is a crack in the ceiling. These are the worst toilets ever. I'm not going to that toilet. If I use a toilet, I'm using this one. Definitely not that one. What's the slime there for? Ugh, it's so gross. Hey, no, what are you doing? No, don't, don't drink the slime shop. Come on, get out of there, okay? I don't know if that's safe. Jeez. I gotta take him out of the toilets quickly. Oh, food at last. I'm starving. My stomach's been rumbling all day. Hey, what are you eating, buddy? I'll come back to you. I think he's sleeping or something. Okay, we got burgers. We got baguettes, paninis. Hey, that looks nice. Got some lettuce in that one, too. And a little pot of beans. Okay, right? This isn't too bad. At least we'll get to uh, eat nice things. Hello? Is there anyone here? I would like a bagel, a banana, an orange, and let me see. What have you got up here? I mean, the burgers look pretty good, but I, I want to go healthy. Can I get one of those baguettes? Hello? Is there anyone? Oh, fine. I'm, I'm just I'm gonna go and grab one myself. There is no one there. Hey, can you get out of the way, please? God, I just gotta grab myself some food. <laughs> yeah. Well, at least no one seemed to care that I went into the kitchen. That's good. Is there anything here I could use which might help me? <gasps> 
Escape? Yeah, all right. We might. Okay, we'll take one of those. We just won't tell anyone about that. But this is good. I got one of these and I got one of those. Now, the only thing I got to do is grab myself a baguette. I got two of them. I got to get one for chop. You, you know how it is. I don't want him drinking toilet water all day. <sighs> get off the table, boy. I don't want to make any more enemies in this prison. Man, being in prison with chop is actually kind of stressful. He just does what he wants. At least this guy doesn't mind. He seems pretty chill. Chop, have you really got to scratch your fleas off whilst the meeting on the table as well? Ugh, I can hear them. Hey, come on. Chill out. G get on the floor, boy. No consideration for others. All right, I'm going to gobble this down and get back to my cell. But on the way, I'm going to look for a few places we can escape. Like what's in here? Hmm. Okay, that's just a concrete room. Anything else we might be missing out on? Training room. Oh, okay, we got some table tennis tables. Nothing in there. Mm -hmm. Anything in here? Another training room? Hello? Is there anyone? It's just a gym. All right, there's no way we're escaping that way. Authorized personnel only. Hello. Where does this go? I think I found the washing room. I have. Look at those. All of them are prison outfits. Vests, and trousers, police hats. Wait a minute. Police boots? Okay. All right, this is an interesting spot. Whoa, they're washing a lot of them, too. <laughs> what are they washing in this one? Oh, okay. Sorry for disturbing you, buddy. I'll just uh, get out of your way. What's upstairs? There's an upstairs to this place, and I gotta see everything, remember? Oh, watch out for that. Electric generators, more electric things. What if these are the reasons the fences are electric? I think they are. Okay, how do we switch this thing off? Let's see. Hello? Oh, no, no. Okay. Right, I don't think we're gonna touch that thing. That That is live. That is electric. What if I fire at the red things? Hey, turn around. Yes? Oh, no, it's an officer. Uh, listen, I didn't mean to be in here. You're not supposed to be here at all. Explain yourself. I was just wandering around. Someone chased me. I had to hide in this room. That's the story. What a load of rubbish. Come on, follow me. Oh, no, he's not believing it. You and your dog can make yourself useful. Clean the area. I want it spotless. Spotless? Oh, that's quite a big ask. Do it, or I double your sentence. You, you what? You can't do that. Double my sentence? All right, Franklin, we better get sweeping because this guy is really, really angry. Can you believe it? Downgraded to this? After everything? I moved my house. We got a new bike. We've done crazy stuff for you. And now I'm sweeping the prison yard because we were sea monsters in a nightmare I don't even remember. Where are you going to anyway? Chops up to something. What are you doing? What are you doing, boy? Wait a minute. That's a vent. Are you trying to go through the vents? Oh, you're a clever dog. I think he's found something. I can hear him barking. Yo, 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 one second, boy, one second. Let me just come over there and see what you're doing. Oh, my days. All right, Franklin, you just you, you chill out in the yard, okay? I don't, I don't want anyone raising any eyebrows. You keep sweeping. I'm just going to quickly play his job. So, how do we get you open, then? What if we use your teeth? Ah. Whoa, check it out. I'm inside the vents. <laughs> This is such a tight squeeze. There's no way Franklin would get through this. I'm in the vents of the entire prison. Where do they go to? Yes, we're gonna find out because Chop has been in here for a while and we have gone pretty far down. <laughs> I must be inside the blocks by now or something. Wait a minute, guys. I think I can see something. Quick, check it out, check it out. There is. Guys, I found a vent. So this is what they connect to. I wonder what's down there. Oh, wait a minute. Am I? Have we just escaped? Are you kidding me? I have escaped the prison. Well, there's no point going back in there. If I go in, we could both be stuck. And that's worse than one of us being stuck. Come on, let's see if we can find some help. Yes, this is just the person I need to find. Trevor, and he's got a helicopter. Uh, listen, Trevor, Franklin's in trouble and he needs your help. Well, let's get him. Wait, how does Trevor understand what I'm saying? I'm a dog. Well, that was easy. He didn't even need convincing. All right, Franklin, it's time to rescue you, buddy. He's gonna be so happy when he finds out Chop organized all of this. <laughs> right, where is he? I presume he's still sweeping. I mean, I know it's like the end of the day, but this guy wanted to see the entire yard tidy. In fact, I wonder how much he did tidy the yard. Oh, wait, there he is. I can see him. He's still there. Franklin, we're coming to get you. All right, land the helicopter. Come on, T. Land it. Land it. He'll know what to do. Oh, my days, I'm in. Seriously, Franklin, you didn't even clean it up? Wow. Wow, he's terrible at doing these kind of jobs. <laughs> but let's get in the helicopter. I'm going. Nice. All right, we're getting out of here. Now, <laughs> they haven't even seen us. This is amazing. I thought you guys built a fortress. Where are you now? Oh, that's where you guys are. You're, you're five stars. Oh, brilliant. Okay. So, <laughs> turns out escaping prison really does get you a five-star wanted level. But I'm telling you one thing, Trevor. These guys are not going back again. Franklin and...
and Jop had a 114 year sentence. Come on, get us away from the police. We are not getting caught. Not today. Is anyone in the sky? Oh, wait, I think we have lost them. We there's no one around us. We got out of there just in time. I can't see helicopters or cars or anyone. <laughs> I think we're gonna be just fine. In fact, we are. Trevor, you are a legend. Take these. My clothes. Man, I'm so happy to get rid of the orange jumpsuit. Thanks, Trevor. You really came in clutch. I'm not done yet. This house, it's yours. Wait, this one over here? How do you know it's mine? Nobody lives there. Hasn't for two years. Oh, really? Okay, well, thanks, man. I, I guess we can't exactly go home. Now the police know where I live. All right, well, this isn't too bad. Ain't that right, boy? Let's take a look around this place. Does the garage? Yes, it does. It opens. And I got a car in there. Nice. Okay. Check it out. They left their car behind. What kind of people do that? So this is where we're going to be living. 6085 Vinewood Hills. You know what? This is actually a little bit of an upgrade. I like this. I know we've done a lot of crazy things. From upgrading our house, to moving our house, to, hey, even getting some of the best vehicles in the game. But to be out of prison, to not be wanted, to still be with Chop again, things aren't that bad. What do you think, Chop? Do you like it too? Oh, I love it. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, guys, this has been a blast, and what a crazy adventure it's been. If you want me to have an adventure with any other characters in this game, let me know in the comments, and don't forget to subscribe. It will literally make my day. But thanks for watching. My name is Noah, and from me, Frank, and Chop, I will see you guys next time.